Hi everybody, good afternoon. That's a little sneaky peek as to what we've got coming up this afternoon for the first couple of hours. Really, really exciting day for us. We've got a brand new launch. Romeo is here, Caesar are here for the very first time on Hobby Maker. That's gonna be our first couple of hours. It's an unbelievable cutting machine that's gonna blow you away, I know it will. So that's what's coming up soon. Uh, just a quick heads up about what's coming up at three o'clock this afternoon. Lovely Bex is back with us. It's the 15th birthday celebrations continuing of Hunky Dory and we're gonna announce the winners of the the uh, two goodie, goodie bags that we're going to give away, uh, people that shop with us yesterday, we'll be doing that at three o'clock this afternoon. So a lot to squeeze in between now and five, but we go right the way through, of course, to eight o'clock uh, with lots more great shows with Xena a bit later on as well. Now, if you want to shop with us today, if you've never ever shopped with us before, the easiest way to get in touch is via the free phone phone number to our call center, or you can go via our website, which is hobbymaker.co.uk. Either way, you can order that way on the web or on the free phone number and talk to our call center as well. So it's entirely up to you. How are you order but the most important thing is that you do order now okay you saw that little clip a few minutes ago about uh, the Romeo cutting machine from Caesar now Caesar is an Italian brand um, they make the most incredible iron-on vinyl that's often used in uh, high-end fashion uh, chains also in the sporting world football clubs use it for their numbers and names on the back of shirts that sort of thing so the quality of that is absolutely incredible and the quality of the machine that you're gonna be using to do your cutting is off the charts this is the widest cutting machine we have ever seen on the channel. This is a 20 inch mouth you're talking about here. That's a big mouth, which means you can do much bigger, wider and longer projects as well, whether it's on fabric or whether it's cutting cardstock, whatever it might be. Let me introduce you to my guest who's with me for the first couple of hours. Rudy's here from Caesar. Hi, mate. Hey, Dave, how are you? Good to see you. It's pleasure Good being you. here. Now, um, I way, thought great it was- Great introduction. Thank you very much. I think Thank you can much. sell the machine by yourself. Thank you very much. <laughs> um, I thought it was Sizer, but it's actually called Caesar. It's Caesar actually yes yeah. so obviously it's an Italian brand yeah so it's the C sir also like the Caesar salad okay so yeah that's <laughs> actually, it's, to remember. It's funny enough is how I usually start my presentations when I do these lives right so because I think it's very important I know we get a lot of different sisters Sizer but just to set the, the record straight, it is Caesar. <laughs> okay, now the most important thing is that the, we do a lot of great cutting machines here at Hobby Maker, but this one is in a league of its own. Firstly, the size of it, but also the pedigree of the brand as well is really impressive. Absolutely. Absolutely, so there's several things we wanted to go with with the machine. Obviously, ease of use is the first one right away that we wanted to really, really focus on. We wanted to have a machine that was powerful, obviously a size that allows our users to grow whether you're a beginner or a small business owner mm -hmm. or you're looking to expand, all right? So we wanted a machine that was gonna be impactful in the market, but also that had all the great tools at an affordable price. Sure. So it's very fast, quiet to cut, and it has an incredible ability to do your print and then cut solution. Okay, now we're gonna be going into this in a lot of detail, that's why we've got a two hour show this afternoon. Now obviously, if you wanna ask any questions, if you've got any queries or anything at all, uh, Rudy is our expert, you can get in touch via our website, just where it says contact the studio, or you can send an email if you want to, uh, to us as well. Either way, get involved in the show. We're gonna talk you through how the machine works, how it will work in your environment, in your home, or if you are, like Rudy said, thinking of having a small business with it or whatever. We've got lots of different vinyls, and as I said to you before, well, the vinyls can be used obviously in this machine, but they can also be used in other machines as well. And the quality of the vinyl is right up there. So it may be that you want to decorate t-shirts, bags for life. It may be that you want to do um, harder surfaces, that sort of thing. It doesn't have to be fabric all the time, does it? No, absolutely not. We have a lot of different uh, items here that we can demonstrate throughout the day. Um, also back here, we have some different products that we've applied to different surfaces, which I think it's it really shows the, the, the versatility of the product. Sure. So yes, it's a heat transfer material. With that said, you know, and, and most of these ideas actually come from you guys, from the users that just get very, very creative. Now the thing is, where else do you get a whole two hour dedicated show uh, where we're, we're gonna be demonstrating the machine, showing you how brilliant it is, how user friendly it is, and the potential of it is absolutely massive and huge from a domestic point of view and also maybe from a small business point of view too. Now you can find this machine elsewhere in the country. We're not saying it's exclusive to us. What we can say is our price is going to be 50 pounds less than elsewhere. Also, we're going to have it on not four split pays. We're pushing the boat out even more and giving you five split pays on this. So you can get it home for just over 160 odd pounds today, plus your PMP of 395, and you can put this machine to the test. Think of it, a 20 inch width. What does that now mean that you can decorate? 
that you can add decor to for home decor, that sort of thing, furniture upcycling, anything like that at all, or maybe making banners or signs, that sort of thing. With us today, it is £799. Now, I know that is a considered purchase. Now, if you were to buy it anywhere else, would they offer you split pay? I don't think so. I don't know, but I don't think so. We offer you, as a matter of course, interest-free. It's something we do as a company. It's not gone through a finance house or anything like that. There's no credit checks or anything like that. It's basically $159.80 today on your debit and credit card, plus your PMP, and this beauty will be on its way to you. Next payment automatically comes off your card in four weeks, eight weeks, 12 weeks, and in 16 weeks. NW 9G80, I think that is. NW 9G80 is the product code if you'd like to order this today. If you've been watching this or looking at this somewhere else, you've seen it maybe on a website somewhere and you're thinking, I just want to see how it works. I just want to see it in action. These are the shows for you. But I've got to let you know, we don't have anywhere near as much stock as we would have liked to have got hold of. These do not get mass produced in their tens, you know, in their thousands. We've got a few. So if you want to get yours, all you've got to do is put it in your basket and check out with that first split payment today. That means the one is on its way to you straight away okay if you leave it till later in the show we may not be able to have any of the machines left okay really um that's the kind of housework done oh, that was great what do you want to talk to us about first of all what do you want to show us yeah so i think we can first start with the, demo, the, the presentation of the machine right um uh, so it is a 24 inch machine it, and it will give you the ability to cut all 24 inches so you need most machines will limit you to 22 21 and a half with this particular machine you get to cut the full 24 inches. Right. One of the nice um, options, of course, is those that are doing signage. So one of the big concerns was how can we do uh, lettering for walls? And notice I'm talking about other products as well because yeah. I think the, the versatility of the machine is really what makes it unique. So it's not just limited to our products. You can use so many other types of products and materials with the machine. And equally, the vinyls from Caesar as well can also be used on other cutting machines Absolutely. too. So you can, if you've got another cutting machine, mm -hmm. use their vinyls in your machine and you can use other products in the, the, uh, the Caesar machine as well. Absolutely. Absolutely. So right off, um, I don't know if we can show the box, but you can see it comes in a very beautiful packaging. Now, the, the name Romeo uh, comes from the the story, the, the story, and Julia. absolutely. Yeah. So we are, so Caesar is actually, the headquarters of Caesar is located in a city called Vicenza in, in Italy. And Vicenza is actually where the storyline takes place. The, the actual castle of Julieta and Romeo are actually in a city called Montecchio, mm -hmm. which is right there. It's part of the region of, of uh, Vicenza. So that's it's a where gorgeous the- gorgeous place, I've been there myself. Fantastic. Gorgeous place, mm -hmm. and you're more than invited to uh, whenever you want to stop by. Cool. Have some nice pasta, and uh, uh, sounds good. if you like wine, oh, there's yeah. no better place for some <laughs> good wine. Oh, I'm there, I'm there. <laughs> so, it's, um, so that's where the, the, the name and the, the, the theme of the, the machine um, kind of came about. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we know Leonardo da Vinci was an amazing, amazing uh, philanthropist, uh, scientist, artist. So you can see the box has a lot of that influence directly on it, and we wanted to keep that theme with the machine. So it's a beautiful layout, a beautiful um, static machine. You can see the, the, the layout is very simple, very unique. Very stylish. It is very stylish. There's no other machine out there that has this particular frame. Okay. All right. Now, as far as cutting's concerned, mm -hmm. does this have certain designs built into it, or how do you actually get it to cut what you want to cut? Absolutely, that's a great question, actually. So we do, the machine will come with the software. Uh, right now, the, there's a free version, and we will be launching a pro version in the near future. The free version comes with over 3,000 designs. Oh, wow. Not only that, but it is the software that allows you to actually create your own design. So there's a lot of features on there that will help you get started. So if you want to do someone's name and it's spelled in an unusual way, you can do that. Absolutely, like right. my name. Right. <laughs> it's not just actually Rudy, but. <laughs> so the nice thing also is that there is a section in the software that you will see tutorials. You click on that tab and you will have videos that will actually help you get started. Ah, oh, terrific. Unboxing the machine, plugging the machine in, starting the software, registering the machine, which is also very important. So there's a lot of education behind it as well. I, I do love the fact that you, I asked you this earlier on, that if you're planning to buy this maybe as a small business, sometimes you find that guarantees are kind of null and void, mm -hmm. um, but you, know, you only get the guarantee if it's for domestic use. This, you get that two year guarantee, whether it's for domestic or for business use, no trouble. Absolutely, and actually another really key element is the, the, the support. Mm. Caesar itself actually supports all the machines that um, that come through. So every machine that is sold, we are supporting on our end as well. Terrific. So there is Romeo.support at Caesar.it, and we can actually help you 
um, with the support side. If you have any questions, whether it's registration, issues with the machine, hopefully not, but uh, we are there to help you guys uh, throughout the process. So basically, so that we know exactly what we need at home for this to work for us, you need to have a computer of some sort. A computer, yes, but not only a computer. Because Tablet? Tablet as of right now, depending on the tablet, of course. If you have a Windows tablet, yes. We do not have an application yet for the, for the cutter. And the reason is we are still um, enhancing and improving the software on a daily basis. Right. So the engineers are really focused on creating the best program out there to allow our users to have the most flexibility and versatility, whether you are a beginner or an expert at designing. Now, before we get cutting, let me just explain to you, you're not only getting the machine today, you're also gonna get a 12 by 12 cutting mat. So if you're Absolutely. doing things like cardstock or whatever, uh, mm -hmm. you've got that. But the thing is, you don't need to use the cutting mat. This nope. is the real game changer Absolutely. from my point of view, because there are rollers in here that hold what you're cutting taut. <laughs> so unlike any other craft cutter that you've seen, I'm sorry, I threw this back here. <laughs> <laughs> um, unlike any other cutter that you have seen in the craft market, these have uh, set rollers that are actually adaptable, so you can, by moving the lever, we're gonna move the lever down, mm -hmm. and you can actually adapt the rollers to different widths and sizes of the material. Now, the other really important aspect of it is, you'll notice that when I bring the lever up, these rollers do not move. That locks them in. They lock yep. them in, mm -hmm. exactly, and these are very firm. And the reason that's important is, and you can see it there, the reason that is important is because once you place your material without the mat, you can continuously cut that vinyl whether it's signed vinyl, whether it's heat transfer vinyl, um, cardstock, you'll be able just to cut through. Well, cardstock not so much because you'll need to cut it through, die cut it. Um, but this allows you to cut lengthwise as well. Can I just say, mm -hmm. the response already, we, we weren't sure how quickly you put them in your baskets and check out, but we didn't have a large quantity and already a good few have gone. So if you are in the market for this, maybe you've been seeing it, hearing about it, you know, in the crafting world, people talk to friends and that sort of thing about things. Put it in your basket now, one split payment, the first split payment today is all that needs to be paid from your debit or your credit card. That's all you have to find, plus your PMP. And I've never seen a cutting machine like this, full 24 inch width mouth. I mean, the potential for that is huge. Whether it's for fashion, whether it's for home decor, whether it's for sign writing, whatever it might be. Maybe you just want to cut out vinyl to decorate glasses or, or mugs and things like that, whatever you want to do. Phone cases. Phone cases, yeah. This in itself is a business. Yes, exactly. I mean this is a huge business. You go to any mall nowadays and you will find a kiosk that is selling just particular cases for phones. Yeah, so you can offer like a personalization yep. for phone cases if you want to. But the sky's the limit with this. And this is what I think is so exciting. You have got a USB port in it as well. So if you we have do. got cutting files on other USBs, you can pop those in. Absolutely, and as, I, as we mentioned prior, I know you had mentioned that we are also focused in the sports world. So if you are doing on the spot events, for example, and you don't have the capability of having your computer, maybe your, your, your table space is limited, you can just pop the designs into the USB stick, place it in the back, and you can cut as you go. Okay. So you can personalize, you can create the designs as you go, uh, and that gives you a, a nice ability to be able to sell there on the spot. Okay, now there are more people wanting this with it in their baskets than we actually have stock of available currently. We have got like a, a, another plan in place should it sell out quicker than we were anticipating, which is looking like it's gonna happen. Um, well, well, if you check out now, their immediate dispatch, okay? It's guaranteed immediate dispatch. Um, we were talking about the football teams and that sort of thing. You know, when you see their names and numbers on the back of shirts, very often in some of the high-end teams, they will be, they're gonna be using Caesar vinyl. Um, that is renowned and regarded as being one of the best out there. Uh, and we have got all the vinyl available today and we are gonna be bringing that to you during these two hours as well. And that will work in other cutting machines as well. We've got the Easy Weave, which I know is one of the best sellers from Caesar. We've got the Blackboard, we've got the Holographic, uh, and we've also got the Glitter as well. All coming up, they'll obviously work in this, but they'll also work in other cutting machines as well. And they really have got the kind of high-end superiority about them, the vinyls, yeah? I'll let you say that, but you know, we do focus, we, we are very prideful in all the products that come out of the warehouse. So these products are manufactured in Italy 100%, which gives a huge advantage to us because we are able to control mm. the quality of the materials that are coming out. Sure. Um, with, beyond that, we are also capable of making and manufacturing any type of material that, well, that is feasible, right? Sure. So if you guys come up with an idea, you have an idea of a product, we are more than happy to test in, 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 in the headquarters. We'll create the lab test results, we'll do tests, and then that goes into mass production. Right. It's a beautiful set. I mean, to watch the process from idea to um, prototype 
to actually mass production is quite incredible. I mean, I can tell, having met you and hearing about the company, they've got that Italian passion and fire. They do, they do. And that really shows through the vinyl, shows through the <laughs> machines, shows through everything. Okay, um, can we get something cutting maybe? Or yeah, can you yeah, talk yeah. through it? Do you want to first um, get the test cut done or do you want to show some of the different products and then we'll go into the, the cutting? We can show some samples first yeah. if you want. So we'll be, the first product we'll be, we'll be showing today is going to be the, the Easy Weed material. Okay. And the reason for the name Easy Weed, it is a product that is super, super easy to weed. And weeding is the removal of the excess material once you cut the product. I mean, let's face it, to be honest, anyone that's got a cutting machine has probably at some point, more often than not, struggled trying to get, with a little pick, uh, the excess and the waste away from the mat, all that sort of thing. Easy Weed, as the name suggests, makes it really, really simple. I mean, here we've got some personalized baby grows here, gym gear. Gym gear, yep. There we go. So you can see the nice thing is, you, no matter what field you are in or your market, your niche market, you can see that you can really create and personalize just about anything. So we have sportswear, we have, obviously, now that the winter's coming, I know, it's a shame to say that. It's very sad to say <laughs> that. We have the fluffy socks over here. Now, these are obviously different types of materials that we've decorated with, but you can see the versatility mm -hmm. of the heat transfer vinyl that are manufactured. I mean, that bag for there. life just there. That's really? gorgeous, isn't it? I mean, look at that. That's the glitter vinyl <laughs> that's also in the show today. But you can really see the quality of it. See the quality of the cut, see the quality of the vinyl. And behind me here, some other things that we've decorated using the vinyl, of course. Uh, we've got a little... Uh, Paper bags up there. Yep. We've got like a. a Check this out. This one's really cool. Oh wow! Earrings. We'll be showing that next time. But yes, it's even the glitter on the earrings. Hey, and they weigh nothing. So they're <laughs> very, very easy to wear. But yeah, you could do glitter, glitter jewelry. Yep. Uh, it could be that you've got bullet journals and things like that, and you want to decorate the covers of those. We've got T-shirts over here, of yep. course, as well. So you can see the nice thing is what we want to show here is that with the Easy Weed, you're capable of using multicolors. Oh. So not just one color, two colors. You can really get creative and let that creativity really explode. Right. With, uh, with the machine and the PS or the Easy Weed material. I don't know about you, I'm so excited to have so the Caesar machine, the Romeo here today. <laughs> if you've seen it elsewhere and it's been on a shelf or it's just been on the internet or something like that, and you're thinking, oh, I don't know, we're live. Any questions, message in via our website, hobbymaker.co.uk. You can say we're at co contact the studio, just type your message in there, send it in, and we'll get Rudy to answer any questions you may well have. Uh, because we are live at uh, nearly 20 past one. Yep. And this is a brand new machine that we're, we're just showing right now. Terrific. So <laughs> we'll see. We'll give it, we'll give it the, the full live test, test cut, and you guys will see it all the first cut of this machine done live, which is pretty incredible. And this is what you do yourself at home. You do a test cut as soon as it arrives. Always. Yeah. Always. Always. Right. Well, let me rephrase that. Not, of course, the first time it comes, yes, but always the first time I'm doing a cut with that particular material for the day. Right. The reason is, you know, after time, the blade can wear out, so not always will you be using the same force. I don't want to waste material, so the machine will give you a really easy and quick way to show if the cut settings are correct. Ah, great. Okay. okay. So, so we'll go less chance for error. Exactly, and that's the point. We don't want to waste material. No, exactly. That's the last thing we want to do because wasting material is wasting money, mm, and we absolutely. don't want to do that. So No, don't like doing that. Okay. So, so what do you think? You ready? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. So the first thing we want to show, let's go ahead and turn on the, the Romeo. Now you'll notice that there is a screen here on my left-hand side, your right-hand side, which is actually a touch screen. So you ready for it? Mm -hmm. Because the, the, the front display is quite impressive. <laughs> all right, so we'll go ahead and there's a circular button in the front. This is all you will need to turn the machine on. Very nice and pretty. And you'll see the LED screen will turn on. And then you have... The Romeo. Is it the Romeo. Very okay. elegant, very beautiful. Again, has to be inviting. Mm -hmm. Okay. You'll notice that the touchscreen is very simple. Just a couple arrows. The arrows will help you um, place the origin for the cutting the material. So it'll help you move the material up or down. Mm -hmm. And also the blade here, the motor, to go left or right. Okay. okay. Yeah. Now we talked a little bit about the settings with the USB. So here is where you have some different options. One thing that's really, really unique about the Romeo is that it can be connected via Wi-Fi. Okay. And that's very important yep. because Wi-Fi is typically more secure connection than a Bluetooth connection. Right. So if I'm here and I'm connected to the Wi-Fi, I can actually cut somewhere else in another room oh, that's as long as we're both connected. Anywhere to in the house. Room. Exactly. Yeah, brilliant. And that adds a lot of value to mm -hmm. it because you no, no longer need the cable as I'm not showing correctly here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Then you have some different options here. The USB, obviously that is if you want to work with the USB stick. Should we talk about the camera now or should we wait that for, for a later moment? Should we do the camera a bit later? Let's do it later. Right. Good, good, good. 
All right, and then you have all your settings here. So let's go back. Let me see here if I can do this upside down. Now, another really, really, really important tool inside the Romeo is right here in the middle where it says cut settings. Now, we have all of our materials already placed inside of the Romeo. So if you're new to Caesar Vinyl, let's say you want to go with Easy Weed and you have never cut this particular material and you don't know the settings, you maybe you don't have access to the website to look at the technical data sheet, you can simply go to tech, uh, cut settings. Mm -hmm. We're going to select here Easy Weed, select oh, load. Oh, it's all in its memory. It's already memorized. Fantastic. Absolutely. So you have the speed and the force. It is adaptable. You can adjust it as you would like. If you maybe the blade is getting a bit dull, you can increase or decrease. But let's say, for example, I wanted to cut into a 12 by 12 piece mm -hmm. of American craft cardstock. Okay. I can still do that. Absolutely. Absolutely. There's actually a section where you can actually preload your own materials. Right. So it, you can personalize it as well. So you don't always have to use our settings. Um, you can also in, you can set your settings, whether it's on the Romeo and also in the software. Ah, OK, so, brilliant. So the software will have a lot of different options for cardstock. So you can do the scolding, you can do die cuts, so a lot of different features in there. Okay. Maybe for a different date that we can show more in depth. <laughs> so you selected the easy weed, which is remember the vinyl that is just so easy to peel off the, yep. the waste, okay. Okay, so I think what we can do now is let's go ahead and give it a, give it a go, right? Okay, let's do so it. So one thing I do wanna show, we have a very, we went ahead and went with a very professional steel blade holder. Yep. And this is gonna give us consistency throughout the cut. Okay, right. and you are gonna get the blade with the machine, of course. The blade with the machine, and actually you get three different blades. Okay. So you get two 45 degree blades, which mean is the blades for the thinner products, like your Easy Weed and things like that. And then you also get a 60 degree blade, which will be for your glitter materials, holographics, thicker products. Right, got you. So, that okay. we'll place that right in there. Clips into the holder. Yep, yep. clips in, let's tighten that in. And the reason we went with this type of solution is because we want to make sure that we are capable of cutting lengthwise. Right. All right, so we wanted to go with a high-end um, system with the steel blade holder and obviously the pinch roller. So that's the perfect recipe to be able to do all sorts of different jobs that you want to complete. Perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we're ready to go. I think so. I don't know if you want to show some of the, the, the bait casing because we're very proud of the, the packaging as well. It's very oh, okay. beautiful. <laughs> so there we go. The, the boxes and the packaging and everything else, all the accessories come really beautifully um, presented. So that's the roll holder, which you get with the machine. Exactly. And that's that, yeah? Yep, and this is the roll holder. Now, of course, we might, you know, just to show something that can be used for. So we have here more, a longer piece of material. So this right. is 50 centimeters wide. And this is what you will place on the roll holder to allow you to cut lengthwise. So is that the largest roll you do? For heat transfer vinyl, yes. Right. We, this is the, 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 the widest that we manufacture for the commercial world. Okay, and the ones we have in the show mm -hmm. are slightly different size. Slightly uh, different, yes. They are 30 by? 12 centimeters. 12 centimeters. Yep. Okay. So 30 by 50. 30 by 50, mm -hmm. there we go. So uh, yeah, basically that's the size of the rolls we've got on the show today, but they all fit onto this roll. Absolutely, holder. yep, okay. absolutely, with no problem. Okay. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start basic. So we're gonna first create a t-shirt, just nice cotton t-shirt. Mm -hmm. We'll use, today we're gonna be using the heat press just because it's gonna make the process more reliable. But you can use an, an ordinary everyday iron. Absolutely, and actually, inside of the, the mini rolls, that when they see when they get receive the mini rolls, they remove the, the plastic packaging. Inside is a label. Inside the label is actually the instructions right. for application with the home iron. Okay. So it gives you all the tools that you need to get started with the product. Excellent. All right. So do you, do you mind just no. placing it on there? Yeah, sure. In the meantime, I will go ahead and load. Now, right now, I only have a four sheets. <laughs> So this is what we're gonna be working with today just because of the space okay. that we have available. And we're gonna go ahead and place our material. Now it's very important when we're placing our material that we're use, placing the pinch rollers in, the pinch rollers, when I say pinch rollers, is the wheel. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. These have to be directly on top of the black section right here on the steel roller, mm -hmm. okay? And so they're totally adjustable. Totally adjustable. I'm just moving it from the right, left and right. Yep. And notice I don't have to, oh, I don't have to actually use all the pinch rollers. In this case, I'm only going to use two. Mm -hmm. And bear with me, I'm using, I'm doing this backwards. So yes, it's not the easiest thing for Rudy to do. Back to front and uh, yep. upside down. Okay. So yeah. now we're going to go ahead and clamp this down. And you can see this material is no longer is not that's going to move. So exactly. that's why we don't need a mat. Exactly. Exactly. So let me go ahead and move the material back. And again, I apologize if it's looking a little bit. Okay, there we go. 
So the first thing I want to do, okay, this is a brand new machine, the blade is in, I want to first make sure that the blade depth is good, mm -hmm. because if it's too far out, it will cut through the material, and it could damage the, what we call the cutting strip here, which is a little plastic piece that helps control and guide the material as we're cutting, all right? So first thing I want to do, there's a little bit of, there's a little t-shirt on the left-hand side here, do you see that? And that is my test cut. Okay. All right, so if I press that, my machine is, and you can hear how quiet and fast it is. It really is quiet. <laughs> it's very nice. So now we're going to bring out the handy dandy. The peter. Yeah. The, the weeder. Yes, yes. Yeah. That will come with the machine as well. Okay. So we got, our, we have our weeder here, and then we are going to just do a quick. And if this cut correctly, look how beautiful that looks. Oh, wow. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So nice little test cut there. And it shows you that that product or that particular cut setting is just right. Okay, excellent. Right? Yep. And you do that after you've turned the machine off and left it for maybe a day or two. Do another one each time or not really? To be, to be fairly honest, I use a test cut every time I switch materials. Okay. Just because I like to ensure that it's going to cut correctly every time. Make that kind of, you know, habit. The standard. Yeah. Yep, yeah. absolutely. Okay, so let's move it over here. I'm going to set my cut setting or my origin. And again, it's easier if you do it from the front side. And I think now we're ready to cut our first design. Okay. Okay. So I have a design already preset here. It's one of the designs that actually come with the software. So I think if we switch over to the, to the laptop, Ooh, something here. Okay. Now you can see here, this is the tutorials page I was talking about earlier, mm -hmm. where you can see a lot of the different videos getting you started with the machine and also just videos for particular tools okay. that might be new to you or to the user. And that's included on the software. All of this so is already included. there for you. Another important aspect I should mention is these particular windows that you see right now, you do need Wi Fi for. So you right. do need the internet. The actual designing part of the software, the actual Leonardo Design Studio, you do not. So this can be just done offline. Okay, so nice you can do that wherever you may be. If you're off or out for the weekend, you could be designing before. Absolutely. And then connect it when you get home. You could be at the beach, okay. you could be in the mountains, and you can use it no problem. Sounds good. Yep. Yep. All right, then we have some inspiration. We'll just briefly kind of go through some ideas for you. Um, so you have, obviously, this is both, um, a lot of these designs also come from our partners in the US. So if they're a little bit Americanized, I do apologize. <laughs> That's fine. But you can also design your own, of course. Absolutely, absolutely. And the nice thing is you can also use the designs that are already inside of the software and edit them to create your own designs. Oh, so you can take bits and pieces. Now, the designs themselves cannot be sold. Right. So see, if you're doing this for a business, the actual designs cannot be sold, the, the digital file. What can be sold is the finished product. Yes. So let's say you make this T-shirt, you can sell the T-shirt, no problem. So although the image can't be sold on the laptop, when you've cut it out and put it on something, you can sell it. So you have the commercial license, gotcha. exactly, right. which is a huge advantage as well. So Massive. you basically have your full business once you, once you receive this package. A full business for less than £800 and on five interest-free split pays. Or maybe you just want it for family and friends. Maybe you want to offer it as a service to people at work, uh, which I know lots of you do do for personalization. This is perfect. If you've been restricted by the size of other machines that are on the market, thinking, oh, if only I could get a machine that's got a bigger mouth, 24 inch wide, and you've seen the, si the size of some of the rollers that are available as well that you can buy with that top quality vinyl that's got such a heritage in the fashion world, in the sporting world as well. Can't really go wrong, yeah. okay. All right, so I already have a design picked, and I picked it from the design library. Now, of course, we have Halloween coming up, so I figure let's start off with a little bit more theme. The friendly ghost club. Yeah, the friendly like ghost club. <laughs> it's cute, it's nice. So I'm actually using, here is our EasyWeed uh, rose gold material. Mm -hmm. Now, very That's important. In the show. It is, exactly. And very important, I'm using, I'm facing the material with the color facing down. So we're actually cutting on the adhesive side. Oh, right, okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Now, you can't tell yet because this is heat transfer vinyl, so it's only activated with heat. Right. All right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go to send design, and look how easy it is. Boom, my design is ready to cut. And you can change the size if you want to. You can change the size as you would like, and here you can also change your settings. So I'm using the settings I have placed in the software, or excuse me, in the machine, but I can also customize my settings. So you can see here we have fold, crease, perforated cut, so a lot of different options depending on your project. Okay. So again, the idea is to not limit the creativity. Okay? Mm -hmm. And then we're just gonna go ahead and send to cutter. So I need to connect it. It's the first time I'm using it, so I will just set connect with USB. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
And it's nice because these are things that's get, that can happen in life. There it goes. Yep. It's off. It's running. Let's watch it in action. <laughs> I should have warned you that it was going to start that quick. <laughs> <laughs> it is incredibly quick and incredibly quiet as well. Incredibly quiet, yes. So if you're doing it maybe in the bedroom or a spare room or something like that, you normally have to take machines elsewhere so it doesn't annoy the rest of the family. You could do this on the dining room table. Or late at night when you're working and maybe your family is yeah. trying to watch TV or go to sleep and you're working late nights, yeah. this is a great opportunity. And you can see we're cutting this material and I hope it's, I made the right size and I think I did. Hopefully it's not too big. It's looking okay so far. Yeah, well, looking okay. Yeah, yeah. Incredibly quick. Now, I know there are lots of cutting machines out there on the market. Maybe you've already got one and you're thinking, do you know what? I've, I've, often fancied the Caesar. Maybe, maybe you've seen it or someone's talked about it or something like that. This is your first opportunity to get this machine with us at Hobby Maker. It's debuting today. Remember, with us, it's £50 cheaper than elsewhere. You can find it elsewhere in the UK, but you'll pay £50 more. With us, you pay £50 less, and it's on maximum five interest-free split payments, okay? Less than £160 to spend today, and that will be on its way. Okay. And remember, we have a very small quantity available. We'd love to have a lot bigger quantity, but they don't get manufactured in their thousands. You know, these are specifically designed, engineered machines. You don't expect to get lots and lots and lots of them made available. So we've only got a few, but a large quantity of that has already been allocated. I know Maxine in Kent and Linda in South Yorkshire. Stephanie's interested. Mandy in Buckinghamshire is interested as well. Um, what are you going to be using it for? Obviously cutting, but what purpose? Is it for a little business? Is it because you want to personalize for your friends, family, your children, that sort of thing? Or maybe you've just been waiting for a cutting machine that's out there that's bigger, that's got much more scope, a 24 inch mouth. It's just a brilliant investment with all that software included and thousands of images and designs that are included on the software as well. But of course you can make your own and you can also, if you've got cutting files on USBs, use those in this machine as well. So don't think they're gonna be you know, completely uh, past history or old news. You can still use those, but you don't have to use a cutting mat because you've got those grippy rollers. If you want to use a cutting mat, you can. One does come with it, but it's really clever. Yep. And I made a little bit of mistake, so I'll be honest with you guys. And okay. these things do happen live. All right. All right. So th I made the design a bit too too big. So and we ran out of material on the space there. So what I did is I just cut the top piece off, which is fine. The rest of the material okay. cut okay. So it's still a pretty design. It's still a cute design. Okay. No problem. Okay. And I like to be honest. If things go wrong live, these things do happen to oh, us. Oh, so, tell okay. us about it. It's, <laughs> we know on live TV things go wrong. Um, exactly. Now we've had a, a question. Did ask you to send you any questions. If you've got any queries or anything that you want to know, Susan has sent us a message. Hello, Susan in Merseyside. Um, she says afternoon. Great looking machine. Will it cut fabric? Thank you, Susan. So these are things that we're also working on. There is, a, we have a, an ambassador that has done some things with fabric as well. Fabric is challenging because it can be, it all depends on the fibers and the different types of cottons that you're cutting. Mm -hmm. um, in, in short, yes, there are some fabrics you can cut. Now with that said, we are always adapting and evolving the machine and the tools for the machine. So fabric is one that's on the, on the top priority list as well to make sure that we cut a lot of different fabrics. But yes, there are instances that you can cut fabric. Fantastic. Thank you for the question, Susan. Thank you so much. Any more questions, just message in via our website, hobbymaker.co.uk, uh, where it says contact the studio. That's what Susan did. Just type that message in. It gets sent through. We put it on the screen and we can hopefully answer it for you. Okay. So now I want to show you a cool trick with our products. Now, you have done in the past the weeding process, yes. right? The removal of the excess material. Typically, it can be a bit tedious. What do you think? Do you like it? Um, it can be a bit tricky and a bit fiddly. Look at how easy this is. Can you see the camera there? Where, am I, where should I point? <laughs> um, Would you like to show the detail yeah, yeah. on that? And then I'm going to show you a head. trick to make this even faster, quicker. There you go. <laughs> there we go, look. Yep. I mean, that's how easy it is to actually remove. And you can check out the eye. Look, how it's, look at the detail in the eye. Yeah. And the reason for it is because the material, the easy weed material comes with a very nice adhesive carrier okay. that allows you to cut more detail and really, really small designs. Okay, I'll toss right. that back to you. Thank you. So now, quick little trick. For those of you guys, I know in many cases, weeding or removing the excess can be very therapeutic. If you're like me and you would like to do things very quickly, there's a trick. <laughs> that frustrates me, but you know, you find tricks to make the process a little bit easier and smoother, right? Sure, yeah. So one thing you can do is actually use some heat. Okay. So I can go here, apply a little bit of heat to the bottom platen. Now check this out. Place my transfer right on top and watch this. Look how easy you can remove the excess oh. now. You see that? Oh, looks like it's too hot. It's okay, no problem. 
So the heat makes the weeding process even quicker. Exactly, so exactly, exactly. Look, and it's no problem because it, it is a little bit adhesive, so I can move it back. No problem. You can see it makes the process of removing the excess much, much easier. Yeah. And look at easy. We can remove the, the ghosts. Okay. And remember, the vinyl from Caesar is highly regarded in the fashion industry and also in the football industry. Sports stars very often have mm -hmm. vinyl with their names and numbers on the back from Caesar. So you're getting get top quality vinyl that's yep. in the show as well. And there you go. So now we can apply it. Wow. So let's go here and show you how easy it is to apply the material. All right, so we have our designer cut a little bit of it. Okay. First cut live for me in national television has been a bit <laughs> rough, but it happens, right? Okay, so now we have our 100% cotton. Now, easy weed can be applied onto cotton uh, blends, so cotton polyester blends or just polyester materials as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the first thing we'll do here is we'll do a quick pre press. And you don't have to have a press like this, an ordinary iron will be fine. You don't, you don't. So you can also use a, an iron. It just takes a little bit longer time to apply it. Sure. With the heat press, very quick and easy. I can go here, place this right in the middle. Mm -hmm. Now I'm not covering in this case because I don't have, or I'm still using the cover sheet. Yep. So that's going to protect my design. We are applying this at 150 degrees Celsius for 15 seconds. Okay. And that's it, quick mm -hmm. and easy process. Right. Now, once applied at the correct time and temperature and pressure, then you have that longevity of 50 plus washes with no problem. 50 plus washes? Absolutely. Wow. Okay. Watch this. And you can remove this hot. And look how nice that came out. Look at that. <laughs> and that's the rose gold, which is actually a really, really beautiful color. Uh, it's my favorite color. <laughs> whether it's cardstock or whether it's vinyl, rose gold is always my favorite. Look at the quality of that. And that's going to be fine for up to 50 washes. I don't think the t-shirt would last 50 washes. No, like, it like, typically doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, this, this is the sort of quality we're talking about here. You mentioned heat and pressure. If you're using conventional iron, do you have to apply a lot of pressure as well? You or? do, you have to. So the pressure is one of those things that will always enhance the longevity of the product. Our products are tested for, are ma manufactured specifically for, with three main ingredients. Right. Time, temperature, and pressure. Right. So I always do recommend to use some pressure. If you're not using as much pressure, just increase the time and the temperature. Sure, gotcha. Okay. Now, loads of you, I know, have already chosen this. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll remind you about the features of the machine, and then we'll also show you the vinyl rolls, the easy weed that we've been talking about uh, with Rudy. That's available as individual options, and you saw just how easily all that excess and the waste came away. But it's the debut today, brand new to Hobby Maker. It's the brilliant cutting machine that is the Caesar. Yes, you're joining us on a very special afternoon show, a two-hour special with Rudy and the brilliant Romeo, which is the brand new cutting machine to us at Hobby Maker that's got the 24-inch mouth. Remember, it comes with all the software. It has at least 3,000 images, which you can, of course, customize as well if you want to on the software. You've got tutorial videos to kind of back up the brilliant machine as well. And remember, today, if you bought this anywhere else in the UK, we've seen it for 50 pounds more. It's about 849, something like that. Today, we're giving it to you 
for 50 pounds less, under 800 pounds, and where else do you get five interest-free split payments other than us here at Hobby Maker? We don't do five normally. Four is normally our maximum. I think we've done five maybe two or three times before on certain things, so it doesn't happen regularly. And on split pay, that means it's under 160 pounds, I think. Yeah, 100, under 160 pounds today, 159.80, I think it is, on that first split payment of five. And it will be sent straight out, straight away today, okay? With one PMP of 395, that's all you have to pay for the whole day's orders. So if you're coming in for Hunky Dory a bit later on and you're buying this or anything else in the show, you've paid your 395 PMP already. Okay, now let's talk about the vinyls then, yes. Rudy. I thought these were gonna be quite a bit of money, but they're not, they're so affordable. Absolutely. Yes. But this has got, tell us again about the quality because it's got such a great heritage in, in like designer uh, fashion and also sport that we've talked Sports, about. Sports, yes. And um, the, one of the really key elements of the products is also the certifications. So all these products are Okitech certified. Right. They are vegan okay. And they are recyclable with the right code. Right. So they're also eco-friendly in that way. But one of the important things is that they can be used all, all throughout the different categories, whether it's kids clothing, baby clothing, because they are Okitech certified, which is very, very important, mm -hmm. all the way through the sports world, because they are firm and durable materials and will have the longevity always if it's applied, if applied correctly with the three main ingredients. I mean, if you think about sportswear and what that goes through on a regular daily mm -hmm. basis on the field and also how many washes it gets and all that sort of thing, it's got to be tough. It's got to be durable. Uh, it's got to be, uh, you know, um, long lasting. And that's what these vinyls are all about. So we've got the Easy Weed, which as the name suggests, it makes it very easy when you're using the picking tool to actually take the waste away. Um, and they come in a variety of colors, don't they as well? They do, they do. And right now, obviously, the more, some of the more popular colors um, now that summer, well, I would say the summer colors were more the pastel colors here. Mm -hmm. So you have your pale blue, light pink, aqua green, which are really, really beautiful colors. Uh, you have your white, which is will forever be the most important product, yeah, <laughs> the yeah, most important yeah. color, along with the black. Um, you have the gold, which is also a really beautiful color. Gives it, especially if you're doing events, if you're doing parties, that's a really nice color there. Mm -hmm. And then we have the ones that we just showed, which was the rose gold. Mm -hmm. The rose gold is really beautiful because it not only is the color really beautiful, but it also has this really metallic sheen to it that really makes that design, that color pop. Um, and also looks amazing when you combine it with other materials. Now, we've also got the blackboard vinyl. Mm -hmm. So we've got the Easy Weed, and we've also got the blackboard vinyl in this show as well. Now, do bear in mind, if you haven't got the funds or don't want to go for the machine, if you're thinking, oh, can I use this? I love the idea of using this really kind of top quality vinyl. The answer is yes. Mm -hmm. So if you've got another cutting machine that isn't a Caesar, it doesn't matter. You can still use these wonderful vinyls in that machine as well. Uh, so we'll show you the Easy Weed first of all. And we'll start with the white and we'll go down in order. So the white one, they're all the same size, aren't they, as well? These? They are, they are. They're 12 inches in width. 12 inches in width and how long? 50 centimetres. 50 centimetres, okay. So 12 inches wide, 50 centimetres, a half a metre long, only 7.99. Wow, and That's like, like Rudy That's said, you know, the white is a classic. Everyone needs that. You may not need every other color in the collection, but everybody needs a white, everybody needs a black, everybody maybe needs a gold as well. So $7.99 is all it is for a half meter long by 12 inches in width. So it's gonna go through other cutting machines as well as the Caesar, obviously, today. YC9G64 if you want the white one. So that's YC9G64. Now the other colors we've got for you, we've got the pale blue, which is a, a lovely kind of sky blue. We're calling it pale blue. All the dimensions are the same though. They are always the same dimensions, 30 by 50 centimeters. Okay, which mm -hmm. is 12 inches wide. There you go. So that's the pale blue. If you want that one, that's what will be arriving. Uh, you Only you know the projects that you're going to be wanting to do, whether it's going to be wall art, whether it's going to be furniture, whether it's going to be fashion, fabrics, bags, whatever it might be. Uh, if you love that sky blue, it's called pale blue. That one is HE9G59. Then, um, to complement the pale blue, you've then got this beautiful light pink, uh, perfect maybe for, I don't know, little baby girls. Baby girls, yeah, and again, because of the certification, the Okitech certification makes it a no-brainer. Absolutely, yeah. You uh, can buy these in confidence knowing that the quality is absolutely spot on. Uh, there's no nasties in them or anything like that to worry about. Do they have, do, is gender reveal as popular here in the UK? It's, the gender reveals? Yes, yeah, oh, yeah. Perfect, so you have the pale blue and the light pink. Yeah, absolutely, <laughs> yeah, yeah, great idea. So that's the light pink if you want that one. They're all the same price, seven ninety nine. Now, I must admit this one, this is our uh, hobby maker color. This is aqua green, okay? Aqua green, again, 50 by 30. 
And there we go, that's $7.99 is your price for that one. They're all the same price and they will work through other machines. Don't just think it's the Caesar. It will work in other cutting machines out there. Now, if you know the next one, the next colorway is really lovely. It's like a teal, but we're calling it turquoise. Turquoise, yep. There we are, it's like a petrol blue, beautiful. There is your turquoise. $7.99 for turquoise, 30 by 50 centimeters. I would have thought these had been like double that sort of price to be honest. You would think so, yeah, yeah. And, and that's the thing is, you know, it's high quality at an affordable price. You know, we understand also the market and we want to be adaptable to the market as well. Mm. And these are all manufactured, remember, in Italy, in which Italy, is yes. nice to know, to exacting standards. The quality of the vinyl is second to none. Um, treat yourself, even if you're not going for the machine today, treat yourself to the vinyl because uh, it's a game changer. You'll notice a massive difference between other vinyls that are out there on the market and Caesar. Um, turquoise is OS9G29. You know what the difficult part is? Is actually showcasing the beauty of the color on, on screen. Yeah, that's Sometimes it's very part. challenging. <laughs> totally. Now, uh, we're recommending, um, obviously the next color is gonna be very, very popular. It's a beautiful gold, as you can see here. This is the standard gold, isn't it? The, uh, the yellow gold. Look at that, isn't it opulent and rich? I mean, how often do you want to use gold on your projects? Quite often, I would have thought. A, a lot, I mean, for me, gold, black, combination with the black t-shirt always comes out great. I mean, with it, whether it's a uh, party, birthday, bachelorette party, I mean, the, it, it's the go-to typically to make that the design really pop. Maybe you want to go for a couple. If you've got a few projects that you want to do in gold, feel free. It's only one PMP for the whole day. $7.99 for 30 by 50 centimeters. That's a 12 inch width, remember. That's your gold. Then we go on to this next one, which is the lilac gray. I love this, very different. Very beautiful color. Is that a metallic as well? Or? It's not metallic, no, no, no. no. We'll wait for the... Okay. <laughs> Metallics are on the way. But it does have a really beautiful tone that gives it, it, it pops. It's not your typical gray color, sure. so it has a little bit of a sheen that, to, that, that really makes it unique. Okay, very different indeed. YA9G89, £7.99 for that one. Then we've got another classic, just as much a, 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 as popular as the white, the classic black, this is gonna be hugely popular as well. You know, you always need white, you always need black, probably you always need gold, at least, as your three main staple colorways. So $7.99 for the Easy Weed in the, uh, in the black option. And again, the Easy Weed, if you're wondering what, you know, Easy Weed actually means, it's basically when you're taking the waste away and kind of peeling off what you've cut from your machine, that sometimes can be a bit fiddly and a bit tricky. The whole process has been made that much easier with the technology used in this vinyl, okay? Um, now, how much has gone? 10% of the black has gone already. Remember, it will work in other machines, not just in the, uh, in the Caesar, other cutting machines, not a problem for any of these vinyls. Um, and these are gonna be a, a, a regular in-stock item for us here at Hobby Maker as well. So you can always, if you run out, just go on the website and order some more if you want to. Now, the rose gold that you used in the demo, yep. um, now this is gonna fly always rose gold <laughs> as a card option, as a vinyl option. It's always one of the most popular, really beautiful. There it is, 50 by 30, seven pounds 99. Gorgeous, gorgeous color. So that's the rose gold that we used in that t-shirt demo a few minutes ago. Remember, we are here for another hour and 10 minutes with the Caesar machine, the Romeo. So if you've got any questions for Rudy, please do just send them in. We've already had a few already today. Just go via the website and send us in any messages that you want questions answered. Okay, from rose gold, we're then going to go to our silver. That's the last one in the easy weed. We've got a blackboard one in a minute, which we'll talk about, which is a bit of a game, cha bit of a game changer. But the silver, there we are, look, classic silver, $7.99. Again, they're all the same size. GW9G01 is your silver option. Stock up on your vinyl today. It's the first day we've had Caesar in on the channel, and they're going to be a regular stockist here with us at Hobby Maker, which is really exciting and great news. Okay, now loads of you checking out on vinyls, which is good news. Now, down the end, <laughs> we've got the chalkboard vinyl. Now, you might think to yourself, how on earth, how on earth can chalkboard uh, how on earth can vinyl be a chalkboard? Well, you've actually got a shopping bag. There. I do, I do. This is a very handy shopping bag. Look at this. So it's, it looks first, first and foremost like a classic black vinyl, but the difference is it gives you a chalkboard surface. Although it's flexible and washable and everything else, you can, with chalk, actually mark on it and write on it if you want to. So it doesn't have to be a hard surface. It can be a, a soft surface or whatever. Should we do a sample? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. This is genius. Now. For me, it's a bit kind of a sensitive topic. Right, what, using, shopping? No, <laughs> using chalk. Oh. I'm left-handed. Oh, okay. You can only imagine right, what happens. Right, right, <laughs> yes, I can imagine, yeah. So, do you want to do the honors? Okay. Because otherwise, I'm just, and of course, on a flat surface, it's nice. 
Oh, look. See? Yeah, yeah, you just you can write on it. You can then erase. No, look at that. Now we now we know what you're thinking about. Wine. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> wine. What a great combination. <laughs> I know. Look, how cool is that? And then you can just wipe it off, I suppose. I'm just laughing because vinyl was third. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no, so you can just now wipe it off with a little bit of a uh, rag, and, yeah. and technically you can wipe it off, you know. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, and then you can reuse it. So the whole it. roll is basically chalkboard vinyl. Yeah. Genius. Exactly how the name says it. Now, this is only one pound more <laughs> than the standard vinyl, and you can, yeah, have a lot, have a lot of fun with it. Yep. Eight ninety nine is your price. Um, it's still the same adhesive, though, yeah? Same adhesive, yeah, one, and we can actually apply one if you would like. I have a sample that we can apply. Okay. The nice thing about the material, you know, this is a shopping list. You can do name tags. Yes. I mean, you can really get creative with this particular product. You can get, think outside the box with it, realistically. Um, name tags, if you're working as a security guard, yeah. guard name tag, security, so many things you can get creative with. Great idea. Yeah, so you go into a party and everyone can have a t-shirt, maybe with a little chalkboard plaque yep. on it, and everyone can write their names. Yep. 8 99 if you want the chalkboard vinyl, JY9G27 is the product code, JY9G27. Now remember, it's all about today, not only the vinyl, but also about the launch of this brand new cutting machine. Um, now let's have a look at the website, because if we go to hobbymaker.co.uk, you can see all the vinyls there that are available in this hour. Uh, we've got a few more, I think, to show you a bit later on as well. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got some glitters, and we've also got some holographic vinyl as well, but those are the ones we've shown you so far. Are the glitters and holographic on there yet on the website or not? Not yet, okay, so they're all the ones we've just shown you now. Loads of you have put them in your basket and check it up, okay? Uh, $8.99 goes for the chalkboard uh, vinyl. I'll tell you what, take a little look at this again and then we'll go back to the machine and do more demos Great. with Rudy. Here at Hobbymaker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. If you've recently missed your favourite show on Hobbymaker, it's really easy to catch up on our website. Simply visit hobbymaker.co.uk and click TV Guide. Here you'll be able to choose any show broadcast in the last seven days, which you can watch, pause and rewind at your convenience. And to make shopping even easier, any items featured in the show will appear underneath. With Hobbymaker's catch-up, there's never a reason to miss out, no matter what time of day. Welcome back. There's a real buzz in the building today about the launch of this, uh, the Caesar cutting machine. Of course, it is uh, an incredible piece of equipment. It really, really is. I, I totally understand that spending, you know, £800 or 799 needs a bit of thought. And that's why we've given this show a two hour slot this afternoon, because we want to get as many demos in as we can, answer as many questions as we possibly can. The truth of the matter is we know an awful lot of you have had this on your wish list for a little while. Um, it is available elsewhere in the UK. We're not saying it's exclusive to us, but what we can do is save you another 50 pounds off what other people are charging for this. So it's 799. Big deal with us as well, not only saving you 50 pounds, we're giving you five interest-free split pays. So that's for less than 170 pounds today. This will be dispatched straight away. It will be with you in the next couple of days. And what it allows you to do is utilize the software that comes with it, 3,000 uh, images and designs and words and, and uh, all those wonderful designs on that software you can of course change the size of if you want to you can cut out of whatever vinyl you choose you can sell what you've made no problem at all so this could be a new business for you a new business idea I mean how many bit businesses require thousands and thousands of pounds to start up in all sorts of costs. You know, for less than 800 pounds, you've got basically a business on its way to you, or it may be that you just wanna do it for friends and family or friends at work and that sort of thing. Um, it's entirely your call, but this is the, this is the game changer. And the, the actual mouth of this, the cutting mouth on this machine is 24 inches. You can buy 24 inch rolls. So imagine then the, the scope and the potential of how big signs could be. Uh, if you're doing signs for fairs, doing your own publicity, that sort of thing, offering it as a service 
service to somebody else. Maybe you're a school or a group or a, a craft club, uh, and you're just thinking, this would be perfect for all of us. Maybe if you want to share it between you and your best friend. Each of you spend maybe £90 a month for the next five months or the next five payments uh, and share it. Um, be perfect for crafting groups, but remember, you can also adapt the software. You can add to it, you can do your own personalization. If you've got USB with cutting files on it as well from other places, they can slot into the machine too. Um, and you get full backup, a full two year warranty, whether you're using it for domestic use or business use. Also, you've got all those tutorials on the software as well that Rudy was talking about. Okay, Rudy, uh, lots of interest in this, which is no surprise, really. Absolutely, no, I love it. And I thank you again for having me on. It's, no. it's been an incredible pleasure. first hour. Brilliant. It's gone by like that. It does go Fly, like that. Right? It goes oh, so quickly. Man. Now, um, I'm going to use the chalkboard okay. line on it. Yeah, you so. want to show the... So I already have the chalkboard design cut out, but I do want to show you the weeding because the weeding, again, is super, super easy with this material. Again, it comes with that adhesive carrier mm -hmm. that allows you to create small details. So you can see the lines are very, very thin in the center there to separate, obviously, the shopping list. Yep. Um, but the product is super easy to weed again. So I'm going to go over here to the... Okay with our weeding tool and we'll create the same bag that we just showed. Mm -hmm. Can you see that here? Is that gonna be easier to see or where should we put it so we can see a little bit easier? No, that's okay. Where okay, yeah, perfect. That's yeah. So grab the left side here. Ooh. Perfect. And again, you can also use the heat press trick. Mm -hmm. Let me go ahead and... Uh, you don't need to have a, like a professional nope. uh, t-shirt press at all. Just an ordinary iron would do the job. Exactly. You can see here, I see that the product is, you can see it's very elastic. Yeah. So this also works great with polyester materials. And remember these vinyls are used, I don't know about the chalkboard one, but certainly the other Caesar vinyls are used in um, top fashion house designer boutiques, those sort of places, and also sportsmen and women uh, are very often wearing, you wouldn't know it, but they are very <laughs> often wearing uh, Caesar transfers on the back for numbers absolutely. and names. No, you no, know the quality is going to be top, top notch. Absolutely. You can see here, using a little bit of that heat is allowing me to, and I'm just going slowly around, you can see how nice that comes off here. Okay. All right. Now we can do two things. We can either remove the inside or I can move each individual letter. Mm -hmm. So basically what we're gonna do here is allow the, the, the shirt, or in this case, the bag, to kind of show through. Right. And I should thank our marketing team for helping us out with the, all the different designs here. Mm -hmm. Because even the letters, how easy it is. And I always like to use this heat press trick because it really makes the process so much easier, even when you have text like this. Okay. You can have so much fun using this machine as well. Oh, yeah. So much creativity. I mean, think about how much you've spent on your dies over the years, how much you've spent on stamps over the years, die-cutting machines. You know, they are decent ones. They're, you know, 150, 200 pounds. So to get a cutting machine like this that you're in control of via your computer and the software that you get with it, um, it's just a, a great opportunity, and it's all about the size. Yes, other cutting machines are good too, but they haven't got the size capability that this has got. You can do small things on this as well, but you can do up to 24 inches in width, which is, I've never seen a cutting machine that big before. Uh, but it's not big in bulk, you know, it's, it's long and wide, but you could easily put this on like a, a, a standard table and it wouldn't be, you know, out of, the, out of place. It wouldn't take up too much room because its footprint is actually quite small. It's the width of it. And it's not so heavy either. You'd be surprised by the way it's right. quite, I mean, it has to have some type of weight so the material doesn't move while it's cutting. Yeah. But you'll see it's, it's, it's sturdy, but it's not bad. Okay. Okay, so we have our design. Again, very, you know, in, in a sense, you have a lot of different parts to weed, mm -hmm. and that was quite easy, actually. So then we'll... Now, I always like to do the pre-press, especially when you're using cotton, and the reasons are, obviously, you want to remove the wrinkles. Yep. And, of course, with cotton, sometimes you have moisture, which can affect the overall application. Oh, so right. just some tips there as we go. So just a few seconds, and then we can place this right on here. Let's go ahead and flip it because I don't have enough room this way. Mm -hmm. So again, the heat press is very nice because you are capable of, of adapting based on the different design. So there we go. Mm -hmm. Now, typically with the blackboard, you do want to apply it at lower temperature. Right now, for the purposes of the live, because it does take a few minutes to lower down to 135, that's okay. 
we'll just do it for about seven to eight seconds in and this it, case. And it says on the rolls in the instructions exactly it does. what temperature it, so. it does, exactly. Now, the reason I'm kind of veering off a little bit less time is just because I have more temperature. Okay. Don't worry, this, this all comes with the usage ah, of the material, but check that out. Look at that. And a beautiful matte finish, which, which really is, is really nice. So anything that you've cut out of the, uh, the chalkboard vinyl has got the capability of it to be written on with colored chalk, white chalk, whatever you want. And, uh, you know, just a pound more than the standard vinyl, $8.99. There you go. So that is your chalkboard vinyl. And it's, remember, all the vinyls are 30 by 50, 30 centimeters by 50 centimeters, which basically is a 12 inch width, like a, a standard uh, size. So let's go back to the machine. Okay. Let's go back and maybe, can we do some more cutting? Is that Absolutely, right? let's go for it. So okay. I do have a little bit longer piece here. And okay. So this will be the last one we'll do with the easy weed, and then we can focus on some other materials. What okay. do you think? Terrific. All right, so now I want to, again, our materials are really manufactured for all types of applications. Yep. Now I have a pair of, I don't know if I can remove that for now. <laughs> so I have some jeans here. Um, they're nice, but I think as an artist, you look at it and you think there's so much more we can do. This is a blank canvas. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and decorate these. But the great thing is blank canvas is normally a very, very inexpensive. It's when you get the design <laughs> ones that you pay through the roof. So you can make your own designer clothes. Unique. I will be very honest. It's very challenging for me to go to a store and buy uh, graphic tees. Because mm -hmm. you can do them yourself. Not only that, but you also know, you know, I do respect the artist and the value behind it. That's for sure. Sure. But also, I know how it's made. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so, of course, in some a cases, a lot of those are mass produced, and thousands <laughs> of people are wearing the same thing. You can exactly. do something a bit different and be more of a one off. And um, the game changer with this as well is not only the 24 inch width, but it's also the fact that it will work with or without a mat. You will get a 12 by 12 mat included with the machine yep. and three blades, but it's got the capability of having these lockable rollers, which are really, really clever. So, you don't need a mat all the time. No, exactly. And that's what we're doing here. We're just showing a bit longer piece. I think this is roughly around 50 centimeters. So I will, play. again, I apologize. I'm just trying to do this upside down. It's not, it's not easy for, no. uh, for Rudy or for me, for that matter, <laughs> if we're doing it back to front and upside Exactly. Down. So you can see here the material again on the back, that is nice and firm, which yep. is what we want. And now we're going to go ahead and cut this design. Okay. So again, this is kind of a nice little design with flowers and hearts. Mm -hmm. And the idea is to kind of have that go down the Exactly, oh, something nice. unique, so it's not just your standard on the, on the pocket, it's something a little bit different. Placement of the material, play around with the different placement, different designs, um, and just get creative, really. Mm -hmm. So that's one of the 3,000? One of the 3,000, exactly. So this is just the flowers. If I go to my design library, I can type in flowers, and you'll see that come right up. Of course, you have all your categories here on the left side, I think, my, the Does the software now. remember what you've used? It does, there is recent um, searches as well. Right. So you'll see that in there. So you have a lot of different flower designs. Some, oh, it's right here. So this is the one in particular that I'm using right now. Mm -hmm. The difference is I kind of, I, um, I just twisted it a bit. I twisted it to the, so that quarter way it's turn. gonna be, exactly, yeah. quarter turn, exactly. So has it got, are they in categories then, design categories? It does, it does have design categories. So you can go all the way up from, you know, you have motivational quotes, you have flowers, you have different themes for the, the, the holidays. Um, so a lot of different categories to choose from. Perfect. Mm -hmm. The nice thing, it's always evolving as well. So we're constantly adding designs to it. Mm -hmm. Most of those new designs will end up in the front page. Right, so perfect. If you want to see what kind of novelty there is, you can go into the design page there. Also, looking at the screen, it's a very uncluttered, very simple screen to follow, isn't it, as well? Bravo. Exactly. And that's one of the things we really wanted to focus on. We know graphic designing programs can be intimidating. Mm -hmm. And we wanted to kind of go away from that, make it powerful, but as less, as, as less intimidating as possible. Yep. So anybody can go on and start using the software right away. One of the biggest things we heard, we do, we do a lot of trade shows in different industries, and typically is, I bought this machine, it's just sitting in the corner. Mm -hmm. And we wanted nothing to do with that because we want the, the user to buy the machine, use the machine right away and get creative. We don't want it to sit around for, for too long. And, and don't forget, of course, going forward, Caesar are gonna have all of the um, rolls of vinyl, mm -hmm. the glitter, the holographic, the, uh, the chalkboard. We'll have all of those in the future available on our website. We'll get more stock of them. We'll have replacement blades, all the accessories that you need for the Caesar. This will be the one-stop shop. Won't absolutely, it? So absolutely. It's good news. Ready to send it? Yeah. Let's check it out. Okay, so again, nice little design. Now this time we're gonna be cutting the design vertically. 
Here it comes. Is it not plugged in? What's going on here? So we're using the, uh, the silver vinyl in this instance. And remember, it's all about um, simplicity. Ah, Oop. sorry about that. I misplaced right. the origin. That was my fault again. It's doing it back to a fun <laughs> We don't make it easy for you, sorry. Nah, you know, these are the things, honestly, once you've done enough lives and, and demonstrations in person that these kind of things don't ever phase you anymore, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. Now we're gonna send the cutter. There we go. There we go, perfect. I, this, these things fascinate me. It's incredible, right? It's like right? your own personal robot. <laughs> so it's cutting out all those flowers Yep, and all the love hearts. It's about, uh, the design is about 10 inches tall, so. Right. Nice, nice design to show the strength of the machine and how it can cut in length as well. It's incredibly quick. And remember, if you're doing your research and you're looking elsewhere to see um, how much this machine is, what we found is uh, about 849, I think it was. Uh, whether there's split pay available on that elsewhere, I'm not sure, I don't think so. But with us, it's 799 and five interest-free split payments for the ultimate cutting machine, as far as I'm concerned, with those 3,000 images um, on the software that you'll get access to when you buy this machine. It's all in the box, uh, easy to follow. You just register your machine, don't you? And then yep. you get access to the software. It's very quick. It takes only a couple minutes to get started with the right. machine. It's really incredible. Now, the other really nice thing about it is, even if you, oh, cutting caught up here. You can see those designs are really coming out great. Mm -hmm. One of the nice things is also, if you want to increase the speed in during the cutting, oh, it's getting caught. So let's make sure that, we wanna make sure that we don't have any interference there. Yep. Um, one of the nice things, if you want to increase the speed while it's cutting or change the force, because maybe you're seeing that it's not cutting correctly, mm -hmm. you can do so while it's cutting. Okay. Now, of course, now it's finished, so we can't show that quite. So that's perfect, look at that. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that live. Let's. Um, oh, yeah, I can see the, the cut lines. Perfect. Yep. So that should. So let's go ahead and uh, now we'll show you again. Always going back to that weeding trick because, again, with a design like this, could be can be tedious. You can see there's a lot of different points to it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So let's go over here. Now, remember, all the vinyls that we've got um, in the show today, anyway, are 50 by 30. Uh, we will be bringing you the glitter and the holographic fairly soon as well. Yes. So. After this application, we will go right towards the, check that out. Look how easy that weeds. Look how beautiful that looks. Hey. Right. <laughs> okay. Remove a couple no, just of hold those up to the yeah, 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 absolutely. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Sorry, look at that. All of those cut to perfection and weeding in seconds. Yeah, absolutely. So, we'll move just a couple of the dots in the side of the flowers and then um, we'll apply this to the side of the jeans mm -hmm. again. So, you can buy, like you said, very in a way cheap jeans and you can really convert them into a piece of art. Absolutely. Okay, we'll do this here. But of course, they've cut out independently. So if you don't want to keep them in that cluster, if you don't want to keep yep. them in that order, you don't have to. You could use them individually, one at a time. Exactly. On pockets or whatever you want to do. And you can cut them out even once you cut it. You can actually cut with scissors as well. Yep. And really get creative with it. All right, so let's see here. So we have one shot at this, so hopefully it looks good. <laughs> <laughs> the beauty of life. Okay, so in theory, I can place this here. Let's do it this way. Look how beautiful that looks. Yeah. A, a bulk standard pair of jeans that probably were very, very inexpensive <laughs> suddenly look like a designer pair of jeans. Exactly. All right, so now it's a bit thicker. The, the, the jeans are a bit thicker, so I can reduce the pressure some. Right. Perfect. 15 seconds, that's it. Okay. And we're done. And remember, it doesn't have to be with an industrial t-shirt press doesn't. like this. You can use it with your everyday iron, um, preferably uh, steam off, I presume. No, steam off, oh, yes. Steam, no, steam no, off. steam off, yes, yeah. absolutely. Because the steam will affect the overall, the overall application. You can see how beautiful that looks there. Look at that. Isn't that brilliant? I mean, everyone is going to be using this machine for different reasons, to make different things, to be creative in different ways, for personalization. Is it going to be something that you'll turn into a small business? Um, you know, when you bear in mind, businesses that start up normally face huge costs, whether it's in 
premises, whether it's a machinery or whatever, you know, you can do this at home. This could be your weekend treat, your weekend cottage industry, and it's less than, uh, well, less than 800 pounds, and it's got the potential to do up to 24 inch width products, which is, or uh, projects, which is absolutely superb. And of course, all of the software and all the designs that are in that software, you can adjust the size of them to the project that you want. Now, Anne in Greater Manchester has been in touch. Hello, Anne, good afternoon. Thank you for getting in touch. She says, hi, does the machine have Christmas designs in its memory? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, I thought you were. Absolutely. So right now, some of the big designs are, obviously we have Halloween coming up mm -hmm. and then Christmas. Can we have a little look at some yeah, of the designs? Yeah. Is that all right? Because we've yeah. only seen a few. Absolutely. So let's have a little scroll through because lots of you are probably wondering. So let's go to holidays and seasons. Can you see my screen already or no? We've okay. just lost connection to your laptop. Everything, oh, so. did we? Um, we'll try and can get we that flip sorted. it around and I show you guys? Is that okay? Yeah, you can do it that way. Yeah, yeah. Can you zoom in here? There it is. Okay, so I can go to s holidays and seasons, and then mm -hmm. we go to winter. Yeah. Okay, and then we have here Christmas. Okay, it's because I notice I have flowers selected in the in yeah. the search. So of course, if we don't have flowers for Christmas, let's go ahead and remove that. Okay. And now you have a lot of the go. different Christmas designs here. Have a lot of cute ones, different ones that you can layer as well. One really nice aspect of the EasyWeed that we haven't really covered is the fact that you can put one layer on top of the other to create multicolor designs like you see here. Like these? Exactly. Wow. So you're not limited to one color? No. How cool is that? Yep. So basically, yeah, there are different categories with different images that you can resize. And like uh, Rudy was just saying, you can then use different color um, vinyl really effectively. I mean, that elephant, unbelievably, is made up from so many different colors of vinyl, just bit by bit by bit. It's, like, it's almost like paper pieces, but with vinyl. It is, it is. And I'm gonna show you a cool trick also that we can, how to do this to avoid any of the material shrinking on you. Right. So that's very important. The material is very thin, it's 90 microns which is a very, very thin product. That means that when, once it's applied, it's very, very hard to feel on the, on, the, on, the text, uh, on the textile, all right? But what happens is with thin materials like this, at 150 degrees, they tend to also shrink. Right. Just like the fabric will shrink. Mm -hmm. so the first time you wear a cotton t-shirt, you throw it in the washer, you dry it, it yeah. typically shrinks. It has. This happens also under the heat press. Right. So the product has to be adaptable to the heat. And remember, the vinyl has got a great pe pe pedigree. I can't mention brand names or anything like that, but you think of some of the uh, most well-known fashion houses, for example, designer fashion houses. Uh, they're very often using uh, the Caesar vinyl. Um, sports tops, sports shirts with numbers and names, top football clubs, very often are using the Caesar vinyl as well. So if it's good enough for them, it's good enough for me and it's good enough for you at home as well. So if you want to buy any of the vinyl today, remember it will be compatible with other cutting machines as well, all right? So it's not just for the Caesar cutting machine. Obviously it's a perfect match, but if you want to use the vinyls, um, we've got the holographic and the glitter coming up fairly soon. You can use those in other cutting machines as well. If you just want to try the vinyl side of things, if you've already got a cutting machine at home. Okay, I think we've got connection to your laptop we, again. Okay, so let's go back to the design. Look and yeah, yeah, absolutely. And you got me excited with the two colors, so I'm gonna show, I'm gonna, okay. I'm gonna adapt a little bit to the training, <laughs> to right. the showing. All right, so you can see a lot of different designs. Now, the great thing, let's say I choose, let's go to this one right here, for example, the Happy Holidays. Let's open the design. Now, the beautiful thing is I have my, des my, my design I'll be using next. Mm -hmm. Again, with this particular design here, I can ungroup it all, so these are various colors, and you can now adapt. Oh, right. So it's very, it's all adjustable. You can edit all the designs in there because they are SVG files. Right. So these are all what we call vector files that can be um, adjusted. You can change, for example, if I want to zoom in here. Let's zoom in a little bit. Mm -hmm. We can change the, you know, you, let's grab this area here, and you can change the text. You can change the shapes, the lines all adjustable in, um, in designs that can be edited. And remember, you on. can be doing this designing away from the machine. Yep. Um, you could be doing it maybe if you've got a weekend away or on a long coach trip or a long train journey yep. or something like that. So, you know, you could be doing the designing away from the machine. Then when you get back, reconnect it to the machine, uses Wi-Fi. 
Uses Wi-Fi, yep. yep. Rather than Bluetooth, yep. Wi-Fi. And then uh, the design that you've made, you can then cut out. Yep. So you could be designing on the move and doing all the cutting when you get home. But you know, when you think about what this machine's capable of doing, it's got a very, very, very narrow footprint. Obviously, it's got the lovely length to it, which is a 24-inch cutting surface, but it's incredibly compact, very stylish, as you'd expect uh, from uh, a company that's got its roots in Vicenza in Italy. You know, the design aspect of it is just as important as the quality of what it does. But all of the vinyls are produced in Italy itself. So that's another reason why they're so glamorous and also such good quality too. Um, and the machine will be with you in the next few days if you order it today. We don't have anywhere near as many of these as we would like. Um, and a vast quantity, a high percentage of the stock we had has already been allocated and also been reserved. So those of you that have ordered this already, all I can say is congratulations. It will be on its way to you straight away. You should get it in the next day or two. And then you can start playing because you can't really go wrong with this, can no, you? Not, absolutely not. And you can have a lot of fun with it. Yeah. I mean, what other type of project you can really go from idea to design to cut to application to creativity? I mean, yeah. it's beautiful. That's a really good way of looking at it, absolutely. Yep. I mean, we've got lots of um, objects in front of us here. We've got the phone cover, we've got the bag for life, we've got the gym gear as well. And remember, gym you know, yep. this vinyl goes through the paces, goes through its paces with uh, sportsmen and women uh, probably every day of the week. Yep. And it's that durable and that not the gym, the, uh, the sportsmen and women using it every day of the week and you know, regularly getting it washed, going through muddy conditions, all that sort of thing. You know, this, this, this vinyl is designed to last. It really, it is, really yeah. is. And I mean, you can see, uh, this is actually a particular product that I, I bring quite often to different um, showings and, and it's a little bit dirty, you can see there. But it's because I bring it to a lot of my demonstrations and right. the first thing they want to do is stretch it. <laughs> yeah, it's not it's, it's the It's the first thing they will do is stretch that material. And you can see it really does hold but other things, you know, even for for your dog. Yeah. Right there, you can personalize it. How cool is that? Now, this is something I bought at the Chinese store, of course. Right, yep. A couple euros. But, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you can see how, how wonderful that can come out. But, of course, around us here as well, we've got wall art. Uh, we've even got a personalized eye mask to get a good night's sleep. We've got a <laughs> journal that's been personalized on the front there as well. And you can also make up your own designs, you said, can't you? Absolutely, absolutely. So you can, you can create your own designs. You can bring in designs from outside an image and convert it to be able to cut like we did. Can we show that? <clears throat> Check this out. This is this one I love to show because it's really, really cool. Oh, can, well. You want me to walk it this way? Or? Right. Yeah, this okay. one's fine. So this is actually the Easy Weed. Okay. Right. This was a an image of a dog. I converted it over to a cut file and just placed it on, on paper. Wow. Yeah. So it can actually go on paper as well. And this is a cool way to customize it. Wow. That's it. Look, you can feel it. I mean, it's... Oh, yeah. How cool is that? Looks like a photograph, but in actual fact, it's yeah. the, uh, the Easy Weed vinyl. It's the black and white tone look that looks really, really cool. So you're gonna have so much fun, not only with the machine, but also the software as well. And I dare say everybody that buys this machine will use it totally differently for different things as well. But now you've got that potential to cut up to 24 inches width. Uh, it's brilliant. NW9G80, okay, NW9G80, 799 pounds. Uh, but remember, we don't expect you to pay that in one go. You can if you want to, if you're able to do that and you want to, that's fine. But if you'd rather have the split pay, we've got it on five interest-free split pays. That means you only pay 169.80 today, uh, plus the PMP of 395, and this brilliant machine will be on its way, and you should have it in the next couple of days from us here at Hobby Maker. Okay, more to come, including the other vinyl that we haven't shown you yet. Yep.
Talking with Rudy here uh, from Caesar, and when you actually think about it, two hours on TV sounds like a long time, but it goes quick, doesn't it? It's flying by. It's flying <laughs> by. I almost forgot I was thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> and Rudy's got another show later on this evening as well, one hour later on with Zena yes. and Rudy. Uh, now, we've already shown you some of the vinyls. All the sizes of the vinyls are exactly the same, okay? 30 by 50 centimetres, which if you're an inch person means 12 inches wide. Um, and we're going to show you the holographic. Everyone loves holographic. Well, I mean, everybody loves special effects. Yeah. I mean, this is what's in right now, special effects. How, how can we stand out? As human beings, we want to stand out always, right? Totally. We don't want to do black and white. I know we mentioned those were the popular ones for easy weed but the reality is we all want to stand out yeah right so these are the products that will help you do that now although they're holographic will they actually work on the same surfaces fabric and all that it, now the holographic is a bit more rigid right so you do have to and I'll sh show the settings over there momentarily um, but it will work on cotton polyester and you'll notice even with the um, the eye cover that I have over there, that was the holographic. Okay. I have the book. We can show the, the items there when we come back, but okay. we have different types of substrates that you can actually apply to that are hard surfaces as well. Okay, now the fuchsia is where we're gonna start. So remember, all of these are gonna be the same price. Uh, $7.99 for a, for a 50 by 30 centimeter roll. And bearing in mind, a lot of you are gonna be using these maybe for names and sentiments and that sort of thing. You can get so many things out of one roll for under eight pounds. But look at that pink, that fuchsia is just off the charts. It's every shade of pink and red you can think of, a bit of purple in there as well. It's like thousands of little gemstones. Well, the beautiful thing is, it really depends on how the light hits it. So you have the iridescent finish, once the light hits it from an angle, then you have a really beautiful effect. Yeah. Almost like a, like a gem or a rhinestone. Absolutely. Where it can, you can see the different types of um, gradients on it. I mean, it could be your name that you want to cut out and have it in holographic fuchsia, why not? Um, again, for personalization, these really are gonna stand out brilliantly, whether it's on journals, books, scrapbooks, anything like that. Um, uh, maybe you've got an iPad cover or a phone cover that you wanna personalize, because uh, everybody where I, where I am has got the same phone. And if, you've, if you're in an office and there's five of you sat at the desk and everyone's got exactly the same phone, how often do you pick up the wrong phone by mistake, <laughs> go home with someone else's phone? Personalize them, make them stand out, make them different. $7.99 for your fuchsia. Then we've got the aqua. Now this is gorgeous. If you love your blues, if you're thinking Caribbean, you're thinking blue sky, blue sea, look at that. You're making, there. Me, you're making me think of home. <laughs> I was born in Cuba, you know? Oh, were you? Yeah, yeah, oh, wow. yeah. So, I mean, you're talking about the Caribbean, then I'm there. <laughs> I thought you were Italian. No, 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 no. <laughs> No. <laughs> okay, Cuban. No, Cuban, brilliant. yeah. Ah, brilliant. No, I thought, I thought you come from America, but were born in Italian. Oh. No, actually, I was born in Cuba, moved to America, then came to Italy. Then came to Italy, yeah, right, yeah. gotcha. So. Well traveled. Well, I guess so, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> 7 then for your aqua, if that's the, uh, the colorway you'd like to go for. All of these holographics are exactly the same design and pattern. You've just got that, what looks like sprinkled gemstones all over it, but it's a perfectly smooth um, vinyl as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, then we go from the aqua to the silver. Oh, wow. This is gonna be a popular one, always popular in our cardstock, so I'm sure it's gonna be just as popular in our vinyls, but look at all those colors you've got in there. That's blue and yellow and green and a bit of pink in there too, but overall silver. All of them. Yeah, Just choose color. a rainbow and throw it in there. <laughs> Absolutely. So again, yeah, if you're personalizing, writing names, sentiments, anything like that, or doing bigger projects from the software you get with your machine from your, uh, from your Caesar, these are gonna go a long way. KB9G41, I'm actually, maybe the silver and gold together, that would be under 16 pounds, wouldn't it? Yeah, it'd be 15.98 if you wanted gold and silver together. That's a phenomenal price, actually. Yeah. That's phenomenal. Really good. So we've got some great deals here today with the vinyl. And don't forget, just because you haven't got the Caesar, unless you have. If you have, congratulations. But in case you haven't, you've got another type of cutting machine. They're all good, but of course this one's bigger, gives you more potential. These will still work in your other uh, cutting machines that you've got either from us or from elsewhere. They still will work perfectly. If you love the idea of having that superior quality vinyl that's used in top end fashion houses and for sportsmen and women, um, it has to be durable in those circumstances. Well, this is the quality we're talking about here from Caesar, manufactured in Italy, $7.99 for your gold. Now the next two, actually, the last one and the next two, Christmas. <laughs> red, green, Christmas, gold. Yep. Yep. Um, so red, green, gold, if that's something you're thinking about. We did have some questions about are there Christmas um, images on the software? The answer is yes. It's a whole category. So think about cutting those images or some of them out with gold or mixing the colors up. Yep. I mean, you have Christmas here and you have also New Year's. So 
yeah. with the gold and, and the silver. Yeah, true. Yeah. So if you wanted four, that would be under 30, 32 pounds? Yeah, no. Yeah, under 32 pounds. So that's uh, NZ9G82 for the red. And then lastly, the green. There's, there's reflection and a few colours in the green and in the red, but not quite as many as in the silver. You've got blue and green, light green, dark green, uh, like a tealy turquoise colour in there as well. So again, they're all 30 by 50, exactly the same size. And you can use an iron. Obviously, we've got an industrial kind of T-shirt press here for quickness in the studio. But an ordinary iron with the steam turned off will do the job. But just follow the instructions on the, uh, on the rolls. Then, what about glitter? Uh, I mean, the glitter. What can you say about glitter, right? It can't go wrong. It speaks for itself. Absolutely. Now, has this got a, like a rough texture to it? It or? does. Right. It does. It okay. does. I mean, not kind of compared to sandpaper mm -hmm. a bit, mm -hmm. but it's a beautiful finish. The beautiful thing about the glitter, even if you're cutting with the real mail, you will not have any issues damaging the blade right. or damaging the material, um, even though it is a rough texture. It's very, very easy to cut. And if you are going for the machine, by the way, you are going to get three blades, one for uh, like your themed mm -hmm. vinyl, like the glitter and the holographic, and the other two are for? For the thicker products, like, right. or excuse me, for the thinner products, like the Easy Weed, cardstock, things like that. Okay, cool. So it's a 45 degree blade, and when you say the degree is basically the angle of the tip of the material of the blade that helps you cut through whether it's the thicker material or if you have a thinner material you can use less force in this blade okay now this one's called twilight so if black's a little bit too dull for you then this has got the greens and purples and blues in there as well and this is all heat activated again it's it is in the same it way. is it is and the nice thing about it is um we have the traditional black but this one is really beautiful because the actual glitter the sparkle effect that's in embedded it into the actual material is more of a rainbow mm -hmm. glitter. Mm -hmm. So it really gives it a beautiful pop, when, especially when the sun hits it or light hits it, you see that really, really stand out. Perfect. So that's your twilight. Mm -hmm. 9.99 for the twilight glitter. And then we've got the blush. Yep. So this is a beautiful kind of claret red, isn't it? Really lovely. Again, a gorgeous color for Christmas, but for any other occasion too, Valentine's, whatever. Whatever the occasion, it's gonna be perfect. 9.99. And it's gonna make him a blush, so. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Cheesy jokes. GZ9G40. GZ9G40 is the product code for your blush. This one's called Lagoon. Mm -hmm. Oh, I do like this. This one's well. beautiful, yes. Oh, it's like a turquoise, but then you've got green, purple in there as well. Wow. It's hard to explain, actually. It's hard to describe it. You just have to really see it for yourself to really yeah. understand it. I'm kind of thinking like mermaid's tails. Mermaid's that sort of tail, thing. yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. That's Perfect a good color for that sort of thing. $9.99, imagine that on denim or on a t-shirt or on um, a bag for life with the design that you've selected from the software that you're gonna get with the machine today, beautiful. I like that idea, the denim, for example, the denim jackets on the back, look yeah. gorgeous with this type of material yeah. and they're really, really pop. Absolutely. Well, we've got to have um, a gold as well. This one's called yep. Tawny though, we call it Tawny, but it's uh, definitely a goldy color. Isn't that gorgeous? Kind of champagne maybe? Again, back to New Year's, not a bad color for it. Yep, actually that's a really good idea. Bring out the New Year's in style. Yeah, champagne glasses cut out of this. Again, on uh, what you're wearing or indeed what's gonna be decorating the table, maybe napkins, table runners, things like that. Personalization, there's, it, there's big, big business. I mean, if you go on, online on the internet, there are certain websites that offer personalization. You always end up paying a premium for that service. You could be the person offering that service. Absolutely. Like you keep talking about the cell, the phones. I mean, the iPhone 15, I believe, just came out. Tomorrow. What an opportunity to jump on board and start personalizing all the different accessories. Mm. I mean, business right there in itself. Absolutely. Yep. Yeah. And then after Tawny, we're going to go purple. The purple is beautiful too. There you go. The Especially color with Halloween of creativity. Up. Yeah. And Halloween's coming, so. It is. Yeah. Per perfect color, Halloween. 9.99. YS9G07. <laughs> And then the last one is, look at this blue. This is royal blue, wow. Gorgeous, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. So product code for this one, DQ9G03. DQ9G03 will get you a 50 by 30 roll of top quality heat transfer vinyl from Caesar, manufactured in Italy. Top, top quality, 9.99. Um, that's DQ9G03. Okay, now we've got about half an hour left on the show. 
So we've shown you all the vinyls that we've got available. We'll be, we, we will have all the other vinyls going forward on the website as well, uh, which is hobbymaker.co.uk. Have a little look there and also take this opportunity to check out on your machine because the stock is going very, very quickly. Half the stock has now gone. I know on shows like this, I've been doing this job long enough to know that the, the longer we spend talking about it, the more and more of you think about it. And then towards the end of the show, you very often think, Do you know what, I'm going to get that. So we're expecting it to get even busier in the next half an hour. If you want your Caesar, uh, beautiful cutting machine, the Romeo, which is debuting today here at Hobby Maker. Check out your baskets, back in a tick. Our call center is based in the UK and available 24 seven. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker. Welcome back on this really special afternoon. Um, Rudy's here from Caesar, and uh, it's not Caesar, it's Caesar, definitely. <laughs> we all thought it was Caesar, but it's not, um, as in Caesar salad. Uh, Rudy's here basically to talk us around this amazing cutting machine, which um, you can find elsewhere in the UK. We're not saying it's exclusive to us, but what we can give you today, remember, this is the game changer. We can give you another 50 pounds off what it would be elsewhere. So it's, I think, 849 somewhere else. It's 799 with us today. I know that's a bit of money to think about spending in one go that's why our bosses have agreed very rarely do they do this but they've agreed five way split pay normally maximum would be four so today we can give you five on this that's 116 or 159 80 sorry 159 pound 80 your first split payment of five you pay the first one today plus your pmp of 395 next one in four weeks next in eight and so on until you've paid the five payments but it could be that you're buying this as a christmas gift for someone someone that said oh if ever we see the uh, the caesar machine i'd really like that and you're thinking yeah, in your dreams. I can't afford £800 in one hit like that. Spread the cost. It would be paid off. Where are we now? We're September, aren't we? So September, October for payment two, uh, November for pay payment three, December. So by January, just after Christmas, by January next year, this will be fully paid off. Um, so you can help to stagger the payments and, and pay it over a period of time. And the price is locked. OK, that price isn't going to go up if you choose split pay or anything like that. It's locked at seven nine nine and uh, no interest to pay. You get the spare blades. You also get a mat, a 12 by 12 cutting mat, um, which you can use for things like your cardstock and that sort of thing. But to be honest, you probably won't need the cutting mat very often because the good grip rollers you've shown us. Absolutely. Uh, we haven't used it at all today. No. Oh, and that's the beauty of it, right? Yes, you can. You have it there for a little bit of a security, mm -hmm. but in reality, the, the the one advantage, one of the biggest advantages, is the pinch rollers to be able to work with different size materials, different types of materials, without the need to always go back to the mat. We're being asked, can you do more than one design at a time, or do you have to cut each one individually? <laughs> in that case, you would need a mat. Right. You would just have to lay it and place it on the actual uh, design space in a certain way that you can cut different colors, different okay. materials, yes. Got gotcha. you. Okay, so it's it can just be a, done, just use the mat. It can. Yeah. Use the mat and just, and a lot of it will come down to actually placement in the software. Okay. And remember, the software comes with it, that's included, and it gives you um, the edit the editable side of things. So you can change the size of things, shuffle things around, do them portrait, landscape, that sort of thing. But also importantly, you've got 3000 images in different categories in its memory on the software, ready to go. You can add things that you've already got. If you've got cutting files on USBs, there's a USB port on the back of the machine. So you can plug that in as well. So you're not losing any of those. Um, and also from a personalization point of view, how you spell a name in an unusual way or whatever, it's all doable on the PC. You will need a computer, whether it's a desktop or whether it's a laptop, um, and it works. You can actually do the designing away from the machine itself, yep. can't you? Absolutely, yes. So. Absolutely, so, and that's a great thing. You don't need the Wi-Fi or the internet to actually create the designs, no. whether it's text, whether it's adding on to designs that you already have saved or purchased from a different site. 
it can all be adjustable and edited there without the, uh, without the, the internet. But you do need the Wi-Fi, obviously, for your computer to talk to the cutting machine. Wi-Fi, right? or you can also use the cable, whichever one you prefer. Right. Exactly. Okay. exactly. In this particular case, we're using cable just because it's right there. It's easy. So. Because sometimes in the studio with the Faraday cages and things, sometimes the signal gets a little bit disrupted. So that's what why, that was why my fear. That was my yeah. fear. And it already happened with the, the, the sharing of the yeah. screen. So yeah. I didn't want to have any issues with that, especially on a live where exactly. anything can happen. Okay. Um, I do want to show you something because you kind of brought it up and it was something I had kind of hidden, but you already mentioned it. So I want to show you how easy it is to apply and decorate something like a, a napkin, a paper napkin. Oh, no. So I have well, a, a fabric little, napkin, a yeah. paper napkin. Oh. Yeah, this is, no, 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 this is actually paper. Okay. You can even show them. I mean, you can, I mean, maybe it's just because I'm strong, but you can see it rips, mm -hmm. right? <laughs> <laughs> so I have a design already pre-cut here. It's a little pumpkin that also comes with the designs. Yep. So it's in the design library. Okay. But check out how easy it is to, let's say you want to decorate, maybe you want to do something special now that Halloween's coming. You want to do, you're throwing a party and you want to do something different, yep. unique. You can also use the, the glitter, the heat transfer vinyl. In this particular case, we're using the, um, I believe it is the Black uh, Lagoon. Okay. Okay. So, so that's the glitter vinyl. That's the glitter vinyl. Yep. yep, yep. Just because you mentioned it earlier, mm -hmm. doing it on fabric, let's do it on paper so you can also see how you can do that. Okay. Always with a little bit of heat. Now I'm going to increase the pressure. The reason for it is a very thin material. Yep. And the nice thing is you only have to do a few seconds. This is not something I'm going to wash. No. Right? <laughs> so all I have to do is just want, I just want it to adhere and check this out watch boom hot peel oh look at that you can see there's no rip on the paper so that's really really wonderful now think about you doing names names personalization for and look at the color that's beautiful <laughs> look at that look at that look and at you can really great. see how vivid the sparkle is off the off the glitter as well yeah. really lively so think about doing this for a party or you're doing a wedding for example and you're doing the gold with the names or the, the table toppers with the paper. I mean, there's so many options. You can yeah. just go on and on and on and on. I mean, I always think, you know, if you are mentioning the word wedding, you can usually add a couple of zeros on the end of the cost <laughs> of whatever it is that you are actually having done. So it, it, whether it's personalized stationery, napkins on the table, that sort of thing, personalized or decorative table runners, all of those things can be really enhanced and, and made really unique by using a machine like this yeah. today. And if you've not met Romeo before, that's not, this is, this is Rudy, not Romeo. <laughs> this is Romeo. Um, it's the first cutting machine I've ever seen that's got a 24 inch cutting mouth. I mean, most cutting machines are 12 inch, aren't they? 12 inch, yep. Yeah. So, the, yes. So this is double the size. Double the size, double the work, double the, 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 the efficiency. And, and double the impact yep, because you can have things 24 inches wide, signs uh, above the top table at a wedding or whatever it might be, using it for business actually offering to personalize. Our, our, our fantastic Julie, who works in the office that comes on and does lots of cutting machines with us here at uh, Hobby Maker. She, for friends and family, does personalization all the time. She put something out on Facebook the other day about um, Harry, the pop star, um, <laughs> Harry Styles style glasses for parties, for kids and things like that. So there's all sorts of things you can do when you own a machine like this with the software like Check this. Check this out, this is a nightgown. Again, going back to the wedding theme. Oh yeah. You know, before wedding night, but check, the, the, this is rose gold with a pink finish. Look how beautiful that looks. Look at that. That looks great, right? So personalized with the, let, with the first initial. Yeah. And a little bit of a flower effect there. This is something really wonderful. And remember, not all vinyls are the same quality. As I said to you before, some of the most iconic design fashion houses in fashion around the world use this vinyl from Caesar, um, and top football and uh, sports players that have their names on their backs and numbers very often, not all of them, but very often quite a few of them actually have transfers on their outfits from Caesar that are actually manufactured from Caesar vinyl. So you know that you're dealing with the finest quality vinyl here that are designed to last and last and last, and also not look rubbish after a few washes. Absolutely. You know what I mean? They're gonna look crisp and, and professional. Can you imagine you can go from a napkin all the way to a professional fashion brand or sports team. Yeah. Incredible, right? That's, that's versatility, brilliant. that is versatility. Yeah. And <laughs> okay. most brands can choose from whatever Absolutely. companies around the world, and they Absolutely. choose you, which is great. You said it, not I. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, so I think we should give it another, just another test run for those of the, every, for those of the viewers that have not been able to watch the machine at work. What do you think we do a two color design? Oh, one thing that we haven't yeah. touched on that you talked about earlier on was the camera feature. Where does that come in? What yes. does that do? And this is something we'll talk briefly about or more in depth about later on at the 6 p.m. one. Mm -hmm. But the camera is what allows you to do the print and then cut solution. It gives you the precision that you want when you're doing designs that have 
multicolor that you're printing on, whether it's a sublimation printer or a inkjet printer right. to create full color designs. Okay. So it will allow you to cut with precision without having any of the white material showing on the outside where you do, or you're doing stickers mm -hmm. or heat transfer vinyl. That camera feature is gonna give you the best precision possible to be able to do this kind of uh, project. Terrific. Stickers is what's really, really popular right now as well. Okay. But later on, we'll show the, the easy color material, which is a vinyl that can be printed with an inkjet printer, okay. home-based printer. Superb. So that'll be coming up in the 6 o'clock yep. show. So if you've bought it already, make sure you tune in for more demonstrations at 6. You can always watch these shows back a bit later on if you've got to dash out and do something else and you miss a bit of it. doesn't matter. You can just watch them back on our website whenever you choose. Perfect. All right, so let's do a two-color design. Now, okay. I want to do, in this particular case, we're going to use the Easy Weed, and then we'll use glitter. Okay. Just two-color. Right. So I have my artwork already done. I'm just going to go ahead and send it over like we have in the, in the previous um, demonstrations. And in this case, we're using two different materials that are different in thickness. Mm -hmm. So I will have to adjust the pressure. Okay. okay. But remember, all the different um, Caesar vinyls are actually stored in the memory of the machine anyway. So exactly. if you're using Caesar glitter or Caesar holographic or whatever, you just select whichever one you're using and it, it does it. Exactly, very, very simple to go from material to material. So there's my first layer. This is gonna be the background. Right. Okay. So while I weed that one, I'll start cutting this one, mm -hmm. which is my glitter material. So you load the machine glitter down. Glitter down, exactly. Let me move this pinch roll a little bit. Okay. Remember, these are the lockable wheels. It's not as easy going from the back side here. So let no. me, yeah, just getting a straight. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> so in this case, I will go back to, okay. I will go back to my settings here and I will select the glitter. Mm -hmm. So it's a thicker material. So I know it's going to increase the force quite a lot. And as always, because it's a different material, I want to do first a test cut. There we go, very easy. This is gonna ensure or assure me if the, pro, if the settings are right. The test cut is that little t-shirt. Exactly. Yep. And then maybe sometimes it can be a little bit challenging to see, but it looks like it cut just fine. Perfect, do you see that? There we go. That's what we wanna see? Yep. Okay. So now we'll move this up. In the software, I will now select the second color. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna go ahead and cut this design. Okay, mm -hmm. send this over. Now, as that's cutting, I will go ahead and weed my Easy Weed. Again, I always go back to my handy dandy trick over here with the heat press just because it makes okay. everything so much quicker and easier, especially and because we don't have that much time left. So, <laughs> If you're wondering about Easy Weed and what's that stand for, basically, when you're picking away the waste of what the machine's cut, that's what's called weeding. So this process right here, Yeah. So check this out, all in one weed. And you can see the lines here, how incredible it cut. There you go. So now we're having fun because we're cutting different colors, different materials. And you could have made that bigger, smaller? Smaller, bigger, but the idea here, and you can see with the glitter, no problem at all. Check out this text here. I mean, I want to show the detail. You can see how nice that cut that right there. Look at that. Without any, look at, look at Mama's Mini, but look at the Mama's, how well that cut it. <laughs> <laughs> and of course we have something uh... and again the glitter also has a nice adhesive yep. um, at least adhesive backing to it so it allows us to cover with a lot of detail that was quick and easy and remember you've got 3,000 designs on the software and growing and, and, and growing. growing it's and being growing. tweaked all the time <laughs> all the time um, yes. and the way you get the software basically it, it talks you around how to do that when you actually get your machine home uh, you just register your machine with the serial number each machine's got one obviously and then it knows that it's you that you've purchased it and it gives you access to the uh, the design space which is fantastic absolutely so now of course we have a onesie yep it's got to so, be a onesie <laughs> it's got to be a onesie right all right so very important here i want to leave Kind of burnt myself there. It happens. It happens in this industry. <laughs> yeah. So here we have some seams in the collar that can affect the application. Okay. Okay. So we want to make sure that. Can, let me see here. Okay. So the collar we want outside of my heat, um, our heating platinum. So we're leaving all the seams out on the outside. Now we have a two-color design. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we'll have the background, 
and we'll have the glitter, which is going to go directly on top. Okay. Which this can be done with the Easy Weed material. Right. So Easy Weed can always go on the bottom. Okay. But you cannot place glitter over glitter. No. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Okay. Yeah. So here's the real. So do you um, do one layer at a time? One layer at a time. Right. Yeah. But we're going to make life easy. Okay. And fast. All right. The advantage of the Easy Weed material that I have not covered yet is that we can actually. My OCD is kicking in. I need to be perfect. <laughs> All right, so one of the really nice advantages of the Easy Weed is what we call the one second tack rule. Right. You wanna see what that is? Yeah. Watch. One, boom. We can remove that carrier. Blimey. Now, of course, that's not adhered yet, but you that's- You said in originally 15 seconds. 15 seconds if you're doing one color. Right, oh. Right? Right. Now we're doing one second, and that's going to help us avoid any shrinkage of the material. Okay. So now I can place a second layer with no problem on top. And you can see we still have that border. And you can see it's a thin border, but if I press it for the full 15 seconds, that material is going to shrink a bit on me. Right. And that second layer might not fit correctly on top. Okay. So this is the way to avoid the shrinkage of the material. Right. Now, there's not many products out there that can be applied in just one second like that. Now, the second Impressive. layer, appreciate it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's why we wait for the last to, to show that part. <laughs> All right, so the last layer, every time you're applying two, three different colors, the last layer, you must always apply the full amount, so okay. 15 seconds. Now, this is what's guaranteeing that first layer to be applied correctly. All right? Mm -hmm. So 15 seconds, 150, very simple, very quick. So in 16 seconds, remove all the explanation in between, you can actually apply a two-color design in 16, 17 seconds. Brilliant. And bear in mind, if you haven't got one of these presses, which I, I dare say you probably haven't got, a standard iron is fine. Yep. Just obviously make sure that you're applying a bit of pressure. And if it's not that much pressure you're applying, just apply a bit more heat for a bit more time, but turn the steam off. Check out those colors <sighs> with the silver backing. That looks really, really wonderful. Look, that looks so professional. That's what this is giving you, professional finishes. Nothing looks handmade, nothing looks, you know, homemade. Everything looks beautifully produced because the quality of the vinyls are stunning and the quality of the cutting machine is really stunning as well. Today's the first day we've actually had Caesar here and this is the <laughs> Romeo machine. Rudy is our guest. He's come all the way from Vicenza. That's where the company is based. And that's where actually all of the wonderful vinyl rolls are manufactured. Uh, and this machine today is debuting here. As I said to you before, elsewhere, you'd be paying 50 pound more than this. So why, why do that? I don't know where the other place that retails this gives you interest-free credit or not. I don't know, but we do. And it's on five split pays. We never do five split. Well, I think we've done it twice, maybe two or three times since we've been on air in the last 18 months have we actually done five split pays. So it's reserved for very select products. We want you to experience how fantastic the Romeo machine is. Um, you've got your money back guarantee, of course, as well. Not that you're going to need it because it's a superb <laughs> machine, but it will be with you. There's a limited quantity available to us this afternoon. Well over half that stock has gone already. And we always, when we do shows like this that are two hours long and involve a little bit of money, it's always towards the end of that last two hour show. People sit there and talk and watch and work out their finances and think, and it's towards the end of the show that suddenly we get a surge on the phone, surge on the website and things sell out very quickly. So whatever you do, you gotta think about it, I get that. But one PMP for the whole day of 395, it's a big box, a really well designed box as well. Everything about this product is classy and well manufactured. It's got a good look, it does a great job, it's got a great history. Thank you um, so much, I appreciate the compliment. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> and, the, and the vinyl, remember, is used in some of the best fashion houses and sports facilities around the world and in the UK too. So, you know, that combination of a great machine and great quality vinyl, the vinyl's only $7.99, $8.99 each roll, depending on which one you go for, but they're all there. And these will be regularly in stock on our website going forward as well. But the machine itself, we haven't got a bottomless pit of stock. We've got a limited quantity. When that's gone, that is it for the time being. Hello to Florence in Somerset. Hello to Gwen in Buckinghamshire as well, falling in love with the idea of this <laughs> today. Um, I, get, I get it's not for everybody. Not everyone can afford to spend 800 pounds, but if that five split phase is making it more of a thing that you you're more of a thing that you're thinking, well, you know what? I can make and sell 
for 160, 159, 80 today, I could be making and selling in the next couple of weeks, getting my money back for the next payment. Absolutely. Think Absolutely. of it Absolutely. like that. It's beautiful, yeah. Yeah, with Absolutely. all the craft fairs and Christmas shows coming up over the next couple of months. Well, this is 10 shirts, you can sell 10 shirts and you can already pay for that first payment. Absolutely. Yeah, we've got 10 minutes left. 10 minutes left, you, really? want, to, you want to finish it with a wow factor? Yeah, go on. All right, so we talked a little bit about the holographic, which yep. has a really beautiful iridescent finish. Now, yep. one style that's really coming back in is the rhinestone effects. So this is something that was really, really popular back in a few years back, and it's kind of coming back again. Mm -hmm. It's coming back in very, very hard. Um, so if you don't have the ability to do rhinestones, this is another option. Okay. okay. So I've already cut the design because I figured we were gonna run out of time here, but I've cut it again with the Romeo. Now this product can be challenging, but I wanna show how well the Romeo was able to cut that design. And you can see here. Oh, wow. Yeah, you see what's happening here? Yeah. So look at, look at how beautiful, and these are all, all little holes, let me go ahead and adjust it here. Always with right. my test cuts. Yes. Okay. And this is another design off the software? No, this was my custom design. I oh, made this okay. one, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But just proves you can. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, yep, exactly. So look at that, look how beautiful that looks. You can see the color is absolutely stunning. Absolutely. Okay. And don't throw that away, you can still yeah. get use out of that. Yeah, you can use it as a stencil, you can just apply it as it is. Actually, yeah, that just as it is, it's beautiful, yep. the positive and the negative. Yep. Yeah, why not? So let's, uh, now we're gonna do this on a black shirt so it really makes that design pop, okay? This, had, is, this I, is gonna be amazing. Yeah, it's gonna be great. But I had, I had to show a little bit that, I, that you can also design in the software right. um, beyond just what's already in there. And you can also import files that you have purchased from other software. Yep. If you have an SVG file, for example, that you have purchased or you have created elsewhere, you can also import it into the software. That's good to know. Yeah. Yeah, we can sit here and actually have a full demonstration, hour-long demonstration on just the software. Yeah. And you can play with that. You know, if you've got a laptop that you want to take to work with you, and maybe you have like we work on an industrial estate here and there's not really many places to go at lunchtime. So most people stay here, have lunch at, at the desk. So you could be actually designing while you're at work on your laptop. Then when you get home, connect, connect it with Wi-Fi wi -Fi to Romeo and cut all those yep. images out that you've designed during your coffee break or, or lunch you, break. Yeah, or you can save it on your computer. It's no problem. You can also export the file. Yep. So yeah. let's go here. Okay, now the holographic is a bit unique because we do have to once applied, we have to let it cool off for a few seconds, mm -hmm. but the effect that this is gonna give you is really, really incredible. Always 15 seconds, 150 degrees, 155 degrees. Yep. Again, with the home iron, the, the settings do change a bit, but always in the label, you'll find the instructions to apply the products with the, um, with the home iron as well. Okay, beautiful. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and cool off this design just a bit. I can't believe how reflective it is, the right? holographic is. No, no, it's so wonderful. vivid. And I like this design because, I, as I mentioned, the holograph can be a little bit rigid. So by doing a design like this where it's not connected, yeah. it really makes the design on the t-shirt feel way lighter and not as heavy. Yeah. You can see here, check this out. It's not missed one, is it? All of those little dots, yeah, yeah, all intact. Yeah, yeah, perfect. You can see there, there's no... Look at the holographic. Yeah, that, that's a testament to the material as well, but you can see that design looks absolutely... I mean, that really that does strange. look like you've encrusted it with rhinestones. That's the quality of the holographic vinyl. If you want the holographic vinyl, remember, was that uh, 9 dollars 9 dollars for the holographic vinyl if you want it. Each sheet, remember, is 50 by 30 centimeters, which is 12 inches uh, across. There it is. If you love the look of this and it's you want up. that in your life, who wouldn't? Think about it. In the past, you would have to do this all by hand, one by one. Oh. With a vinyl cutter, the right material, and your heat. You can create some really, really wonderful personalized t-shirts. Maybe you're in a group or <laughs> I don't know whether you're a, a group of cheerleaders or whatever it might be that you need to have not necessarily a uniform, but a look that's mm -hmm. uniform. And you want to kind of get every member in that group, all 12 of them wearing the same things for competitions or whatever it might be. Something like this is going to pay for itself. If you go and get things personalized and made specially bespoke for you, it could cost you a small fortune. You know, to get this machine gives you versatility and flexibility. You know the beauty about dance teams, cheerleading, they never wear the same uniform twice. It's always, they mm. always if you're doing a competition, typically they need different uniforms every competition. Yeah. That's a full business right there. Absolutely. You can add, I don't know if you see here, the headbands, which is really, really popular. You can put glitter on these, you can put holographic on these. 
I mean, you got the full outfit. And do you know what? The more people that know what you do and what you can do for them, mm -hmm. the more inquiries you're going to get. Because talking to Julie upstairs, she's being inundated every, every time <laughs> by people in the office. Can you do this for me? Can you yeah, make that for me? Um, and, and out and about as well. Yep. People in her road, people in her area know that she can personalise using these machines and she gets loads of requests and I think does quite well from it. I don't know, but I've not asked her that. It's free advertising. Yeah. Free advertising, always have your business card available because you never know when that next big job is going to arrive. That's a really good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, remember, there's one more show with this today at six o'clock with Zena and Rudy. If you've got any questions, it's probably a bit too late now to send them in to us. But if you send them in, we can get them answered in the six o'clock show. Um, the main thing to realize is that the stock of this, we haven't got as many as we would ideally like. Um, well over now, half of the allocated stock that we had for this afternoon show has gone with more people of interest coming through and putting this in their baskets. I think the big deal about this is, is the main USP's unique selling points to me is the fact that you've got the 24 inch width, which is about double what I'm used to yep. seeing. Fast, yep. precise, quiet, quiet, and integrated settings with five split pays mm -hmm. and a 50 pound discount compared to elsewhere that's selling this in the UK at the moment. It's got great classy looks it's incredibly well manufactured the vinyl is in a league of its own when it comes to quality as used by top fashion houses i can't say the names but <laughs> you'd know them if i could um and also top football teams men and women's football teams with their numbers and their names on the back it's very often sees a vinyl that's used so you know that you're using the top quality and thousands of hobbyists around the world as well yes yes really thank you it's been great to meet you Dave, thank you so much for the hospitality. You ah, made this nope. made my first experience on national TV quite a good one. Well, that's good so to I appreciate know. it. That's and good and to know. much easier. Absolutely brilliant. Well, you'll be thank back you with so Zena a bit later on at six o'clock. Remember, <laughs> check out your baskets. If you do go through and uh, decide to put one in your basket, maybe in half an hour and it says sold out, all I can do is apologize. But at the moment, if you want one, put it in your basket. There is enough to go around at the moment. But you will not... Be disappointed with this invest investment. You really will not. Florence, if you want yours, please check out your basket. We only ask you for that first split payment of 159.80. You've got your money back guarantee, of course, as well. Not that you'll want it because it's a stunning piece of equipment. And how to connect it to the software, how to download the software, that's all in the box and in the packaging. So I'll see you in a second as we continue with Hunky Dory's 15th birthday celebrations. Thank you, Rudy. Thank you, everybody. Thank you so much, Dave. Have no a great problem. one. Pleasure. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from a Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? I'm Marie here from Hunky Dory Crafts and I'm so excited because it is our 15th birthday. It starts next week here at Hobby Maker and we are so excited. We have got brand new launches, we have got exclusive offers, we've got prizes, giveaways, games and everything else in between. It is going to be fabulous. So make sure you join myself and the team here at Hobby Maker from Monday the 11th of September.
it couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Hobby Maker are proud to work alongside some of the biggest brands in the industry. Keep watching for these brands and many more here on Hobby Maker. Did you know that digital downloads are now available on the Hobby Maker website? Just pop over to hobbymaker.co.uk, go to downloadable content, choose the collection you would like to buy, and click purchase. This will be an instant payment, and once purchased, you will receive an email. Click on the link and it will take you here. Click download, and once downloaded, the file will appear in your downloads folder. Right click on the folder and click on extract all. Once extracted, open the folder, click auto run, and you're ready to craft. For more information, help, and support, go to the further details section of the purchase page. Digital Crafting with Hobby Maker. When you purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. Our call centre is based in the UK and available 24 7. Just call 0800 001 4433 or email help at hobbymaker.co.uk. It couldn't be easier to watch Hobby Maker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, on our website or on YouTube. So you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobby Maker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobby Maker gift card? Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Hi, uh, afternoon. Welcome back to uh, Hobby Maker. Great to have your company this afternoon. I've not seen you in months. It's been ages. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. Amazing. Happy birthday. I know, hunky dory. I know. 15 years. 15 years. It seems like they've been around for a lot longer than that, to be it fair. It does, doesn't it? And, and you know what? We've just been getting stronger and stronger. And obviously, that's you guys at home that love Absolutely. crafting with us. Yeah, everyone loves hunky yes. dory. Great to see back about, back with us. Now, we've got two great shows with Becca this afternoon, still celebrating the 15th birthday, of course. Uh, we've got this one coming up. Uh, have a little look. This tells you exactly what is on the way. Um, we've got a two-hour special, basically. It's Ooh. concept cards between now and four. And then deluxe craft, uh, craft pads at four o'clock this afternoon. And the concept cards in this show are back in stock, meaning they have sold out previously, okay? So those are the two birthday shows we've got. Now, what that means is, if you buy something from Hunky Dory in these shows this afternoon, you're gonna go into a draw. Now, two customers, tomorrow when we go live, will be told that they have won themselves a Hunky Dory goodie bag, like this. Now, we've got two winners to announce right now from people who shopped with us yesterday. So if you did buy anything from Hunky Dory yesterday, you are in the running to win a goodie bag, which is packed full of loads and loads and loads of Hunky Dory goodies, as you can. Uh, we'll get those names for you in a second. But I tell you what I can let you know about, because we've been seeing these over the last 
few days, the tote bags from Hunky Dory. We've been having people ask if they can actually buy the tote bags. We have. We have been absolutely inundated and we have had to absolutely beg Dan to let us have these to sell um, because obviously we, we just have a short supply for, you know, we are looking at maybe, you know, if everybody likes them, perhaps bringing them in, you know, as a line in the mm -hmm. future. But, you know, originally they were for things like, like this, the, the goodie bag and the giveaways. And we're like, but please, can we have them? And we finally well, got them. Dan actually relented and he he's did. actually <laughs> he given did. us a pretty healthy stock of these bags, which I'll give you details of in a second. Now, these are the winners of yesterday's goodie bag. I don't know what you bought, Linda Jackson or Leanne Fellon, but you have won yourself each a hunky-dory goodie bag that will be on its way in the tote bag for you in the next few days. Uh, and they, all Linda and Leanne did we had, yesterday was buy something from hunky-dory yeah. in this Huge show. Huge congrats. Brilliant, I'll pop yeah. that down here. Amazing. Now, um, if you want the tote bag, this could be your bag for life. This could be your Absolutely. shopping bag down at the supermarket. You can put it over your shoulder. The loops are long enough. Yeah. But why not? If you're a Hunky Dory fan, and I know there are thousands of you out there that are, fly the flag. Oh, yes. Absolutely. And it's so exclusive. Like I say, we've not got tons and tons of these. Nope. Um, I, I don't think we definitely won't be getting this exact one back in. Um, we, you know, who knows? They are very, very exclusive. They're hot property, aren't they? Okay. Here come the details, here comes the product code, here comes the price. Uh, totally reusable, totally washable, and you, what sort of price would you be looking at? TGHD76. TGHD76 for your very own designer hunky-dory tote bag. Have it in the car, keep it in the car, yeah. keep it in the, bonnet, uh, in the boot even. Um, yeah, just take it everywhere you go and fly the flag yep. for hunky-dory. Yep. What price do you reckon these are going to be? Hello, Vivian. Hello, Janice. Hello, Lisa. I don't um, know if we've got enough of these. We do. We have got hundreds. I'm not surprised, though, because the amount of messages that we have, please, 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 can we have the tote bag? Six ninety nine, and they're yours. We will get the messages. Can you buy <laughs> the tote bags? No, you couldn't at the time. Today, you can. So imagine going around craft fairs with this over your shoulder. Oh, wouldn't it look great? It Where'd fits loads from? of crafty goodies in there. It's the first time it's ever been able yeah. to be um, offered on Hobby Maker, and if the stock goes completely, it may never return in this guise. They might do different designs in the future or whatever. It's got the Hobby, uh, sorry, Hunky Dory logo on one side, plain on the other, and it's a really good practical size. Isn't it? Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, you could like pop, pop this in there. Yeah. Yeah, easily. And Not I think if you trimmer. can fit your trimmer in there, you can fit most of your other crafty bits in there. Absolutely. And look, there's still loads of room in there. I mean, you know, we're always being encouraged to have bags for life. And if yeah. you're buying the ones at the supermarket now, like three or four pounds a time, why not have an extra bit of luxury, something you're passionate yeah. about, a brand that you love, that you've invested in over the years, that we all love to bits. We love all the people at Hunky Dory. We love all the products of Hunky Dory. Here's your chance to get your very own oh, designer tote bag. The screen is full. Crazy. Vivian Hampshire's gone for two. Lorraine in Lincolnshire's gone for two. There's a bit of a queue on the phone lines at the moment, so bear in mind it's a free phone number. It's just the amount of time it takes to get answered. It's not going to cost you anything. 0800 001 4433. The call centre will get to you as quickly as possible. If you'd rather order on the website, there's never a queue there. Hobbymaker.co.uk for your very, very posh hunky dory it tote is, bag. It is, isn't it? Yeah. It's I'm so, so glad cute. you like it. I'm so, so glad we brought it today. Bit of a yeah. treat. It is, absolutely, yeah. Six pounds, 99 pence. Um, Size-wise, if you're wondering how big it is. Uh, like I say, uh, I, I, I use it. I use your trimmer. Uh, yeah, use my trimmer. Okay. This is this is sort of the sheet of, yeah, use my trimmer. Oh, perfect. Okay, you're looking at 35 centimetres or 13 inches yeah. by probably the same old, I thought. Uh, by 14, 14 and a half inches yeah, in, de in depth. Yeah, exactly. You can get loads in there. Get loads in there. And it's not just a handheld one. You can put it over your shoulder yeah, if you want to. 6 99 um, TGHD76. What a very, very, very busy start to the show. And you can, for convenience, roll it up and put it in your pocket. Oh, you yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Shopping Perfect shopping, shopping bag. bag. Is there anything more annoying than forgetting your shopping bag? No, I know. Just keep, I it, in your glove, it. keep, it, keep it in the glove <laughs> yes. box. You know, you, you know you've got three or four or five bag for lives at home and you yeah. get to the supermarket, I'll go buy another one now. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. So infuriating. Yeah. Really, really annoying. Okay, right, so that's a really busy start to our show. Now, we've got a whole hour of concept cards. Yeah. Now, lots of these are sellouts that we've been able to get back in stock, yeah, which is really are. good news. Yeah, 
Now, we've brought them back for the birthday. Specially had them reprinted. So this is things that we've, you know, we've made time and space on our machines in our warehouse to get these back in stock. Brilliant. Because the favourites, the absolute favourites, the best sellers, we love them, you guys love them, and they're back in. Festive diorama. Yes. That's this one. Look at this. Everything laid out in front of me here is part of the festive diorama. Now, these have been massive, absolutely mm. masses. Hundreds and hundreds of these went a few weeks ago. Been able to get them back for the show today. And you've even got the acetate, the snowflake acetate included as well. Gorgeous, isn't it? Beautiful. Now, have we got one made up? We haven't, have we? Uh, we... I, I'm not actually too sure, Dave, but they, they do, um, we, we can demo this as well. Um, we are going to be doing loads of demos to show you how easy they are to put together. Okay, you're going to be able to make 16 yeah. cards out of 16. this. And it's basically, think of it like a little mini theatre. It That's is, what isn't they are. it? Yeah. yeah. It's like a little, it's a beautiful, beautiful effect, isn't it? Again, look at the artwork on there, the foiling. Um, just they are this. absolutely stunning, aren't they? You get such a mixture of artwork in here. You've got your contemporary, you've got your classic, traditional, you've got your frosty colours, your mm -hmm. cosy colours. It's just beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. So that's what they look like. Um, so they're more of a, an ornament, or as much of an mm. ornament, as they are a card as well. You've got places to write your sentiments and all that sort of thing too. You do, yeah, absolutely. Every space is covered with beautiful, beautiful artwork, yeah. Full instructions included, but you can make 16 of them. And just to prove a point, look, yeah. there is your pictured step-by-step -step instructions. Yeah, absolutely. We do this with a lot of our concept cards, written and photographic, because we know that the two combine really well. Um, 19 99 we got them back today to celebrate the birthday. Remember, one purchase, one purchase today gets you in the draw. Gets you in the draw, and you two could win a goodie bag like the last two that we uh, gave away about five minutes ago. Yeah, just shop to win yes. with Rebecca. And she's only here for two shows today, so buy something between now and five o'clock this afternoon. And it could be you that gets the uh, winning announcement tomorrow to yes. say you've got a goodie bag on its way to celebrate the 15th birthday. Absolutely. Now, have we got one to flick through? Shall I? Uh, yeah, if we get the one, I think it's just the one off the set, Dave. Yeah, we're just going to flick that one. Okay. Isn't it beautiful, Dave? It's gorgeous. Now, these elements are the backgrounds. Now, you've yeah. got the little choir boys, you've got the snow-filled rooftops that you can see there as well. All the elements just pop out. You've got your pop-out sentiments down the bottom there. And then this is all your decoupage. Oh, I remember this. The choir boys. Aren't Absolutely. they stunning? Beautiful. Layer upon layer upon layer. Oiled, scored, die cut, everything done. Your instructions are on those sheets as well. Mm -hmm. Absolutely beautiful. Like you say, the Christmas decorations in themselves, aren't they? There we then go. you're moving over to the really cool, crisp colours here. Apologies for not having anyone made up here, but um, I thought we had them, but we haven't. But you soon get the idea. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And they are, yeah, absolutely. We're going to put Look them together them, in a second. The family there. Oh, they're gorgeous. Aren't they brilliant? Lots of sentiments as well throughout. And then? And then? Oh, the classic. Father Christmas down the chimney. There he is. Isn't that brilliant? Yeah. It's something a bit different. Rather than just making cards all the time, isn't it nice to, put, you know, to give someone or pop someone uh, something in the in the post box that's yeah, a little bit absolutely. unexpected all the uh, decoupage is numbered as well the different layers and yep. it's flecked with foil to perfection it is yeah and then this is our last one again this is quite again a nice mixture of classic and contemporary you've, you've got your sort of snow in the city and this is the one that uh, i always remember with pauline i said to her it looks like <laughs> she said well, i said it looks like amsterdam she said no it's bethlehem i thought oh no and then um, everyone else said yeah i think it does look like amsterdam i think so yeah, yeah i think yeah. it's too snowy for bethlehem this one so it's ended up being called bethlehem now i get that by i pauline. get that yeah. and yeah. then obviously you've got your vintage car how classic is that absolutely so we'll yeah, show you how to put them together in a second but this is enough to make 16 of these diorama cards and the envelopes included as well there we go. All of that for nineteen ninety nine. So it's about one pound thirty a card. Isn't that amazing? It is amazing for a, for a dimensional card, full yep. of decoupage, foiled to perfection for that price. Amazing. Sixteen cards for that price. Are you demoing that first? Yes. Or? Okay. Are we, are we are we running through? Or, or should we do the rest of them first? Of Perfect. All? Okay. Let's run through everything and then we can get it all demoed. Okay. Now the delightful yes. robins. I've lost track of how many times this particular mm, kit has sold out. Me too. And th this is new for this year as well. And we've still sold it out. 
I want to say at least three times, okay. if not four. Let me show you the sheets to start off with, because this is going to give you all the elements of the decoupage. So you've got the main elements and then the smaller, which you just layer one on top of the other. Mm. Look at these. Oh, I know. They're absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. Absolutely we have beautiful. sold hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of these. Like, they are so, so popular. So, again, super gorgeous. Easy to put together. Uh, and then these are your card blanks. So you've got all your decoupage layers. Mm -hmm. And then what you do is you just grab your card blank, pop your aperture out, and then you put that on the inside of your card. So it's like a gorgeous window, like an yep. aperture. Yeah, there you go. So, that so goes you stick in there that on like the inside. That. Yeah, you get a matching insert as well to pop that on. And then you just layer that decoupage, and then you can see that coming through that aperture, that so window. So how many cards can you make here? One, Twelve. Twelve in this one. Okay. So two of each, six colorways. So you get the red, you get the brown, the green. Look at that. And Stunning. each have got a different sort of, obviously a robin, but in a different design. So we've got the hellebore on that red one. Uh, we've got the post box, the holly. Isn't it gorgeous? I know so many friends, actually, that always each year say, I'd like anything with a robin on it. Anything please. with robins yeah. on is super, super popular. Guys that make and sell, you know that robins are going to be so, so well loved. So just really asked for. Absolutely. Yeah, 100%. So there you go. Uh, there's all the decoupage elements, yep. and you get your envelopes Match as well. Envelopes, yeah. Uh, enough to make twelve cards. Only fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. So again, that's about one pound thirty a card. Isn't again, it? you can't you can't buy anything like that no. either. You, you know. So that's BRHD 96, and buying that gets you automatic entry into the prize draw mm. for a goodie bag, which we'll announce two more winners tomorrow. Every day through the week's birthday celebrations, you could be a winner. Uh, then we're going to go to. Festive Archways. The Archways. This one. Wow. You get loads in this. You, it's a whopper, this one, isn't it? Is it is a whopper. <laughs> now, this hasn't been seen since last year. Yeah, this was brand new for 2022, but again, ever so popular. We couldn't not bring this back. So You've you got get acetate. Acetate windows. Yeah, yep. absolutely. Um, gorgeous designs throughout. Are they gorgeous. Again, you've got you you're quite festive sort of jolly saint nick santa there your christmas tree with that look at that green tartan foiled as well absolutely wow. stunning you get decoupage layers throughout you get your front door um and then you, you again you really nice cute little jolly snowman on there okay so how many cards can we make out of this one 12, 12 cards in yeah. total for 14 pounds and 99 pence i haven't actually got the uh the sheet to show you what they look like when they Again, we can demo this one okay, as well. We'll do that. No problem. Okay. Yeah. So these don't take too long to do. So this is the Honestly, adorable, scorable, a festive archway. And there's one more that we're going to talk about quickly, which is the rocking snow globes. Yes. Again, uh, we have done this before, but we've refreshed it again for 2023. Brought it back with fresh artwork, a fresh feel. Um, and again, these are so easy to put together. Um, again, we can demo this one as well. Decoupage layers throughout as well, which everybody loves there, your bases. Um, and again, if you just turn it round, Dave, I think you've oh, got... Yeah. So they, it's good though, because you see how you get the both designs on there. Um, and then they're obviously your bases and your little space for your sentiments. Perfect. Yeah. But there's, again, there's so much. Everything's done for you. All you've got to do is pop them out and just crease them. Everything's pre-scored and pre-die cut. So there we go. And again, a mixture of designs. You've got classic, contemporary, cute, fun. You know, something for absolutely every recipient here. I mean, look at these little cuties. And you also get your um, your plastic. Your domes. Yep, domes. you do, yeah. yeah. And obviously you can put shaker elements in there. Uh, if you want to, again, use them as like baubles if you have them back to back. So many ideas, Hang absolutely on. gorgeous. These are all back to front. Are we going the wrong way? <laughs> there we go. There we go. <laughs> nice mixture of gold and silver as well. Beautiful. Mm. And all will become clear when you open up the packet and start to construct them, start to put them together. But just wanted to give you all of the item numbers and prices yeah. right at the start. So if you want to stock up, lots of you have already got these, but the chances are probably, um, if you love them as much as we do, you've probably got through a few and you've probably now almost run out. So yeah. if you want to stock up today to celebrate the 15th birthday, um, the snow globes are 1499 BVHD 50. We've also got this year's exploding boxes back in stock. The festive exploding boxes. We'll be bringing these to you fairly soon. Um, but if you want them, they are on the website right now for you. Uh, if you go to hobbymaker.co.uk. Going Which to one do you do first? Demo. We're gonna, okay. Let's do the let's stick in order. We'll do the festive diorama. So okay. this is again, it's brand new for this year. So let's do this. Let me just get everything out of the bag. Have okay. we got any tote bags left? 
Oh, okay. They're, okay. they're going quickly, but we they did have a big quantity. Quickly. How right, much? let's, okay. So we're going to do this one. Absolutely beautiful. So How I'm much of the stuff has gone now? 20% oh. gone. Right, cranky. Okay. And then this one with the foiling on the front, obviously that's going to be the front because it's got all that luxurious detail. This bit that we've got covered up with tape, obviously we don't need to foil that. Okay, so what we do is we grab both our pieces here, front and back. We'll pop out this for now so that we've got that. That can go on the back. So, so easy to put together. And then let's have a look. Um, so it says decoupage here, layers A1 and A2 onto the back layer, which is this one here. So obviously I know exactly which one A1 is and A2. Which it's all printed. It's all on here. So A2 is our little snowball here. Just had to find it there for a second. So you just need to pop it out. It's all die cut for you. So you don't need to be trimming around here. And as you can see, I've already done this ahead of time because this is, to be honest, the foam pads are the bit that takes you the longest. Mm -hmm. Um, and even then, it's, you know, it's minutes. So I've got lots of foam pads on here. You'll want to be stocking up whilst it's our birthday week, whilst we've got this um, amazing chance of the giveaway on. And then what you do is you just gently pop that in place, just line them up, just nice and easy. And then I actually think we've got this one here, which I don't think is a snowball. I think it's the moon. <laughs> it's been a while since I've done <laughs> this one. Yeah, that'll go on there What's absolutely the moon? perfectly. Well, it could be a snowball. It could be, it could be. So we'll put that just up on there perfectly. And then what it says to do next is attach layer three, which is again, this nice big one here. As you can see, the layers are getting smaller and smaller mm -hmm. as we go along. Attach A3 directly to the acetate panel, which you do get included. Um, it, we give you everything, absolutely, we really do. So A3, let's pop this one out here. Again, nice and gently. You can trim off any pips if there are any. Directly to the acetate panel, so it sits centrally horizontal and the bottom of the layer is flush to the bottom of the acetate. So again, we give you really detailed instructions so you know exactly where to put things. You're not going to go wrong. And it's nice to have different things to make rather than making the same type of card all the time and you might oh, get a bit absolutely. bored with it. Yeah, 100%. They're so fun. Bit of construction, bit of fun, bit of something different. Good for the kids too, because there's no um, knives or blades involved. No, absolutely not. So we're going to start popping this together now. So what we do is just mountain and valley fold these, just, just like so. So we'll give those a nice bit of a, a good crease. So again, they're already scored for you. And you can see how this is going to come together. Mm -hmm. Again, we're just going to mountain and valley fold these scores. Absolutely perfect. Again, just giving them a nice, nice crease. I love so again, the artwork. I love the me colours. Too. The me foiling's too. superb. Isn't it beautiful? So we're going to get this on. So we want some red tape for this job. It's high tack. It's really strong. And it's got that ultimate grab. So again, stock up on this, especially with all our concept cards. Red high tack tape is just going to be your absolute best friend. Um, I'm sure we've got a nice little deal on here as well. So we'll have a look for you. We'll get well, them on the back red in. liner tape. Yeah. It's an absolute must have, isn't mm -hmm. it? Oh, yeah. Sure. And when you are using construction or making things um, like boxes and stuff like that, the stronger the tape, the better. Oh, yeah. 100%. Like I say, it can be one of those that's it's very strong. It can be a bit intimidating at first, but the more you use it, you will absolutely fall in love with it. Now you've got 10 rolls of the red liner tape, five by three, five of the three mil, sorry, and five of the six mil. Yes, yeah, so this is the six mil, a nice chunky one. And we're not talking 19.99. Look, it's going down nice. to 14.99, 25% off for all 10, one pound 50 each. Amazing, that is just such an amazing price. So we're gonna just grab that on here just nice and easy. I love that the tabs are coloured as well, so you mm. know exactly where to put them. We're going to go next on with this layer here, and then it also says to pop our next layers on the inside of the frame. So we're going to do that now. You can put your decoupage anywhere, to be honest. You can put it on this side, you can put it on there, you can put it all on the back layer, it really doesn't matter. So we're going to pop that inside the frame. So we're just going to do that now. We're just going to build up our gorgeous... Um, Father Christmas here. He just looks ready for Christmas, doesn't mm. he? And again, it's just great if you, you know, find Christmas in June with us a little bit too early. It's so great that we've planned them, you know, a little bit closer to the big day. 
I'm, I'm not surprised. Lots of you are actually multi-ordering. Janet in yeah. West Sussex is going for two. Jacqueline in Lancashire oh, is going amazing. for two as well. Maybe you bought them back in the earlier part of the yeah. year and you're coming back for more because you had so much fun making them in the first place. Absolutely. You can never have too many Christmas cards. It's always handy to have some spare ones in yeah. for friends and family that say, oh, can you just uh, whip me up a Christmas card? Oh, yeah, what I'll do is I'll give you a really fancy festive diorama card. Um, so, again, we, we're going to need some more tape on here. So we're just going to put some more red liner tape just on these tabs. But also, that could easily be a little Christmas scene that just gets yeah. put out every year. Every year. If you put this in bubble wrap, that's the great thing about Hunky Dory as well. We use adorable scorable. We use really high quality you know, foiling. 350 GSM adorable scorable. That is going to last if you want to keep it. And also if you want to put little lights little back fairy up, lights. lights in there. Yeah. Absolutely. Good? It'd look perfect. It could be a little it? kid's night light, couldn't it? Yeah, Outside that'd be table. so cute. Mm. Again, we're just going to line those two up. And again, just give that a nice, good, good fold. Pop that on there. And then we're just going to literally finish embellishing. So again, totally optional. You get three different sentiments with these. So we're going to put ho, ho, ho. And let's put have yourself a merry little Christmas. I love that there's two different options as well. So we'll get some foam pads so that we can put those on. Mm -hmm. So again, I don't want anything to be seen. So I'm going to stick those straight onto my sort of card blank, if you were. So we'll put ho, ho, ho. So if, if you are new to Hobby Maker, all you really need, if you've never crafted before, is foam pads, which you'll find on yep. the website. Hunky Dory do those for us. And also the red liner tape for the straight. So that's it. Just add your adhesive. That's all yeah. you need to do. Okay, so we've got that. And then we're going to pop this onto the back. Let's just get some normal double-sided tape. You can use your construction glue at this point. Tell you what, though, some of the most popular foam bads are the circular ones. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Um, so you get 12 sheets of circular ones. Haven't got many of these left now. 9.99 for 10 sheets, or 12 sheets, actually. 12 sheets. Um, £9.99. Great if you do your penny slider cards and that yeah, sort of thing. Absolutely. So you need to have a perfect sphere. There we go. There we are. There it is. Look at the, look at the dimension. It, look at the dimension in that, isn't it incredible? Oh, again, that decoupage just coming through. Yep. Uh, and again, you can pop that anywhere. And I mean, I would just love that in the middle of my Christmas table or coffee on my table. fireplace, coffee table. Windowsill. Absolutely. And you can be selling those. Yeah. Now, oh, you can so make, good. how many cards was it again? 16. 16 yeah. with a diorama kit. Details coming back up on the screen for that if you would like it. It's packed full of tons and tons and tons of content. It may look, when you see it all laid out and not necessarily put together, it may look as if it's a bit tricky, but I think Becca's just shown you there, it's absolute yeah. simplicity itself. Absolutely. And all the instructions are printed on the carrier sheet. Yeah. So you can't really go wrong at all. But you've got um, the Amsterdam scene, uh, you've got the classic vintage car, you've got father going down the chimney. Uh, yeah, beautiful, beautiful images, mm. all for that price of 19.99. It's been a sellout so many times. If you want your diorama, there we go. It's Absolutely. on the screen right now for you. Okay, we're nearly halfway through the show and we're going to try and get as many demos as we can. Now, let's go to my favourite. Oh, they're my favourite too, Dave. The Robins. Yeah, they're so cute, aren't they? Evidently, is it um, friends and relatives are near if a Robin's near? Or robins appear when... Is it? Yeah. Yeah, Robins, Robins appear, appear when, when loved ones, ones are near. That's, That's it. it. I That's knew it. it. <laughs> yep. And uh, my mum and dad actually used to have a, a neighbour across the other side of the road. Every year he said, can I just have a car with a Robin? Or I just want as many Robins in my lounge as possible. Absolutely. Um, and I think a lot of us feel the same way. Yeah, 100%. I mean, just look at them. They're sweet little faces. This, again, it's brand new for 2022. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous. And we have done these this style of concept card in the past. We've done it with birds. We've done it... Um, but this is the first time that we've done it just solely with robins and they I mean, flow. This one, literally. <laughs> I know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this one, though, is probably one of the most easy to work out yeah, concept cards. None of, them, none of them are complicated, but it's pretty obvious. You can either keep the card like this if you wish to, but then once you've put that and separated it from the front sheet and you yeah. put it on the back, then the decoupage goes on top. Yeah. Uh, and then the, so it's a very simple process, but very stylish mm. and very effective because the actual character comes out in the middle. It does. Absolutely. And again, it's one of those that adds so much dimension. You've got the Gorgeous. inserts included. You've got the envelopes included you as do. well. You, do. Uh, you can make, I think it's 16 cards. 12. 12 with this 12. one. 12. 12 with this one. 12 cards with this one. Inserts included too. And you've got lovely natural wood grain colours. Yeah. You've got really festive green, a lovely, quite contemporary ice mm. white blue. Richer blue, burgundy. You're loving the so you're loving the robins. Gorgeous. 
goodness. Oh, you, my goodness. Look how many people want these. If oh. you buy this today, you'll be in the draw Absolutely. and you could win a goodie bag from Hunky Dory tomorrow. Well done to our winners today. Every day this week, we're giving two fantastic mm. goodie bags away every day you could always put these away for next year you know yeah. you, you, you know if you've done if you've done your christmas crafting again we're not sure if we're going to bring these back sometimes we do sometimes we don't it just depends well i'm um, just thinking schedule but yeah if you love them and you've already done your christmas crafting put them away for next year when are your christmas fairs arranged in your town or in your village wherever you live um i bet they're kind of september october time very often yeah. certainly october time yeah. um this gives you enough time to make these yeah if, if, if we find that, that Robin-themed collections from Hunky Dory are the most popular, yeah. people are going to want to buy the cards that you've yeah. made with them because everybody loves Robin, so you can't go wrong with this. Um, I go for a couple of kits, actually. I mean, yeah. if, it works out, yeah. if it works out to about £1.30 per card, I already could charge two ninety nine for those. Absolutely. Maybe you could even charge them for a full... You know, a lot of people like to uh, send uniform cards, the same card to all their friends. You could sell a whole set of those for what? £20? Mm -hmm. I don't think that would be unreasonable. No, I don't think it would. No, not at all. And you'll have fun with all the die-cut decoupage yeah. elements. Just yeah. Everything just pops out and absolutely. layers on. OK, so we'll get to make one of those right now for yes, you. Yes, absolutely. Perfect. OK, let's put the diorama one to one side. OK, so we're going to go in with that gorgeous holly green one. Isn't it beautiful? So we've got everything that we need in here. And again, you could make these... You could probably make these on your lunch break if you wanted to. They're that quick and easy, like the full set. Mm -hmm. Why not? So let's grab everything we need for this one. You don't really need the instructions for these. You don't. You really don't. It's super, super easy. Oh, I'm All impressed. the foam pads. I love it because I love, I can't concentrate on the television. I love to be doing something. So I stuck all my foam pads on last night before I came so that I was ready to go and demo these for you guys. Okay, so let me just grab a little score tool to just give that a little burnish, perfect. So we're gonna pop out our image first of all, that's foiled and die cut. So we've got the card blank there, we could just pop that straight onto there, but we think of everything at Hunky Dory and we've given you a matching insert. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna pop that on with some construction glue for the perfect central positioning on here. So if I just grab that, oh, it's ready already. Okay, so we're just gonna pop a little bit on there and then that should be absolutely plenty it was quite um quite speedy that so we'll just pop that down on there and again we'll shut our window and make sure that's placed perfectly which it is so then let's move on to our topper we'll pop our card blank to one side so it's this image here that we're concentrating on so again what we do similar to all of our decoupage it's so so easy we're going to go from the largest to the smallest layer okay Obviously, you can see all our foam pads so these, on here. these aren't numbered, like on the They're previous They're not numbered, yeah. but you'll know, because like I say, it's the largest to the smallest. Right. Yeah, absolutely. Every single piece is a different size. I think with the other one as well, they have to be put on in a certain order to make the diorama, uh, you right. know, fit. Right. So, again... It's um, great to see so many of you coming in buying multiples. Amazing. Carol in Kent's gone for two. Sheila in Berkshire for two. Craft has gone for three. Yeah, I, I bet you, if you've already started to sell your Christmas cards, I yeah. bet these have been the most popular, Absolutely, one of the most popular. Absolutely, yeah. Everybody always asks. I know when I'm making cards for friends and family, Robins are always so, so popular. They're just timeless, aren't they? Oh, yeah, totally. Everybody loves to see them. They cheer everybody up. They're the absolute... It's where they just kind of dance. They're so sweet, they? just kind aren't of bounce they? around, don't they? They're Absolutely. Lovely. You just honestly love, love, love our Robins. So again, let's carry on. We've got that festive post box. We've got the snow. We've got all this ivy. So I'm just going to gently pop this out. I love the way this one is done in particular because it just kind of drapes around that circular topper. It's so nice. So again, let me just peel my backing off those. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Oh, I've just got one more up here on his tail. So again, we can give that a little bit of a shape with our fingers just to curve it round, to make it appear kind of more natural. And then we can start popping on these tiny little bits. Obviously, if you find this a little bit fiddly, you can stop. You don't have to put every layer on. I think it would be fiddly if I had to cut it out. Oh my you don't goodness. have to cut it out. No, so. and that's it. And it's not overly fiddly, but some people do like to stop after a few layers, which we get. It's mm -hmm. absolutely fine. And luckily, we give you plenty so that if you just want to pop three or four layers on... Well, and in then, that case, you can actually make that kit go that much yeah, further. You, can you can maybe uh, make it go to make 24 cards if you don't use all the elements. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, 100%. You really could. So let's just pop all these, all these little leaves on here. We get so much on here. 
Yeah, absolutely. Now, the first day that this actually was launched, when was that, Laura? Like, so I want to say back in June, July. June? August. August. August it was. We sold out of it three times on the launch day. We had to restock it from Hunky Dory three times in one day. We did, absolutely. And and it just, you know, I don't know where the time's gone since August, but that it's so good that we've got it back in stock. Okay. So just going to pop the last two layers on here. I have missed this one off, um, just trying to sort of rush a little bit. But again, I don't think you'll really notice. I don't think you'll really miss it. That's the great thing about it. You get so much decoupage that if you're a little bit like me and have a blonde moment, it'll still look really good. <laughs> and of course, you've not wasted that. That's no, I'm going to use that. Sheet that you can use on something else. Yeah, and again, even, you know, I could put two of that layer on my next one. Mm. So let's bring our card blank back in. So we're going to get that on with some foam pads as well. So let's get some nice sort of chunky kind of square ones on here. These are our nice large squares, the two mils. Okay. as well so they're going to give that nice height but still fit into your envelope well that together with the decoupage is going to make the whole character of the the robin come through the middle isn't of the, it isn't it absolutely circle. so we're going to just line that up in there just check it opens and closes perfect. Just nice and gentle perfect isn't it absolutely and then we've got this gorgeous sentiment to you both at christmas so again we're going to get one of our ever popular and this is why they're so popular. We do so many button toppers and circular ones. And your square ones can just... Now, if you've got this um, card kit, or if you bought it before, we've actually got some boxes that yeah. would work really well with these particular cards if you want to protect your decoupage and everything. So I'll show you those in a second. But you can, I mean, see, you can see why. see it from here. Uh, where can we... There we go. There we go. Look at that. And I'm still missing like one layer and it still looks absolutely incredible. How classy is that? It's so classy, so elegant, isn't it? And also, it's a card that you see from every angle in the room. Yeah, Whether you're absolutely. walking in from the kitchen, walking in from the garden or whatever, yeah. it, it kind of catches your eye. Gorgeous, they almost follow you around the room when you're walking past it. Yeah, they do. Now, they do. Um, 9 99 if you want your foam pads. So there are the details of the foam pads on there, 12 sheets for 9 99 Now the boxes that would go with this or other cards mm. of a similar nature, um, these are great. You're going to get 12 in total. These are six by six handmade card are. boxes. Look at that. So that'll just fit in perfectly. You'll just tape up your tabs and then pop it in there. And obviously you can decorate that. You can decorate that, you know, you can stamp onto that, ink onto that. Well, um, maybe if you're thinking, oh, no, well, I, I don't normally buy boxes because they're too expensive. If you buy them on their own, one by one, yes, they are. But if you buy them as a set and you get 12, 4 99 yeah, incredible, aren't they? That's about 30p each. Which is, which is crazy, isn't yeah. it? For, for a box as well. Exactly. And, amazing and like I, I say you can it's an extra element to craft with they are t you can obviously keep them plain white well jean's just come in and bought four so uh she's gone for 48 boxes nice so that would be for 20 quid 19, nice. 1996 that's amazing isn't it but it's, again it makes it more of a gift it does doesn't it absolutely and especially if you pop in maybe a little cash gift or a voucher in there you yep. know it's going to be nice and secure as well loads of you coming in for this oh, so wow. it could be that you want to protect the robin cards yep. and make sure that they arrive in good condition or it might be that you're doing other cards in the same sort of size and you're thinking mm. well, i can't let that go by you know 12 boxes in that size for only 4.99 that's too good to miss out on and all you need a bit of red liner tape bit of red liner tape absolutely you don't need to do anything with this you don't need to do any measuring any cutting any scoring nothing it's all done just your tape and everything's scored everything scored so as you know Look at how easy are they to put together. Yeah. Like, I mean, you've just you don't need instructions. In absolutely seconds. You don't need any instructions. Even I can do it. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Becca. Even he can do it. Um, yeah, I'll go. I haven't got any red lines tape with me. Anyway, but that's how easy it is to do. So it's like a, like a pizza box, really, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. There we go. Now, you could even, if you wanted to, if you sell your cards, mm. you could offer to sell the box yeah. to go with it as yeah, well, if you wanted to. Yeah. Um, they're costing you, what, 40p each? You could sell one for a, for a pound each, I reckon. Easily, individual. yeah, definitely. Yeah. So, all about um, presentation and protecting what you've put inside of it. ZKHD41, 4 99 for all 12 boxes. They do come flat packed. Yeah. Now, the Festive Archway, now this is intriguing me because I, I'm pretty sure I recognised this. From last year. Um, yeah, but I can't remember how the finished card looks. Okay. 
it's it's a little bit like our diorama card. It gives you that really nice layered look, but it gives you that art shape as well. Again, you've got decoupage in here. You get the foil in. You get the acetate. It's have gorgeous. I got two kits here? Do you think? I'm not. I'm not too sure. I think this is just one because is it? yeah. Um, obviously, you get you get a lot. You do. You do. It is. A, it's a, wow. an absolutely massive kit. You get twelve cards in total. Yeah, I think I've got two packs here. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have. Um, 1499 WSHD02. You're going to get how many sheets in total, is it? Tw 12 of the double sided, four of them die cut yep. sheets, three of the acetate sheets, envelopes, and instructions. Yeah, yeah, you do get envelopes with this you one do, as well. Yeah, yeah. so that'll be these. Okay, 12 cards. so it'll make 12 cards. Yeah, I've definitely got two packs here. So right, that makes so sense. one sheet is your front and your back. Right. One sheet is everything you need, and then you just add your acetate panels in. Cool, yeah. okay. Yeah. And uh, this is how you construct Okay, them. yeah, let's um, let's demo this. Let's move our robin out of the way just for now. Um, so I've gone for green as well with this one. Um, again, just, just had it. Um, okay, so let's grab this. And again, as you can see... Um, can't sit still in an evening and I've done my tape and foam pads already. Okay, so let's grab this. So nice. everything you need is on one sheet. Right, and it's nice to have different things to make that gives you a bit of mm. variety. Absolutely, 100%. Right, so let's pop out our actual, so these are our card blank, if you will. That's the back here, you get your space to write your message and then this is your front. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. So again, we'll just gently pop this out of the sheet. There we go. And then we'll pop this out as well. This is our sort of topper element, as it were. So again, we're just going to grab both of these. And we're going to mount it and valley fold these. Uh, okay, perfect. Right. I'll tell you what, those tote bags that we had at uh, 3 o'clock, they're still available if you want them. First time ever they've been available. Six ninety nine for a, a beautiful cotton so tote bag shopping bag. We just mounted and valley fold it in the same way as the diorama card. So it's such a great mate to do. And then what we're going to do is we're going to pop this frame out as well. This is our middle frame. So you can either use this um, or pop it to one side for another project. So again, you can put this anywhere. You can put this bit's going to go in next. This is the middle. That's the back. That's the front. So what you do with the topper and the frame is totally up to you. Mm -hmm. Just gives you that little bit more, you know, kind of choice. So we're going to pop our. Um, I love to do it on here because you've already got that sort of perfect placement. So if you struggle, you know, keeping everything straight and neat, you can just use the sort of guidelines on here. Obviously, you can go on top of the acetate if you want to. Um, so you get these extra little decoupage elements. Mm -hmm. Super cute. Again, it'll just, cards like this just scream for dimension because, again, like you say, you get lots of angles, lots of places to look. Isn't it cute? You get that beautiful tree dressed to perfection and then Again, we'll layer that up. It's got presents, baubles. It's so, so sweet. So again, we're just going to line that up. Um, so I'm just going to line that up just nice. Perfect. And then what we're going to do is we're going to pop our acetate on next. Don't forget, buy anything from Hunky Dory. You'll be in the draw for a goodie bag tomorrow. Yeah, shop to win. Yeah, shop to win. Two more goodie bags to give away tomorrow. I'm so excited. It's been the best countdown to our birthday ever. Like we knew that, yeah, it's been absolutely epic. So well, we've, we've just that up. seen Hunky Dory grow and grow and grow in popularity yeah, over the years. So, uh, yeah. And things like this, concept cards, they are our sort of signature, you know, bread and butter product, aren't they? Everybody loves them now. We're going to get this frame on here. So again, we're just going to go in with our sort of skinny thin red tape on here. Okay, so perfect. Um, so we're just going to put a little bit of tape on each of these sides. Again, you can, again, put that over your frame. You could pop that in here. Um, or like I say, you can put it to one side and use it for your other, other projects. Okay. Um, so again, we're just going to grab this red liner tape off of here. Mm -hmm. And then we're just going to sort of line that up. I'm just going to just, sorry, mind my head. 
just so that I get that nice and straight. Yeah, that's absolutely perfect. I'm really happy with that. And then we've got our, our sort of thicker red tape on these two tabs again, just because we've got that really nice amount of coverage on there. So we're going to pop that on here. Again, like I say, mountain and valley fold. Whatever you do on this side, do it the opposite way around to give okay. you that dimension and that effect. It's like going into a posh hotel and it's an entrance door into a lobby Isn't lounge it? or something. Yeah. And we've got one with a front door scene on. I mean, how nice would that be for your neighbours? Oh, yeah, it's the front door from mm -hmm. our home to yours, absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Your neighbours are going to think, oh, flipping it, we've got a very posh neighbour that sends <laughs> posh Christmas cards. There's the front door one. Isn't it gorgeous? I love that Great, one. So then we've got our sentiments as well as our little button toppers. And again, you get three extra little elements there just because why not? We love to jam pack our topper sheets. Hunky Dory always fill every we single do. sheet in their, uh, in their card we collections. We absolutely do. We can't stand any, any spare space. So we're going to put that little Christmas tree on here. Again, I just love to just put them at a little angle. You'll, you'll figure out your own favourites. And then we're going to put... What should we go with? Have a ball this Christmas. I love that. It's a little bit punny, isn't it, that one? Mm -hmm. um, have a ball. So we're just going to pop that. Again, you can pop that straight onto here, actually. And then I know that, again, that's not going to... That's not going to show. Now, the strip foam pads, which are what Becca's just used there, yeah. um, these always prove popular oh, and they're yeah. perfect for your sentiment strips. Absolutely. So they're just 9 99 if you want those too. All the different shapes and sizes, you'll see them on the website. Hunky Dory and all of our suppliers have always got brand shops on our mm. website. So if you're we ever do. running out of something, you can always get it. Yeah. All your essentials are always there. Absolutely, because we know that everybody needs those all of the time. Yep. So we've got our made just for you on there. But again, Let's just be a little bit extra and pop this on. Again, you could be popping ribbon, gemstones. Again, if you've got any leftover little button toppers, um, die cuts, 100%. And then look again, that dimension. Oh, isn't um, it incredible? So you've basically, with the foam pads, you're going to get 12 sheets of foam pads for 9 99 You can make 12 of these archway cards, though, from the collection. Um, I can't remember the price of this now. Um, but the archway cards, if you want them, 14 99 That's what they are. And you get, yeah, acetate. Acetate. You don't get yep. is the foam pads. And Absolutely, adhesive. yeah. Just add your adhesive. Absolutely. Yeah, 100%. So the Archway collection is WSHD02. Now, don't forget about the tote bag. When I saw it on my list today, tote bag, I thought it was going to be like a little desk one, like you put your, your tiny little mini in. one. Yeah. No, this is a shopping tote bag. Whether it's going to be down the local craft fair, whether it's going to be down the local supermarket or the Christmas fairs. Absolutely. Imagine if you have a... You know, you might want to be really generous. Imagine if you've got a little craft group, there's four or five of you, treat yourself, all be matching. Look, I mean, it's, that a really, be amazing? it's a really comfy size as well because nice, it's got nice it? long straps. You know, I, I, I'm not a big bag carrier fan, to be fair. But I mean, if, you, if you're walking, I'm, quite, I'm about six foot one. Oh, yeah. You're walking, it's not going to touch the ground. No. But if it's got something quite heavy in there and quite bulky, over your shoulder, good from security as yep, well. Absolutely. I've had this on it. the train with me this morning. It was, yeah, it was great. Yeah. You'll get lots of people, especially people in the crafty know, uh, will say, where'd you get your hunky dory bag from? Because it's an iconic symbol, isn't it? It is, yeah. There we go. Uh, 6 .99. it was only today, that's the first time ever we've been able to offer this. Dan, um, evidently at Hunky Dory, didn't think it was a good idea to, to sell it. Didn't think you know, people would want it. But you're absolutely wanting it and loving it. And it's proper material as well. It £6.99. pence. And everybody in the know will know you're a hunky dory fan. <laughs> absolutely, yeah. You can you can have that bag, show it off with pride, can't yep, you? Absolutely. Um, and no one else apart from someone watching the TV like you are at the moment will be able to get one because yeah, these aren't for sale. You will if you win a goodie bag. Get your goodie bag, I think, in one. Yes, yes, certainly yes, yes. This is the goodie bag. Well, this is it. And originally, that's just what they were going to be for. And then, obviously, everybody fell in love with them. Right. We were inundated, so we decided to but bring them for that, you. That, that, that's full. There's full. loads of product in full. there. Yep. Um, and it weighs a lot, but it's still a strong bag. Yeah. So that kind of proves you how yeah. strong and sturdy it is. Yeah. There we go. You can get a lot of shopping in there. You can. A lot of crafty shopping, a lot of food shopping. But just what I love about it is, because... I've got a boot full of, I do the shopping for my mother yeah, and father yeah. every week. So I've got a boot full of bags and I always tend to go in the supermarket and forget about them. Yeah. If I've got this in my pocket, I'll yep. put these in my jean pocket. Yeah. Um, and it's just there. Absolutely, yeah. In your car, 
Uh, in your craft trolleys, yeah, 100%. Yeah, or just keep it in your glove box in yep. the car, whatever. 100%. But there it is. Hunky Dory Fly the Flag. 6.99, TGHD 76. Now, the exploding boxes. Now, we can offer them yeah. to you individually, or the best deal is to go for all three. Now, an exploding box, in case you've never seen one, that is what an exploding box is. Basically, it's like a, a hat box that opens out, all the four sides open out, and you've got various different sections on each one. So they're really, really popular. We've got... Um, the festive exploding boxes, we've got the exploding boxes cute Christmas, which is that one there, and we've also got uh, vintage, vintage Christmas as well. Now, you're going to get all three. You do, yeah, you so do. So you can make one box out of each. Yeah, okay. absolutely. Obviously, you can split the layers up and make like cards and other projects with them. Yeah. But yes. Now, yeah, just to let you know, one. you can easily get into the packaging by just opening up the bottom yep. rather than tearing the top. And, and we then can then pop that back in if we need to. So this one's your vintage one. Yes. So you've got all the bows and all the little accessories and snowflakes and wrapped up presents there as well. There we go. So you get loads of elements on there. Yeah, of course. And, and then, then you get all the panels for your exploding box. Yep, you've got that's your box lid on that sheet there as well yep. for you. And then as you can see, they get larger and larger so that it'll just pop out and then that's your, your acetate for your elements. And you get full instructions. Again, yeah, your full, full instructions. Okay, so if you fancy making a vintage Christmas exploding box, okay, this is the detail for everything actually. So you're gonna get that one Three. and you're gonna get the uh, cute Christmas cute. box as well. That's like the frosty blue. It's got very, um, you know, sweet artwork. Perfect, baby's first Christmas, you oh, know? Yeah. Imagine. Now you've only seen these once before back in July and they absolutely flew. So this one is your cute Aww. in a lovely kind of frozen blue, which I love. Yeah, it's so nice, isn't it? It's lot, like I say, lots Fresh. of sweet little characters in here. I mean, even um, the bows have been printed on the front and on the back as well. Yeah, they have, yeah. Again, so everything, you know, we know that they'll be, you'll be looking at these from every angle. So we, you know, we do print on both sides. Perfect. Look, you've got the, uh, you've got the penguin, you've got the snowman kind of a nordic -y feel to it as well. But all the elements Cute, you need. It? Love that. So that's in there as well. So it's working out less than a fiver for each collection. And then the last one is this one. This one's got holographic on it. Holographic. This is the um, Very contemporary fancy. Christmas box. This it one. is, yeah. Okay, let's get this out. And you can put things in exploding boxes, not mm. just, it's not just purely decorative. You yeah. can put a little gift inside it if you want Absolutely. to as well. Absolutely. But it's like a, a surprise when you lift the yeah. lid everything just goes you know. and it's amazing it's so fun there we go so there's the holographic foil there's your snowflakes and prezzies again there's all the elements but that decorative foil on there is amazing isn't it loads of different colors coming from it absolutely beautiful so different in these colorways as well isn't it love them Absolutely love them. So they're, all three is fourteen ninety nine. Otherwise, if you buy them on their own, I think they're five ninety nine each. Yeah. So you save for another three pounds by buying all three together. Absolutely. Um, yeah. UTHD fifty three. Okay, so we're going to run through a little demo for this. So we're going to start popping out all of our pieces. Obviously, I've got my instructions to hand if I need them, but again, they're so easy. It's absolutely fine. So each cross sort of shape is a box as you can see this is the walls coming up here the four end squares are the walls and then the central is your sort of base so we're just going to attach all of your corresponding panels which you get on the same sheet so you know which is which it's absolutely beautiful this holographic foil and it's so different it's so fun um, and again it's just super sparkly mm -hmm. Um, so I'm just going to pop these. And it's a total contrast to the dark blue background isn't, isn't it, it? Yeah. absolutely yeah again it just gives it that real I don't know, I think there's something about holographic, it's quite luxurious. So we're going to stick these panels onto here. Um, okay, so again, we're just going to stick those in. You get a really nice matte and layer, so don't worry about, you think, oh, I really like that starry design that you get. Don't worry, we've given you a nice sort of chunky matte and layer to one, be able to matte and layer it really easily, and two, so that you can see that beautiful design as well. You know, you don't want to be covering... Um, any of that gorgeous, gorgeous artwork up. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we just we just give you everything you need to make these look really, really pretty. So, again, this one is a little bit 
the sort of repetitive you just go around and do all those panels but again uh, so satisfying to put together i mean it could be that you want to do an exploding box rather than a cracker yeah on your table yeah. these will look awesome I mean, they're, they're working out about a fiver each okay they're a bit more money than a cracker would be but I you could put though. something a gift that's meaningful to the person yeah. who's sat at that table Absolutely. um and it's something they can take home with them and you well. say that crackers are expensive i mm. mean you know some of them are crazy oh yeah yeah. I mean, some of them are hundreds of pounds. They if, you go, if, you go, so. if you go to like the upmarket department stores in London and that, Absolutely. I've seen the magazines and they're like three, four, five hundred pounds. I know. Them. And I think I'd rather have one of these. I would. Um, I mean, like I say, how cute are these? They're going to be so fun, especially if you do little table presents. Like um, my mum always does little um, uh, like uh, scratch cards and stuff on the table. Uh, love that idea. So they're really nice to do that. And then again, also, gonna... have you seen those little mini mince pies that you can buy? Yeah, you could put little mince in pies there. in there. Little yeah. loads, um... Mince pies are in the supermarket now, by the way. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I almost bought some yesterday and I stopped myself. Uh, Jen, I saw them in my uh, local shop last week and I thought, oh my goodness, summer is over. <laughs> okay, so again. We... I am a sucker for a mince pie, must not it? Oh, Labour Kuchen. Yeah. Labour Kuchen. She's not listening to you. She's not, no. German, the biscuits are called Labour Kuchen. Yeah, they're amazing. <laughs> oh, I can eat those by the packet. Um, okay. I, don't I, I don't think I've had them. Very, they're very spicy, but they're really nice. Yeah. Okay, so again, and again, how nice is that? We've got that starry print continuing on here. So again, we're just going to pop these on and then we've just got our little dink. So you get three layers in here. So that's going to be a really strong box. Oh yeah, super strong. Really, really effective with all these layers. And then we're going to go down to our last one here. So again, it's all foiled and die cut for you. Again, we're just going to burnish those score lines. Pop our bit of tape in the middle. A glue dot would be perfect for this as well. Mm -hmm. So just going to pop two pieces of double sided. Again, you can use high tack as well if you want something a little bit stronger. Um, and then we're just going to pop that in the center and then pop our little, our little squares on here. Oh, and I've put the tape on these already. That's great. Busy old show. And we've got another one to come from Hunky Dory, still celebrating 50 I years. know, to our special To our today. special. We've got um, craft pads. Yes, we have. Deluxe, Deluxe craft, craft pads. pads. Again, we're sticking with the festive theme. Three um, for two deal. Yeah, three for two. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous craft pads that we've got for you. And they are so lovely. They were an absolute joy to uh, to play with yesterday. And I'm, I'm very excited for the next show. So again, this is the center of our box. So again, this is your sort of net layer here. So again, like I say, if you want to pop a little chocolate or, or anything like that, you can do right let's just get all my trees the right way up so I then i believe how how wonderful that holographic foiling isn't it is amazing i'm seeing so many different colors coming from it yeah absolutely and then you get a box in a box within a box which is just fabulous so we're going to get our box lid next mm -hmm. and then this is all again scored for you so that you can just pop it together and then these are the little walls here. These are the tabs, these four corners here. I mean, so it looks, makes a lovely kind of table centerpiece. Just, when, doesn't when, it? When all, the, uh, all, all the four walls are open. Absolutely. And again, you could be popping Christmas lights in there. Maybe a little... Um, battery candle. Flameless candle, yep. yeah. Yep. Absolutely. Battery powered candle, yeah. 100%. Absolutely gorgeous. And then obviously you can box it up once, you, you know, when you're clearing the table. And actually, if you make the lid out of acetate, if you use that oh, yeah. as a template, yep. draw around it and acetate, yep. have a see-through clear lid, Ooh, you yeah. could put a little battery operated to light inside. Absolutely. Like a little lantern. Yeah. Well, that's the thing with our concept cards is, you know, you can put take your own twist on it. all those. Yeah, you can take the footprint and you can make your own cards. You can make lots of you know quirky makes i know we haven't had time to to go through any quirky makes but once you get them home you can just have a play with them mm. um and, and turn them into other things other projects yeah for sure um so let's grab grab my last little bit of tape off here and then um just fold these all together just gonna just 
Oh my they're, goodness. They're complimenting you for being very neat and tidy. I do. That is not neat and tidy. Oh my goodness. It's a pile of rubbish. It's, that is upsetting me, that pile of rubbish. For me, <laughs> I'd have rubbish everywhere. Whereas you've got just a nice, neat just little pile. A, just a nice, huge, neat pile. <laughs> And then we pop our box lid on here. Let's get everything folded up. And then in essence, oh, look at that. that's what we get. Obviously, we haven't put any of the elements in yet. And then you get that amazing surprise. So that one's the contemporary Christmas is, box. Yeah. I must admit, I think that's my favourite. I love the colourways, the olive yeah. greens and that sort of thing. Yeah, 100%. Kind of a Nordic look. Um, okay, do you want me to pop, finish it off and pop the elements in? Got about half a minute, I think. Half a minute, yeah, let's do it. So we get our acetate, we just get little strips here and then we'll just pop one in and then you can see how it sort of works. So you pop that in the centre, you can just bend that back, pop a little bit of tape on, just onto here like so. And like I say, I'm only going to put one on, you can do absolutely loads, you can just squeeze them all in, pop multiples on one strip of acetate, you could use snowfall acetate as well if you want. Mm -hmm. but let's just pop that in the middle there. And then let's go with Merry and Bright. Uh, and no, in fact, let's pop our snowflake on and then we can put that sentiment on the top. So we're just going to pop that on as well with, again, let's go with a bit of high tack tape, just a tiny bit on here. I wonder what the uh, acetate was in there for. That's what it's there for. Yeah, it's to make, and obviously you can trim that down. We don't put it in strips for you because we know that you might want to use it in, you know, lots of different ways. So once that's in, that just will wobble really cute. Super, super cute. You get your ribbons and bows as well. So well, love it. Our lid so on. with the return of the concept cars, we've got about four or five different ones to choose from. They're all on the website, but they're all selling very, very quickly. This will give you all three explode, exploding boxes for fourteen ninety nine. That saves you best part of three pounds off what you should be paying for them individually. You get the contemporary Christmas, you get mm. the vintage, and what was the other one? Uh, bum, 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 bum. Cute. cute Christmas. So all Sorry. three of them, a fiver each. There you go. Do you want to uh, open it? Do the honours. <laughs> Exploding back. Isn't that amazing? There's so much Great, fun. Fabulous. Brilliant. Uh, right. Viv quickly. Hello, Viv. That's not her name. <laughs> I'm going to mention this from Viv quickly. Uh, Viv says... I bought these exploding boxes a while ago. Anyone who's not too sure, buy them. They're fantastic and so easy to make. Really Viv, are. thank you ever so much. Lovely to yeah, hear from thank you. Thank you. Right, another hunky dory show to come. Uh, more from we've got our multi buys of the craft pads. So they're on the way. Three for the price of two. We'll show you those in a couple of ticks. <laughs> Did you know that digital downloads are now available on the Hobbymaker website? Just pop over to hobbymaker.co.uk, go to downloadable content, choose the collection you would like to buy and click purchase. This will be an instant payment and once purchased you will receive an email. Click on the link and it will take you here. Click download and once downloaded the file will appear in your downloads folder. Right click on the folder and click on extract all. Once extracted, open the folder, click auto run and you're ready to craft. For more information, help and support, go to the further details section of the purchase page. Digital crafting with Hobbymaker.
purchase anything on Hobby Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobby Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Hobby Maker. Have you heard? We're celebrating Hunky Dory's 15th birthday. Yes, yeah, we all are. week. We've got celebration shows, celebration giveaways. We've already given away two goodie bags today, and we're going to do the same again tomorrow. All you've got to do is buy something from Hunky Dory today to be in the draw to win tomorrow. Yeah. Hopefully, it's you that wins. We'll announce the winners tomorrow when the Hunky Dory shows, which I think. Um, is it Anne Marie? Anne Marie tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, 1357, yeah. I think. So. New launches, um, loads of goodies it's going to be very exciting. so we'll announce today's winners of two goodie bags and the one o'clock show tomorrow afternoon so watch that if you possibly can or watch it back a bit later now um these are great i love these because this is a complete card kit in a pad yeah. such a clever concept because rather than having kind of loose sheets all over the place yeah. everything you need to make a card or multiple cards is in the pad yeah. now this is a three for two offer they are normally uh 11.99 they are yeah yeah so 35.97 for three today you're going to get one of them free we've got winter wildlife which was a hugely popular one we've got deck the halls traditional vintage christmas and we've got under the moonlight isn't it gorgeous? which is beautiful wildlife look at look, look at the under Again, the moonlight ones look if you like holographic foiling which we do. Which we all do. Oh my goodness. Look, at, Look this. at these. You've got bunny rabbits. You've got tigers, tiger yes. cubs. You have got my favorite, bear. the polar bear. Oh, that is adorable. Absolutely adorable. Um, so that's just a few of the cards you can make from Under the Moonlight. Yep. The vintage or deck the halls. Yeah, this, this is, is our forever floral. This is Laura, our producer's favorite. Uh, yeah look at it it's classy it's elegant it's it's quite i don't know it's kind of got that nice sort of romantic yeah. feel to it as it's well like, hasn't it's like it? a christmas hug it does feel like yeah absolutely so beautiful colorways something a bit different and then the last pad i'll flip through the pads for you in a minute uh, winter wildlife yep. is this one just here now this is a firm favorite of mine as well because you've got your sheepdog yeah <laughs> Sheepdog with a the farmer, there we go, look. Absolutely. You've got your blue tit. You've got the fox making friends with a little hedgehog. Gorgeous. Oh, it's amazing artwork this, isn't it? It really, really is. And then we've got a tawny Ooh, owl. This is cute, very fun. Okay, and you've got the donkeys in the snow. We do, we love these. Festive donkeys. Look at them. Okay, so let me flick through them for you. Now it's three for two, you're doing the maths, you're working it out. You're gonna get your topper sheets. Yep. You're gonna get your printed cards, you're gonna get your printed and foiled cards, you're gonna get your inserts. Yep. As you'd expect to normally get in a full card kit, but these are kind of mini card kits. They aren't are, they? aren't they? Absolutely, but you know what though? I love that you can get the whole collection in one pad, in one pad <laughs> as well. It's, you know, sometimes a great big launch of one thing is a bit of an investment for some people. So if you kind of like it, 
but you want a few different styles. This is so great because well, you get everything. It's a great way of trying hunky dory trying if you've never out. tried it before. Mm. And you get four, four, four. Normally in a conventional car kit from hunky dory, it's normally eight, 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 isn't it? It is, yeah, so absolutely. Four sheets of toppers, four sheets of printed, four sheets of printed and foiled, yeah. and then how many? Your inserts, inserts eight. Eight inserts. Yes. Yeah, so it's basically half the size of a conventional card kit, yeah. but at a fraction of the price. That's Winter Wildlife. This one is your Deck the Halls. Again, the foiling is lovely. The colourways are wonderful. Look at that. That would be so perfect for a winter uh, wedding or an en engagement. Yeah. Couples got, you know, the, the mistletoe, uh, the poncetti is there. Absolutely stunning, isn't Hurricane it? Hurricane lamp. All those gorgeous vintage tones, the wood grains in here. And this is matastic, this it one. Is, it is. So you can add any mixed media finishes to this. Your inks, your sprays, glimmer mist, anything, your pearlescent powders. And then they're your beautiful inserts just to finish your cards off. It can't be easy to put, put it all, all those different elements into one pad. I know, but we do it. We do it so, so well. Now, this, again, I love. I love all three of these. Three for the price yeah. of two. We haven't dropped the price yet, but oh. we will do. Put them in your basket and check out. You know, no one's going to be charged thirty-five ninety-seven. Everyone is paying the lowest price, which is coming up now, twenty-three ninety-eight. Twenty-three ninety-eight for three pads. One of them is free. Which one is your free one? It's up to you. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. The howling wolf. The beautiful cubs. Oh. I mean, look at this out of focus snow. I love yeah. it. Absolutely love it. Gorgeous. Such a great effect. There's your bears. Oh. <laughs> I know, your wolves there as well. Just so handsome, aren't they, these creatures in this one? Absolutely. 23 98 for three pads, one PMP for the whole day. That's just in case you haven't heard, every day we only ever charge you 395 PMP, no matter how many things you buy. You could buy 20 things. Yeah. It'd be one PMP of 395. So if you bought something since midnight last night with us, uh, you forget about PMP until tomorrow. Fab. 23.98. How many cars could you make out of this? Oh my goodness. Do you reckon? It depends how frugal mm. you want to be. I mean, I would say at least 12. Per pack? Uh, I would say so. So at yeah. least 36, yeah. but maybe you could stretch it a little bit further. Absolutely. And then you're still going to have bits of toppers and sentiments left over as yeah. well. Yeah. Well, oh, hello to Deborah, Grace, Sharon, Michelle, Jean in Kent as well. Hello to Leslie in Powys, Jeanette in Somerset, Gail in Ayrshire, Karen in Staffordshire, coming in and filling the boots, enjoying these yeah. three for twos. We have got also a pick and mix on the show we that do. we'll get to a bit later on, including these as well, which is any two for 19 98 yeah yeah so that is on the website as well if you want to have a little look and that goes for all of the pads that we yeah. have available okay and we've also got the brand new scoreboard now this came into our building two weeks ago okay um Amory delivered it yes okay or was it natalie no i think it was natalie delivered it and she is said under no circumstances do that do not that that don't let that go anywhere near the studio for now <laughs> because it was under what do they call it? Under kind of like um, a curfew. No one could see it. No one was allowed to yes. get a whiff of it. The brand new Hobby Maker Tone, the beautiful teal, adorable scoreboard, the award-winning adorable scoreboard is still available today. Only here in this color, nowhere else. So if you fancy it, it is in the show. It's coming up a bit later on, but uh, just thought I'd let you know that it is available today. Is Another useful. birthday treat. It is, it is. It's it absolutely looks so gorgeous. good in that color. Doesn't it? Absolutely. Um, I love it. Right. What are we, are we doing a demo? I think so. Okay, okay. Yep. Which one would which one should we do? Which um, of the three? Um let's let's do that let's one. Winter Winter Wildlife. Yeah, winter wildlife. Perfect. Perfect. Right, let's um let's get this stuff out to do this. Okay, okay. So we're gonna make an acetate easel card. Okay. So there's no reason why you can't still make your fancy cards with this pad. So what we've done is I've got a six by six car blank, a six by seven acetate mm -hmm. and some gold mirror mats, six by six. I've already cut, if I just flick to the pad, I'll show you which piece of cardstock I've used. It is the printed one, so it doesn't have any foiling, but it does have that beautiful artwork on here. So as you can see, I've chopped that one from there and then that one from there so that we're getting that, that detail across too. Okay. And you'll have a few scraps left over as well. We've got our mirror mats and we've got our... Um, insert ready to go as well. Okay, so what I'm gonna do first of all is I'm gonna mat and layer this one to my gold mirror mat. So I'm just gonna pop some double-sided tape on here. I do like the fact as well, Becca, that on the front of the pack, 
you actually get finished yeah. cards. You do. Give you some ideas. Absolutely, because I mean, obviously in our ultimate collections, we, what we do is we give you an inspiration sheet, but we don't want anybody to miss out just because they're buying something a bit smaller. So we still put that amazing inspiration on the cover for you. Isn't it incredible? So you can have, you can copy any of those, you can tweak them, carry them over to into your other collections. But yeah, you still, you don't miss out on that no. inspiration. Um, okay, so let's start making my acetate easel. So I've got some snowfall acetate. I'm going to bring in my beautiful aqua scoreboard here. So this is six by seven. So all I need to do to make this in there. Oh, so satisfying. So we're just going to make that. That's going to be our little sort of tab. So again, we're going to go in with some red liner tape on here. And I'm just going to go with a nice big strip just along here. And we're going to pop that onto the snowfall acetate, mm -hmm. of course. The ever popular snowfall acetate. Ever so popular. We have to do this. Um, oh my goodness, there we go. It's a little bit picky there. So what we're going to do is we're going to open this card. We're going to sort of, like I say, just... By the way, just to let you know, tomorrow, if you're a Miri card fan, we've got a most incredible show at three o'clock tomorrow with oh, Anne-Marie yeah. and myself. Oh, no, it's not me tomorrow at three. I'm on the evening shift tomorrow. Um, I think Zena during the day tomorrow. Awesome. So yeah, Miri at three, make a note of your di in your diary. Okay, so we're going to just grab this onto here and then I'm actually going to um, do a little bit of fussy cutting. Have we got a craft, have we got the craft mat, the purple mat? Mm. Perfect. We'll okay. see if we can get it for you. Awesome, thank you. <coughs> well, in the meantime, I can put my toppers on and I can put my insert on, so that's absolutely fine. Ah, oh, here she is. Perfect, let's do that now then. So I'm going to grab my craft knife and we're going to do a bit because I do not want to fussy cut onto this desk. And what we're going to do is we're just going to sort of place that on there and what I'm going to do is I'm going to just fussy cut around my donkeys. Aren't they sweet? Mm -hmm. So... Obviously, we could just use that on the bottom or we could use it in there, but I really want to have them, you know, nice and proud. They're such sweet creatures. They look like they're fresh from the nativity. They do. They really Local do. Local school nativity players, aren't they? They really, really do. They're ever so sweet. They've got the most beautiful little expressions as well on their faces. So I'm just going to just fussy cut kind of round here. So, so easy to do with your craft knife. Okay. Again, just going to go round their ears on here. And I'm just going to just move my blade slightly. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to see where we're at with that. I'll, see if I'll tell you what, to. for those of you that are in the market for a craft knife, can I recommend the Hunky Door oh. craft knife? I've got it. I use it all the time. I love it. Isn't it amazing? It's such a good craft knife. I just feel really comfortable and it's confident with it. Very ergonomic, knives? isn't it? Absolutely. Borrow me a bit. Yeah. <laughs> No, it is, it is certainly, it's a really economic one, uh, ergonomic one, sorry yeah. to use. And economic. Uh, yeah, of course. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're just going to lift those up and then we're going to pop this on here. So we're going to get some double-sided tape and then pop some tape. Obviously, we don't want to tape down my donkeys, so we're going to just put some at the top and bottom and on the side. Okay. And then... We are going to just pop that on there. Now, I wasn't sure if we actually had this deal available or not. And Laura, our producers, found out we still got this deal going on. This is, uh, when I bought it, I got three blades with mine. Okay. Um, this yeah. deal is crazy because you're going to get 13 <gasps> blades, two wow. packs of five, which when you've used those, you can actually use that as a dispenser to hold your blunt blades so mm. you know where to put them. Um, so easy to dispose of. Nine ninety nine for thirteen blades and the actual craft knife is absurd. I don't know how we still got that deal, mm. but it's available EPHD seventy three, and I'm still on the first blade that I've. Um, they do used. last a very long yeah. time, don't they? So what we're going to do is we're going to make that our sort of stopper for our easel. Oh, so the how cute is the that? Stopper. The donkey's ears <laughs> are just going to be the stopper there. That's so brilliant. it's super sweet. Um, so then we're going to pop our toppers on now. So obviously we're going to go with the matching donkeys. I wasn't expecting that. That's uh, I like that. Do you know, I saw it and I thought, yeah, that's what I'm going to... I was thinking, I knew I was going to make it an easel card. And then I thought, wait a minute. 
And then I thought, yeah, yep. that has to, we have to do I've that. I've never seen anyone else do that. <laughs> That's really cool. Um, I've seen Anne-Marie do it with a completely different topper set. Right. And it actually had a race car on it. It was with our sporting silhouettes. And I thought, wow, that is amazing. So you can take that technique and put it to any mm. of, you know, if you like one from the under the moonlight, you could do that technique yep. or the deck the halls. You can use the same technique, just fussy cut out your element from the cardstock and then just use that as a stopper instead of using an extra topper or a border. So just gonna pop some foam pads on here. Loads of you coming through for that knife. I'm not at all surprised. I, I, we honestly thought that deal had either sold out or was over, but it's still available. Just thought we'd give you a heads up about it. 9.99, two packs of five blades, plus the three it comes with normally. I'd pay that 9.99 for the, for the reason. Oh yeah, easily. Really so we're gonna pop that in the center. And then we're going to take out our middle frame so that we can see that snowfall acetate. And then again, we're just going to raise that up with some foam pads. So I've just got some, again, some nice square ones here. I know you guys have been going mad on our foam pads, stocking mm -hmm. up whilst it's our birthday. Um, so again, we're just going to pop those on there as well. So just nice and centered. Remember, every time you buy something at the moment, that enters you into our draw to win a goodie bag. Oh, yeah. Two more goodie bags to give away tomorrow. We'll let you know the winners at one o'clock tomorrow when we come live and at one. we've got our, for someone very special, uh, I mean, you'd feel special when you're receiving a handmade card. Oh, yeah. Um, so we've got, for Especially someone. Especially with a donkey on it. I know. Anybody that loves wildlife or loves getting wrapped up in the winter and going for those nice winter walks. There we go. And then we're just going to pop our border strip on there as well. Okay. And the hungry drawer always give you so much on each sheet, don't they? Don't we just? I mean, I'm going to snip this border off and I'm going to get one more topper on here. But, you know, we're going to have so much left. Now, if you want this one individually, it is available. It's called Winter Wildlife and it's $11.99. Maybe you've bought it before and you're running out mm. and it's your favourite. Um, buy a couple if you want to. £11.99. You get, remember, four of everything and eight of the inserts. So four sheets of toppers, four sheets of printed, four sheets of printed and foil cardstock, and then eight sheets of toppers. But they're just adorable images. They are, aren't they? And it used to be, you know, that once our collections had gone, we'd release them as a flagship and that was it. They might be seen in a little book or something else again from time to time if you were lucky but to have them like this all over again in a deluxe craft pad form it's just incredible isn't it so just look at look at Beck, becca's cars how adorable on. is that absolutely we're going to pop one more sentiment on with the, just, ears. with the little ears let's pop that on as well just to finish that in place then i'll show you where we're going to put the insert on a card like this and Again, ha just how much you've got left on the sheet. So if I just mind my head so that you can still see it, we're going to pop our festive wishes there. And then once the card is, this is sort of the back of the card, mm -hmm. but obviously with nowhere on the front because we've completely filled in, it is a little bit different to your sort of traditional card. But we want to finish it off with that insert because we do get them included. So we may as well finish it off with that really luxurious finish, you know? Absolutely. Just have it all all looking beautiful and perfect. So we've cut that down to six by six. We're gonna just pop that on there as well so that that all matches mm -hmm. and we can write our message on the back. And then like I say, let's get that on there. So they're so sweet, love it. aren't they? Absolutely love it. So that is if you want the Winter Wildlife pad on its own, 11 99 The three for two, remember, which is the best deal in the show. So in yeah. other words, you're going to get an 11 99 pad for nothing. Um, 23 98 for all three of them. That's going to give you Deck the Halls, which is the vintage Christmas. Under the Moonlight, which is basically beautiful blue mm. hues and um, outdoor wildlife, uh, zeb uh, not zebras, you've got um, your tigers, tigers polar bears, wolves. Polar bears, absolutely wolves as well. And then the last one is this one which is the winter wildlife, uh, which is traditional outdoor mm. kind of winter characters. £23.98 for th uh, three of them. You're only paying for two of them. Which oh, one's yeah. the free one? RTHD 58. Now we have got um, the scoreboard oh. yes, details. Let's do. give you this. Now, if like me, you love this color, this duck egg color, which is traditionally um, our color at the channel, hobby maker colors. It is, That's absolutely. That's why Hunky Dory actually manufactured it yes. in this color just for just you for us, and just yeah. for us. Just for hobby maker, yeah. Absolutely. Just for the birthday. Yeah, gorgeous, isn't it? Double-sided, double-sided. So you've got your metric measurements on here. 
Um, you, you're also going to get the crafting handbook as well. Yes. So that is the scoreboard handbook, which I don't think we've got here, but you will get it. That's worth 9 99 yeah. uh, and that's coming with it as well. But more, most importantly, you've got the award-winning characteristics uh, and personality of the adorable scoreboard. Absolutely. I mean, it's been voted product of the year so many years yep. in a row. Yep. Um, it wins so many awards, usually in purple, but for a limited time until the stock goes, which is going quickly, we've got this duck egg blue to celebrate mm. the birthday and to celebrate the fact it's uh, with us at Hobby Maker. 39.98, I think we did a pink one once. We've done a we? pink one, and then, but again, that was several years ago now. So right. if you missed out on that one and want one of our limited edition, this is perfect. Again, like my husband loves this one because it's a less feminine color as well. Yeah. Um, so it's great for like male crafters as well. Very obviously unisex, but yeah, perfect, perfect. Okay, and it's centimeters on one side, inches on the other. Yep. Uh, and remember, Box one maker. side is the base, the other side is the lid. Yep. So the lid's always a little bit bigger than the base, so it fits together. Yeah, they think of everything. We do. It's mm. amazing. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Beautiful and uh, we were all sworn to secrecy last year. You might <laughs> think it's a bit daft, but actually, no. If, if word had got out and you'd knew, known about this, um, yeah, the powers that be wouldn't have been happy at Hunky Dory. It was a really, really te uh, yeah, Top closely secret. guarded secret. Top secret. Top yeah. secret. Because <laughs> it's a lovely thing. And, uh, you know, a lot of us are very passionate about our mm. tools and about what we buy to help us with our crafting. Why not have something that looks amazing yeah. and different that not many other people will have the chance to get? 100%. There you go. Cool. Bit of a cue on the phones for this now. I'm not at all surprised. Um, yeah, and you can just see how smooth the plastic is there as well. Amazing. You get a perfect score every yep. time. Lynette in Somerset's there, Lois in Greater Manchester, Christine in Essex, James in Merseyside's checked out. Uh, yeah, the Crafting Handbook 6 is actually a tenner. So it's like you're getting this for 30 quid yeah. um, with the score tool as well. Um, it's really well manufactured. It is, isn't it? Absolutely. Really nice and sturdy. But again, nice and thin, nice and light. So it's the best of both worlds, yep. really. Yeah. Put maybe a little cup hook or something like that yep. in your craft room, hang it yep. there so it's easily accessible, ready to go when you need it. Yeah. And there's nothing to, to, to wear off with this either because it's all embossed. It is, yeah. We, um, I, no I believe we've got that. a special like mould made for this, um, which is just incredible. Yeah, the nice rigid measurements. These, these measurements, your numbers, they're not going to wear off. No. They're not going to scratch off. They are just going to last you years and years and years. Okay, you know? well, just thought I'd let you know, my first time with the board, I know it launched a couple couple of days ago but just in case you didn't see it uh, here it is it's available and it's flying the color I just adore it now also we've got some more fantastic luxury craft pads yes, we do. but these are different to the three for two that I just showed you a few minutes ago and you can't I, I think I said that you could get the three for two in the pick and mix you can't unfortunately so three for two yep. you can either buy them on their own or as the three for two offer but the other ones that we've got from previous shows these are available as a buy any two yeah. for 1998 yeah 1998 so it's less than 10 pounds each so if i quickly flick through them and show them to you true blue is obviously blue in color but mixed with silver, silver foiling. foiling absolutely beautiful the same setup for each one um so we'll just you know we'll just very quickly show you what you get in here um but again True all blue. Of you, we haven't all got of many of True Blue. Just basically select the two that you want or phone the call centre and they will get the two that you ask, uh, ask for. Um, this one is Blush Moments. Yep, we've got stock of this. Now, this is always massively popular because it's one of the few that have actually got pink foil. Pink foiling. Yeah. It's beautiful. And blush Moments, you've got um, the beautiful pink dove yeah. in there as well lots of pink roses pink as well as well as very in at the moment certain movie came out oh, yeah <laughs> so we're finding that pink is very very on trend right now oh, i had an email about that yesterday <laughs> available now to buy and I, thought, mm, I don't know everyone's um, saying you should get it okay absolutely well. but like i say very very popular very on trend if you've got fans of that then this is just perfect to to do all your crafting with so that's your blush moments yep. Then we've got uh, Hydrangea. Now, I remember this being really popular, actually. Yeah, yeah, this is beautiful. And this has actually got little um, definitions and little poems and that sort of thing on it as well. There we are. Yeah. Little so we've got a nice mixture, haven't we? Love it. Yeah, absolutely stunning. So the, the formation is the same, 4-4-4. This is yep. adorable, scorable. This, um, this one's Matastic. Matastic, sorry. 
Uh, yeah, so this one you can add your effects and yeah. your distress inks and all that sort of thing yeah. to it as well. But really lovely. It's got a, a mixture of florals and also kind of um, jottings and notes. Yeah, and like it's notebooks. gorgeous, isn't it? Yeah. Beautiful. And then you've got apertures in there on the inserts. So you can stamp your own verse if you want to, write your own sentiments. So that one is called Forever Floral Hydrangeas. Then we go on to Perfect Pansies. Now, this is back to the coated cardstock. You can see the difference. It it's got the shine to it. Yeah, it's a beautiful satin finish, this one, isn't it? Look at this. Wow. So cute. And floral, but so different to the sort of vintage tones of the hydrangea one. Yeah. You know, you've got your bright colours. You've got your busy flowers. Um, absolutely beautiful. Um, the most important thing to hold on to in life is each other. I know, it's so oh. sweet, isn't it? Isn't Absolutely that? lovely. But look, it's a riot of colour. Absolutely yeah. beautiful yeah. summer colours, really uplifting. Again, more beautiful foiling on here too. So this one, what did I call this one? Perfect, Perfect pansies. pansies. This one. Perfect pansies. Nice. And then the inserts are at the back there. Yeah, okay. of course, you get all of those. Cool. Then we've got Garden Party. I mean, this is just a testament to how popular they are, that we've done this many. And we've done, we've done, you know, previous ones that have, that have been and gone because they've been ever so popular. Um, but yeah, we have got so, so many to choose from. And it is because you guys at home love them. And I'm, I'm, a, I'm an absolute fan of the, uh, the stamp edge yeah. effect. And that's that what you've got here. It's so nice, this. that one. Love it. Very kind of cute gardens, this is Very, it? Yeah. yeah. It's got a really nice, yeah, botanical, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, very, very pretty. And then Mactastic on the cardstock, again, for yeah. adding your effects. Perfect. Yeah. So four of them are just printed, other four are printed and foiled, and then your uh, inserts are at the back. Then we've gone to, now I remember this being massive, um, Peacock Garden. Mm. Oh yeah. Look at those, those rich jewel colours in there. Oh. oh. It doesn't get any richer than this, It does really it? doesn't, so dramatic. Purples, turquoises, golds. Here we go, look. Look at that. How gorgeous is that? Strutting its stuff, the peacock. Stunning. Lots of little verses there as well. It's your birthday. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. And then on to the A4. Mm. Do you Adorable like, do you back a, uh, fussy cut it? Uh, yeah, fussy cut it. Yeah. Obviously, all your fancy folds, your easels, your fold backs. Um, anything like that. Yeah, it's adorable squirrel, 350 GSM. So we don't, you know, just because it's in a craft pad rather than one of our ultimate collections, we don't scrimp on no, the quality, same quality, anything like that. It's exactly the same. Yeah, 100%. Okay, then we've got how many more to go? Three or four. Um, Forever Florals, the Rose Deluxe Craft Card. These are, make, these remember, are any two for 19.98. Yeah. So there should be 11.99 each. So you're saving best, basically three pounds. You get one for under a tenner. Yeah. Yeah, amazing, aren't they? Again, oh. just so, so, each one is just so, so different. Um, you know, you can, they don't take up very much room. Again, they'll just go in all of your traff, you know, you well, They're perfect trolleys. if you're, um, you know, going away for weekends yeah. in the caravan or something like that. 100%. This has got everything you want apart from adhesive in one place. Yeah, yeah, yeah 100%, yeah. Now, cheers to you. There we go. This, I remember this one being a very, very firm favourite. Yeah. Definitely. You've got some masculine theme cars. Uh, or, or toppers in here. You've got some, yeah, brogues. Hot yeah. party balloons. Yeah, absolutely. And of course, a tipple or two. Yeah, I know. Really elegant, that damask as well, isn't it? So you're, nice. you've not, you're not old, you've just aged to perfection. Yeah. yeah perfect. I, can, oh, I like Ooh, that. Ooh, your red wine. Yeah, your whiskey. Yep. And then your beers, bottle of beer, all the yeah. design of beers lined and up. again, look at that cardstock. It's beautiful, isn't it? So, so cool. Oh, love that. Love, 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 love So again, that. if you struggle with masculine cards or whatever, that, that, this is going to go a long way for you. There's the inserts again. So 11 99 for that one. That's called Cheers to You. I've got a few more, sorry. Um, Butterfly Blue. Any two. Oh, look, blue foiling now. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, there's loads with luxurious foiling in here. Yeah, 100%. We've had the pink foiling. Now we've got the blue foiling. And who doesn't love a butterfly? I know. You've got the cakes, the teacups in there. So, so pretty. Really ditzy, this one. Beautiful. Aww. Okay, I'll speed up a little bit. Uh, a sparkling season. Yeah, so we've got oh. Christmas and everyday ones. Oh, oh. look at that. Oh. Now, this, this is holographic glitter at its finest. It looks like it's a snowstorm. It does, yeah. 
And this would go well with the new one, wouldn't it? Yeah, the Under the Moonlight. Yeah, yeah. obviously this one's a little bit brighter, a bit more contemporary, like pastel colours. Um, but yeah, it's the same feel, it's the same foiling. So if you do want to mix and match, you absolutely can do. Penguins, yeah. deer in the park. Little sheepies. Yeah, love it. Polar bears. I mean, look at that foiling. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Do you want two the same? Yeah, yeah. you can have both the same absolutely. if you want to. It's, it's any two for 19.98. If you've got a favourite that you're absolutely gutted that you keep running out of, get two. Yeah. Get them for under a tenner each yeah. rather than 11.99 each. Um, Towards the night before Christmas, this is another firm favourite mm. of mine. This, you, you do remember the, the book, Twas the Night Before Christmas, that Hunky Dory did that you could make up and, and keep as like a, uh, an heirloom yes. sort of thing? Yes, yep. Well, this is the card version of that, isn't it? The artwork matches, yes. Yeah. So if you want to do matching cards, boxes, etc., you absolutely can do. Look at him. Love the artwork. Oh, it's so jolly. He's the Santa that we all know and <laughs> he love. He is. Well-fed, smiling, beaming face. Oh, yeah. And Rosie the story. The story of the... Yeah. Get the verses throughout on here. Yep. Oh, look at that. There he is, job done. <laughs> so nice, isn't it? I mean, that's that's really the, th the sort of traditional Christmas yeah. that, that I absolutely adore yeah. and love. Me too, me too. So it was the night before Christmas with the inserts as well. Uh, again, if you want that as part of your any two for 1998. Um, Winter Forest. Yeah, again, this is another one that's great for like non-Christmas winter occasions, you know, yeah. your winter weddings, your winter birthdays, anniversaries. I mean, just look at that elegantly yeah. there. Beautiful. Mm. It's not just Christmas, it's yeah. uh, any occasion during the winter time, absolutely. absolutely. Yeah, if you've got a November, December, even January birthday, these are going to be perfect. Well, my wedding anniversary is New Year's Eve. Yes, I did know that actually. Yeah, so, exactly, you yeah. know. And anything like this would be really appropriate. Wouldn't absolutely. it? Absolutely. So eleven ninety nine for that one. That's the winter forest. Then we've got rose quartz dreams. Yeah, two this more after this. Yeah, we've got two more after this. So this again, this is one of our everyday ones. It's very glamorous, um, quite dark and moody in a good way. Mm. Pink and mm. black. It's very like very nice. Oh, yeah. This one. Two swans, swans next, making you know, your, your heart. Ball gown. Rich damask as well. Yeah, absolutely stunning. Yeah, gorgeous. The only trouble is making your mind up, isn't it, as to what two you want. Oh, yeah. If you, you want all it. of them, feel yeah. free. Yeah. Oh, this is Laura's favourite, I think. Penguin party. Yes. <laughs> this is a really current one. Yeah, this, was, this came out in our last launch, I want to say a few weeks ago. Before these... Be the, this one was the most recent before these three yeah, today. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Look at how cute they are. I think, oh, yeah, <laughs> they're stunning. I, 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 tell you, I do find penguins absolutely hilarious. They're adorable, aren't they? Adorable Especially and fun. Really cute, fun artwork. Again, perfect for the kids' cards, baby's first Christmas. School cards as well for their friends. You know, kids are going to have an absolute whale of a time with these craft pads because they're so, so easy. Um, and the last one is... Oh. The Little Red Robin. Have we saved the most popular one to the end? I think so. I think so. Judging by how popular yeah. our Robin collection was in the last show, uh, I think anything to do with Robin at the moment, we can't keep in stock. It just absolutely goes so quickly. Look at these. That one in the last hour went crazy. So if you want more Robins for your yeah. collection, four sheets of toppers, you can get at least two or three cards, maybe even four, out of each sheet of those toppers. And then you've got the card stock there as well. Mm. Beautiful, aren't they? Stunning. I didn't remember that you did a Robin one of these, actually. Yeah, we did. Yeah, it was it, it was ever so popular, this one. Again, like I say, Robin, we're Robin crazy, aren't we? We love Robin. Well, if you put one of these in your basket, you'll be charged eleven ninety nine. If you put two of them in your basket, you'd be charged nineteen ninety eight, And it could be two the same, two individually different. It's entirely up to you. Do remember, though, the brand new offer that was only uh, available from yesterday is where you get one of them free. So this is the best deal of all. Buy three, but only pay for two. Yeah. So that would be 23.98 for Winter Wildlife, Deck the Halls, and Under the Moonlight. You get all three of them for the price of two, which is amazing. So, Such good value. Yeah, whichever way you want to do it, two for 11, uh, sorry, two for 19.98, or any three for two, that's fine. Loads in baskets now. You're making up your mind as to which ones you'd like to do. If you want um, four for 29.96, is that right? 
No, 39.96. Yeah, 39.96. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Look at the baskets. Absolutely. Oh, Everyone's wow. going mad. Lots of you going for twos and fours and sixes and so on. Fill, fill your boots. Enjoy. Hunky-dory quality. You choose the theme that's right for you. Okay, while you're all checking out your baskets on the, uh, the two for 1998, um, we'll get on with another demo. We are going to get on with another demo. We're going to go with that um, beautiful Forever Florals one. Um, and we're going to bring the scoreboard in for this. So let's grab my score tool out. So I've gone for this beautiful blue um, piece of cardstock here. I've trimmed it down to 28, but I haven't trimmed my width on this down so what I want to do is like a sort of center stepper so we're going to go in with our usual measurements so I want to score all the way along at 14 and then what I want to do I think I want to leave five centimeters in between the sides so we're going to score at 21 and then I want to score at 10 and then six and three and then again I just want to go from sort of like say five centimeters so one two three. yeah if we go to the 16 you can obviously you can put lines in if you find that easier and then what you do is you grab your trimmer super super easy this is from then, deck the halls isn't it this is from yeah. the deck the halls pad yeah so I'm just gonna squeeze that I don't know where that acetate's from perfect so I'm just gonna go with my trimmer and then I'm just going to Score from five. I'm just going to go from the first to the last score line, swizz it round, line it up at five again, and again, we're going to go with this one. Okay, so then once we've got our stepper, they're so easy to make with your scoreboard, and then this is going to be our card. So it's just going to all fold up beautifully. Okay. Okay, perfect. Excellent. So then that's going to be my stepper, just like that. Super, super easy. I've popped out my toppers as well, just for a little bit of speed. And we are going to just pop those just in the middle here. So I think I'm going to go with that gorgeous big one at the centre point here. Isn't it just? Mm -hmm. We're going to have our deck the halls with boughs of holly. And we're going to, yeah, let's, now that we've got my layout. They're very um, stylish colours, aren't they? They're quite very. an unusual palette of colours. Well, such a vintage theme. I actually think it's quite contemporary. Yeah. You know, you get the nice, really nice, um, very on-trend, like, mason jars, mm -hmm. the unusual kind of colour palette, you know, blue. Um, but it's not, you know, like a frosty blue. It's quite a nice cornflower mm. colour. It's really pretty. So, again, we're just going to pop, pop our toppers on, our steps, just on here. So we're going to put this one quite centrally. Such an easy card to make, this one. You know, and you can be making these steppers. You might never have made one before. You treat yourself to the scoreboard. Oh, my goodness. Piece of cake. <laughs> Absolute piece of cake. You're going to be making them all the time. I'll tell you what, it, it will, I'm, I'm, I'm bound to say, and it is the truth, that it will become one of your most used tools the on scoreboard. a regular daily basis. Oh, yeah, yeah absolutely. 100%. Multi-award winning. Yeah, absolutely. Now in this new limited edition colour? It's beautiful, isn't it? So we're going to have deck the halls with boughs of holly, and then we're going to have perfect, and we're going to pop that one there. So let's get one of our sort of foam pad strips for this jar. Um, so again, we're just going to pop that onto there. Awesome. And then we'll just peel that off. I'm just putting foam pads on the bits that I do. Obviously, I don't want to put it all the way up because that's going to show. It's, we're going to stick our card together if we do that. Mm -hmm. And we don't really want that. And then we're going to get these. Again, we've been a little bit little bit looks with this one, a little bit fancy. So we're going to um, put loads of our toppers on here. So I'm just going to trim the pips off because they're a little bit proud from where they've come out of my deluxe craft pad. So I'm just going to just trim my scissors round on there and pop those on with some foam pads as well. And we're gonna pop those down one side. And again, you can put as many or as few as you like on. In fact, we've got these two circular buttons. So we'll have those at either end and then we'll have our square one in the middle as well. Um, so we've got May Your Christmas Bloom, that's a sentiment on here. So we'll just pop that on as well. And then, perfect. So we'll pop that just on the sort of the top left. 
and then we'll pop our little square one on there, our little poncettia, and then we've got this little sort of star, which is super, super cute. So again, we'll just pop that onto there. Don't forget, anything that you buy from Hunky Dory at the moment gets you into the drawer Absolutely. for a goodie bag. Absolutely, it really does. That looks like this. Mm. Can't tell you exactly what's in there, but yeah, if you buy something from Rebecca and I today in these shows tomorrow at one o'clock, Zena and Anne-Marie will announce the winner of the next two goodie bags and we'll do it again tomorrow for the next day. So Absolutely. Every reason to shop and buy. So much fun. And then on this side, I'm just going to put, where can I put these? Fat. Let's see if we can go with four of our large, these are our sepia ones, which I thought go perfectly. You've got all these oh, yeah. vintage brown tones on here. So we're just gonna put one, one at each point of my card. And then I think we're ready to leave it at that. Okay. So let's just make some room so that we can show this little card off. Let's give it a little burnish with our tool just right here. And then, there we go. And then that will just stand up perfectly for you. Look at that. Isn't it? Got, look at, again, so much dimension up among those steps. It's a really fun card to do. So remember, that's from Deck the Halls. Yes. Um, it is all um, matte-tastic. Yep. So that basically is adorable, scorable, but not the shiny. It's the, the matte, matte, which yeah. you can add effects to as well. But it really does suit the kind of vintage look. Yeah, it does. Uh, so that on its own, if you want to go for it, you can. It's 11 99 But if you buy these new three, Deck the Halls, Winter Wildlife, and Under the Moonlight, you'll get one of them mm. free, which is always a really good feeling. Um, RTHD 58 RTHD 58. Now, do remember, I, I took a bit of time doing it, but I wanted you to see all the individuals that are available. Those three are completely separate, okay? Yep. They're not in the pick and mix. But all of the other ones that we've shown you already today are Ooh. in the <laughs> pick and mix. There are 60 of you that have checked out and another 50 in baskets, I believe, as well. Um, now, any two, 1998. Yeah. Incredible. So if you want any four, that would be thirty nine ninety six. Karen in Surrey has bought ten. Wow! Hey, is that all of them? Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. There's uh, fifteen or sixteen of them. Amazing. Wow, Karen, that's amazing. So two for eleven nine, uh, two for nineteen ninety eight. So five. So you spent just under a hundred pounds. You've spent about nine ninety nine ninety for pads. ten craft pads. Brilliant. And one PMP. Yeah. That's the way to do it. I like I like Karen. I like Dorothy too, and Janet, and Elaine, and uh, Elizabeth. Many of you are going for two. Kay in Worcestershire's gone for two. Susanna in Lanarkshire. Okay. Rose Quartz Dreams. I think a few of them may have sold out. Yeah. We haven't got the Rose Quartz. That's gone, on. I believe. Still got Penguin Party. Still got the Little Red Robin. Oh, that surprises me. That's still there. Still got the Winter Forest. Twas the Night Before Christmas, still got that. Sparkling Season, yeah, still got that. Butterfly Ooh, Blue's gone. gone. Sold out. Cheers to you, we've still got. Forever Florals Rose. We've got this one. That one's Yay. still available, yep. Don't have the rose, gone. that's gone. gone. The hydrange is what we've got. Peacock Garden, that, yeah, we've got that one. Garden Party. That one's gone. 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 Perfect Pansies. Still got that one. Hydrangea. Yep, still got that. Blush Moments. That's gone. Gone, 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 gone. gone. Oh. Hang on. What about True Blue? I think this one's gone. That's gone as well. Gone. All right, so these are the only ones we've got left now. Wow, look wow. at that. Penguin you... Party. Little Red Robin. Winter Forest. Twas the night before Christmas, sparkling season, cheers to you, peacock garden, perfect pansies, and forever florals hydrangea. Oh they are goodness. the only ones we have available, <laughs> and they are two, any two, for 19.98. Now, if you're not happy doing it on the website, which I know some people aren't, I feel your pain. 
<laughs> if you go to our, our phone number, our free phone number, that's the call centre. Just tell them which two pads you'd like. They'll sort that out for you and make sure you're going to get charged 1998. Okay, 0800 001 4433. The call will cost you nothing. They're live in our call centre above our heads in the UK, just outside Birmingham. They're brilliant. They'll even set up an account for you as well uh, if you haven't shopped with us before. How cool is that? Very right, we've got enough time to do... Squeeze in another squeeze demo. Squeeze in another demo. Yeah, yeah we've got about right. 10 minutes. Let's just make some room. I'll just move these... <laughs> Um, craft pads out of the way we'll get that card out of the way and then obviously we're going to finish with our third and final new one yep of course uh, it's under the moonlight mm -hmm. under the moonlight uh, under the moonlight on its own it's 11.99 but if you buy that together with okay. well I've mixed them all up now I? <laughs> <laughs> oh darn it I always do that um, yeah if you buy the three together under the moonlight uh, deck the halls. What was the other one called? Under the moonlight. Deck the halls. Oh, winter wildlife. Winter wildlife. Sorry. Yeah. All those three. Just twenty three ninety eight. You're buying three, but you're only paying for two. So we've got our amazing rainbow mirror. It's making the cameras go a bit crazy. We've got this eleven by seven. So what we're going to do is we are going to score at one and a half. And we're going to score at three. Mary at three tomorrow. Then we want a five by seven panel. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Score at eight. And then one and a half, nine and a half, and there we go. So this is going to make us a really nice sort of double fold back card. So just going to, with Miri, you always score on the back. You do not want to be scoring the front. It will scratch the sort uh, of coat in. Good point. So we always score on the reverse. And um, again, it just gives you that really nice clean line. And then again, on to there. Okay. So let's move the scoreboard out of the way and then grab my cardstock. So I've already cut this down to size just for speed. And what I want to do is pop it on here. So we've got our two pieces here that are gonna go here. We've got this one again to go in the middle. And then we're gonna do a bit of fussy cutting with this one. Okay. Super exciting. Sounds so good. Let's get this matted and layered. Just look at their little faces. Aren't they sweet? Again, what a perfect card for a new family. Like I say, baby's first Christmas. Anyone just celebrating those precious sort of Christmas memories. It's amazing. Or just anyone that loves the wildlife. Um, I'm not surprised this one's one of the most popular that yeah. we've got today. Under the moonlight it's called. I mean if you wanted to go for a couple you could do. Um, yeah why not? The deal really is you buy the three of them and you get one of them yeah. free so that's the best way of doing it. It is, honest. it is. Um, but obviously if you want to buy any extras or, or anything like that um, you absolutely can do. So, again, I'm just going to grab my double-sided tape off of here. Okay. I'm going to mat and layer that just in there. It's a little bit tight for those score lines, but we can snug that in. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. And then what I want to do is grab my acetate, and what I want to do is score this at uh, half an inch, I think. Okay. So, again, we're just going to do that on the scoreboard. I love this scoreboard. Um, so we're just going to pop that on there. And then we're going to grab our red tape and we're going to pop a little bit on to each side of my card. So if I just grab that. And then we'll pop that just onto there, like so. Want this on each side. And then we're going to put that in the sort of centre of our card. Mm -hmm. Just again to give it that really nice little window. Again, this feels like a really luxurious kit. I think it needs that that touch of luxury, that really nice sort of finish there. To be fair, it. I think all the pads yeah. feel like and look like luxury. They, they do, don't gorgeous. they? It's just a case of what your personal preference is. Whether you Absolutely. like wildlife, whether you like flowers, whether you like kind of um, Victorian. Now this one okay. is going very very well individually. If that's all you want and you only just want to spend eleven ninety nine, that's fine. Under the moonlight, you can have that for that. Yeah. Um, and one PMP for the entire day. Absolutely. Okay, that's not as big as what I thought it was. It's fine. What we can do is we can, what I would normally do is if that was to the right length, I would have just squeezed that in there. So I'm just going to see. I might have some more on here. So we'll just do that one again. So we need that at seven by seven. I think originally I was going to make this a four by six card, so I've cut it to slightly the wrong size, but that's fine. We can do that again. So we're going again, half an inch at each side, 
and then we'll pop that on there. So again, we'll go in with our red tape again. There we go. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Where will we be without red liner tape? Oh my God, I couldn't live without red liner tape. I would not want to think about a world without red tape. I use it every single day. Um, so again, I'm just going to pop that on my tabs and I'm really hoping now that that should fit. Yeah, here we go. So we're going to pop. They're so sweet. <laughs> By the way, tomorrow the fun continues with Hunky Dory with Anne Marie from one. Uh, four hours of Anne Marie tomorrow, yes. including the Miri at three o'clock. I've got Anne Marie at five and seven tomorrow evening. Yeah, absolutely. And more chances to win a goodie bag. This is it. We, we are here all week. You know, we're already on Wednesday. This week has gone so fast. It's been so much fun. So we're just going to pop that. When did in the there. birthday celebration start? Was that Monday? Monday, yeah, yeah. Monday. So it's only day three. Only day three, I know. So we've just got that really nice sort of like bowed kind of bay window look to our card there. So we're just going to pop our toppers on now. So we are going to grab our foam pads. And again, I've done this really nice and deep so that you can still see that beautiful image. We're not going to cover it up too much with our toppers. Um, and again, we're just going to grab some foam pads on here. And then pop a little one on here as well. Okay. Absolutely beautiful. Well, it's been good to see you today. Yeah, but it's been so fun, hasn't yeah. it? A little catch up. Yeah, absolutely. Very quick one. Let's not make it two months before I see you again. I so hope not. No. I hope not. Well, it's always good to celebrate anyone's birthday, but when it's one of your favourite crafting companies, you win, everyone wins. I think so, 100%. Just so nice. Okay, so we're just going to pop that in the centre. And then again, let's get some nice chunky foam pads on this next topper, which is our, again, we've got that really sweet little polar bear finish on here. Okay. And then... I'm going to pop that on there. Awesome. Awesome. And then what we're going to do is I'm just going to grab my pad here because I'm just going to finish off with a sentiment and then we'll see how much time we've got and then we can pop something else on. So we've got Merry Christmas mm -hmm. and we've got your Snow Cute. Again, we just love our little, our little fun, cute, cheeky puns. So again, we're just going to pop those on. And then, again, just another way to use your scoreboard. Okay, so we've got your snow cute. And that holographic is beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely, it really is. it's stunning. It really looks like it's snowing. Mm, it really does, doesn't it? So we're going to move that out of the way. I'm going to add my final touch, which is this beautiful border. I was nearly going to think, no, we're going to run out of time, but I am going to do it. So we're just going to fussy cut this out. I think I can just about squeeze it in in the time. It's a nice one to sort of fussy cut here. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't leave this off, can you? Look That's not too fiddly to do. It's just a wave, isn't just it? Just a so. nice wave, yeah. I'm obviously being quite gentle because this is a very, very sharp blade. So I'm just going to gently kind of just meander around here. But yeah, it's a super easy one to... Uh, mm. There you go. Okay. I mean, if you want a craft knife that you can put trust in, the Hunky Dory it's one is one, what I chose. It's this one, isn't it? Absolutely. We're just going to. It's metal bodied, it's strong. You get 13 blades with it, which Absolutely. is incredible for $9.99. Okay. And then I think we're going to cut that down to sort of five inches and just have it across that middle. Um, so we'll pop that on there. And then, in fact, what we will do is we'll pop it just down this side, I think. So I've cut it a little bit too, just cut it a little bit too short. So I'm gonna pop it, mm, no, I'm gonna leave it off. I am gonna leave it off. <laughs> <sighs> Honestly, 
Crafter's prerogative, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, only because I've cut it too short. It looks fine as it is. It looks great. I know. I've cut it too short and then I was like, I need to use it. No, I don't. Should I use it? I don't know. It looks great. But like it's that. gorgeous. And then again, you've got that dimension. If you like that di if you like that kind of diorama card from yep. the two o'clock show, yep. it's a really similar look because you get that dimension. Well, remember, it's under the moonlight. That's the actual pad that that came from. And they, these pads, just in case you haven't seen them before and you've just got in or whatever, you get four sheets of toppers, four sheets of printed cardstock, four sheets of printed and foiled yeah. and then eight sheets of inserts all printed on the back this is the three for two so you get winter wildlife under the moonlight and that one which is deck the halls deck a vintage halls. beautiful vintage feel to it all three should be 11.99 each but if you buy these three you're going to get all of them all three for 23.98 so 11.99 saved Amazing. the only other way to get the other pads is in the pick and mix um, a hundred of these have now gone and many, many more putting them in your basket. There's now two, four, six, eight, there's nine left. Just so there's no confusion, you've got the hydrangea available, perfect pansies, peacock garden, cheers to you, sparkling season, twas the night before Christmas, winter forest, little red robin and penguin party those are all available okay. put any two in your basket could be two the same could be two completely yeah. different you'll only pay 19.98 okay uh, and that's why so many of you put more than two in many of you for four or six yeah. or eight or whatever um i've squeezed my border in i knew it was going to go Yay. somewhere it's gone in the middle there Excellent. i was like i knew that i was going to put that on there sorted fixed <laughs> uh, now quickly before i say goodbye and xena takes over the tote bag remember never available until today your go anywhere shopping bag with hunky dory logo here it is it's fabulous 6.99 it? it is great yeah only 6.99 loads of you went for it and loads of you have uh, bought more than one in actual fact and it's surprisingly strong you get a lot of weight and a yeah. lot of bulk in there as well but great to maybe fly the flag for hunky dory at craft fairs and run your local supermarket yeah. and that sort of thing as yeah. well okay thank you for your company today great to see you back and you today i'll be back tomorrow at five Zena's going to see you through the until eight o'clock here she's to tell you what's coming up between now and eight When you purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker. Maker, we want your shopping experience to be as simple as possible. That's why you can buy as many items as you like all day and only pay one postage and packaging fee. It doesn't matter what weight, size or quantity of your order or how many times you check out that day, you still will only be charged one p and p Shopping made simple with Hobbymaker. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gifts? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? If you've recently missed your favorite show on Hobbymaker, it's really easy to catch up on our website. Simply visit hobbymaker.co.uk and click TV Guide. Here you'll be able to choose any show broadcast in the last seven days, which you can watch, pause and rewind at your convenience. And to make shopping even easier, any items featured in the show will appear underneath. With Hobbymaker's catch up, there's never a reason to miss out, no matter what time of day.
Hello, my lovelies. Welcome to Hobby Maker. We've got a lovely lady that we've not seen for a while, the lovely Jane from Creative nice Expressions. To see you. I'm obsessed with her necklace. <laughs> I think I've commented on it about eight times. I can't stop looking at it. Well, it's kind of picked up all the colours that I'm it's using today. It's perfect. Did you make it or buy it? I bought it. It's lovely. Thank you. Lovely. You do well to get out of here wearing that today. <laughs> uh, so then, Jane, uh, you are one of the amazing designers from Creative Expressions and you have created your these incredible doodles, petal doodles. Petal doodles, yes, I have. I've drawn them all myself. I've, I love the little frog. Yeah. <laughs> They've all got something quirky on them. <laughs> yeah, haven't they? And these beautiful stamps that you can see here, all 12 of them that... Jane has, de has designed for you. They are the most lovely. I was just stood here reading in the, in the break. And there's the most lovely positive messages on them as well, isn't there? Yes, there are. I just thought it would be quite nice. It's very difficult to find something different. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah. The, yeah. I mean, there's one or two with maybe a happy birthday on it. But no, they are positive. In they're, love, they're really lovely. Positive. Like, never, never, yeah. ever give up. There's some really lovely. I've just been looking now. Some lovely characters. Beautiful petal doodles. They're absolutely stunning they really are and there, there's some lovely big flower designs on them as well isn't there there are big flowers but what i've done is left space for someone to doodle in them as well yeah and the greetings can fit inside the middle of the flower as well as the center so you've got a choice so you can actually create two different kinds of flower Perfect. they look different I'm just thinking as well, we, we do sand tangling with one of our, with Sandra from Sand Tangle. I'm just thinking some of these flower designs, the big ones, you could yes. then doodle within the petal doodles and do sand Abs tangling as well. Absolutely, yes. Yeah. You've got that opportunity as well. So there's a third look. Exactly. Yeah. So there's lots of options. So I'll tell you what we've done as well, because we've got, we're going to have some lovely demonstrations, because when you've got the designer in the studio of the actual designs, it's so exciting. It really is. Um, so what we're going to do is, there's two options. You can either have an I want them all uh, which we're hoping you do uh, and you can get those that is as always the most cost effective way to buy we can and that's that's what they should be always amazes me when you've got the artist here the designer stood here and then they let you take their beloved artwork that, uh, that labor of love and then we go and give it a saving on its brand new launch you're very generous i know oh, i know <laughs> i love that i so, know um, so uh, what we're going to do is we're going to give you the option to buy all 12 and then there is going to be a pick and mix option. So there's something for everybody. Okay, so if you want the whole 12, that is 69.99. So could you do me a favour? I should know my 12 times table. But could you just give me an idea how many that would be? Is it six pounds something each? It's all right, my lovely. <laughs> we'll get there. Oh, it's even better. Five pounds, 83, a stamp set. Wow. Good value. Very, Very good, good value. value. Yes, and look at all the stamps you've got on each set. You're worrying about that price now, aren't you? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, Ooh. Yeah, so when you look at, at how many stamps, you actually, it's 12 in total, but each stamp is a full set. So that's what's incredible. And they're absolutely jam-packed, aren't they, Jane? They are. You've got the verse. You've got little additions to go on the background. You've got the main image. You might have a little frog on there or I a love little him. bug. I saw, and the little spider. Yes, yeah, so there's, there's a spider big on spiders the everywhere at the minute, aren't yeah. they? very apt. Yeah. Goodness <laughs> gracious. Um, there is all gonna be an, also going to be an option to have the pick and mix. But I'll tell you what, before we get to the pick and mix, where you'll get three for less than 20, should we get Jane to give you a little close-up with how they look when they're printed and a sample? Yeah, should we do that, oh, Jane? Oh, let's do that. Yeah, I've let's do that. I've got them already that. here. Wonderful. Okay, now... So if we turn I'm them around and point them, them to that camera too when uh, we've got the lovely Michael, he's okay. going to come and zoom in on you, Jane. So there we've got... Uh, this is um, the petal doodles all bunched up, and that's what it looks like when, it's, when it's stamped out. Oh, there you go, perfect. Way. Okay, so this is the card I've created using that stamp. I'm going to put that one down and just hold that up. So this is, and I'm just finding the top of the card. There we go. It, yep, there we go. There's the card I've, um, I've oh, done that with that set. So you fabulous. can see how colourful they can be. Can't, and they're so, as you say, if you want to fill the entire card, yes, they do the whole yes. lot, don't they, in one go? But I've got a little trick that you can do to create that white space. So watch this space. Oh, good, because we like a designer 
trick yes. and tip. The yes, next one we've way. got is, um, this is Petal Doodle's Happy Soul. And we've got three small little flowers here. So if you like making smaller cards, this is ideal for you because you could use them one on each card or you could use all th three. Or if you could be like me and oh, use all that. four. So all the little stamps that come with the set are all on the background so that you can make an interesting background. Oh, these are fabulous, Jane. I love that. Do, make, do more of what makes your soul happy. Yes. Well, that's crafting, isn't it? Here we've got Do Petal Doodles, Happy Thoughts. Nice to have a happy thought. Absolutely. And we've got a dragonfly in here. It's actually not part of the flower. It's a loose stamp, so don't panic about that. So there's a what, gap there. I've got an idea. Shall I do these on the oh, left? And shall, okay. I have, shall I be your okay. third hand, Jane? Oh, it'd be nice to have would, an assistant. You would, wouldn't it? I'll be your assistant, Jane. So Free there of you, charge as oh, well. So you can see what you can do with it. <laughs> So you can either you can either put the centre, which is this one here, mm -hmm. in the middle, or you can put the burst Brilliant in the middle. Idea. Or so you can zantangle. You've got, you've got, or you can zantangle. Doodle away, exactly. yeah. Then we have got the never give up, and never, we, never, 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 ever, never, never give ever, up. Give ever, up. ever. So he's quite a blank looking flower, but then I give you the choice of putting the greeting in the middle or the center of the flower. And this card sample shows them both in both. position. So you can see that they both can go on a card. You can stamp them twice. Mm -hmm. I've done some extra doodles on them yep. and you've got a nice curly line there that can be used as That's a, a in the background. That's a lovely border, isn't it, as well? And a frame. Yeah, yeah. Yep. We've got that one Gorgeous. there. Then we have, um, this is Petal Doodles with Love. Do all things with love. That's what we should oh, do, yeah. shouldn't we, Jane? And there we go, it looks like, like that. So you, again, you've got little flowers, you've got separate leaves so that you can have it with or without leaves. I like the little ladybird. And there's a little, well, I don't think it's a ladybird. I think oh, is it's it some, not? It's one of those little bugs you get in the garden that kind of sort of stick to you. Oh, you ever seen oh them? the ones that you have to brush off. Yeah, they're sort yeah. of, they're quite, quite a hard little shell on them. Mm. I don't know what they're called. Dave. <laughs> <laughs> So that's with love. And now we've got a lovely big sunflower with a, oh, a lovely love little swan. ladybird. On. Oh, no, this is a ladybird. You're quite right. Yes. And I'm going to pick that little one I've stamped on, I've, on a bit of paper. There we go. So again, it's got a blank middle. And I've got two things, two centres, the wording and the centre. The leaves are separate. And it's got a little curly, curly stem to it as well. So you can that's see how I've used this, this curly stem. And create a life you love. Oh, yeah, we forgot to say that, didn't we? Mm. And there's little little circles to stamp and create on the background. All sorts mm. of things you can do with that do one. Do you feel like you've created a life that you love? Yes, I have, actually. Good. I've been Good. a rubber stamper for a long, long time. Well, there you so go. There that's you go. She's sorted. <laughs> there we got Petal Doodles Take Care. This has as a big tulip style. Wow. And um, a big leaf. And one of our design team is very, very clever and created a flower out of the this this little leaf here. She just stamped it lots and lots of times, cut Beautiful. it up and Clever stuck idea, it round the centre, which I thought was a really ingenious idea. I never even thought of that. That sheet it, to me looks like it's got a tiara crown on. Oh yeah. It's lovely. But oh, those wordings fit inside. Yeah, take care of yourself. Then we have be happy. <laughs> the look at the look at can we sm can we can we go in on the little bee's face? He's very and happy. And again, he's separate <laughs> in the middle of the stamp set, so you can take him out and put the centre or the word "be happy." But he's cute, isn't he's he? He's really cute. Now you can cut him out or whatever you like to do with him. He's lovely. He's Brian. <laughs> You're giving names to we them are. All. Right, this one is. Is this on there? You make the world a better place. It is. Oh, Jane, that's this is lovely. Pretty place. Oh, a prettier place. A you prettier make the world place. a prettier place. Yes. Oh. So it's quite small, so it fits in the centre of the flower. Yeah. yeah. And um, what a lovely got... sentiment. Oh, that's nice. I like that. You like that? I do. So we've got a swiggly bit that can go in the middle. Yeah. You've got teeny weeny little sort of dragonfly, and you've got two little smaller images for your backgrounds this as well. I mean, we're not we're not even done yet, and we're still at this. Why they're five pounds yeah. eighty three each, and I think this is something to really bear in mind when you're having a bad day. Each day oh, is a yeah. gift, <coughs> and it really is. It really yeah, is. Each day is a gift. This is, has the little frog on it. <laughs> He's my favourite. <laughs> 
So again, you've got a separate leaf, a curly stem, and I love that little frog. And he looks fantastic painted green in the in the inks that we've got on today. Yeah. Oh, is that the pigment stains? Yes. Yes, wonderful. Yes. Okay. Yes. He's such a can you do me a favour, I'm so sorry, but the des this is all <laughs> hand drawn up. by Jane. Yeah. Every single element that Jane has drawn is so characterful. The leaves, the doodles, the flowers, the way the sentiments work in the set. I love these because they look like lemons or lime wedges as well in the centre of the flowers. Oh, do they? I think so. Oh, yeah, like a cut-up cake or something. Yeah, they're lovely. This is, I've oh. got a few samples of that yeah. one. This is the, this is the um, bug doodles. And these can be on a separate card, all on their own. Or you can add them to some of the other cards if you wanted to. So you've got seven on there with that lovely spider. They're great. Oh, there is some big spiders. They look, they look great coloured in. Yeah. All, all the colours that I've used on, the, on these samples, the orange, pinks. And these are nice for kids' cards as well because there's a lot of kids yeah. that like to go out in the garden with their big magnifying glasses. Good idea. Look, you know, yeah. the bugs and yes. things. Or if somebody's yeah. really, really annoying you, yes. you really bug me, you do. Do oh, that, I, well, I didn't have room for a, oh. a, a greeting on that, have that one. Have next time. All right, then. <laughs> and then, of course, I've got some um, doodle stitches. These I've used for borders or from on all the cards to oh, frame Oh, so like them. that one there. Oh, yeah, all those yeah, three brilliant. you've got, got there you. show lots of different borders. They've all got something different on them to, so you can see how you Isn't can good. use them. That's, you're going to get a lot of use out of that, aren't you? That I one? think so. I and like it, that one. Again, they're all hand-drawn. I've drawn them all. So they're all, um, they all fit with the style of, the, of the, the flowers. I love that because the thing is, you could do that, but you wouldn't get that sort of, although you don't want it uniform, it's that really nice little yeah, spot it, dash it matches, all the way around, It matches it? the sketchy yeah. feel of the flower as well. It's brilliant. Yes. And a real time saver because you've got to do that flick of that, you know, can I just show you all those borders, Becky, please? Because I just want to really want to get in and show because they're oh, all four borders. Oh, is it lovely? Yeah. Oh, you can't get the assistance, yeah. can you, Jane? So that's the one with the little flicks that we were just talking yeah. about. Yeah, lovely. Little cross hatch there as well. And then as you go into the, uh, this one here, look as well. I've got the dotted, dotted lines around the base card and then you've got the other one on the, the main card. So if I turn that up there, look so you can see. Yeah. And then you've got this one here. These look brilliant. And then I like this one. And then you've got the little, little zigzag stitch you can do on a sewing machine. Do you know, I do that under all my work. Everything I do. Yeah. I do, yeah, I, 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 look, see, look. Oh, a little. I, yeah. I do it under oh, everything yes, I do. Yeah. Oh, I do wow. a zigzag. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I could stamp it instead of drawing it. It'd be much quicker. Um, so, um, these are lovely. Thank you. Absolutely Thank you. lovely. You should put those on the top and then we're oh, in the same order, aren't we? Yeah. So, I know that in the last couple of seconds, Rita and Margaret have just come in and got the big I want it all, and I oh. don't blame you. Absolutely stunning. Um, we are going to have a lovely demo, and we've got some beautiful stencils to go with it. Basically, um, if you've checked out today already, you might as well grab these four stencils because we're practically giving them away, aren't we? They're well. fantastic because yeah. you don't need a huge stencil for these. They just want little bits in the background. And they're perfect. Yeah. So we've got a pack of four stencils uh, to go with it. We've got the, um, the Cosmic Shimmer um, Cloud uh, blends as well. And we've got the pigment stains. And we've got the, um, what do you call them? I always forget. Smoothies. Uh, and but it's all about Jane stamps today. So if you would like a pick and mix option as well, if you're thinking I love them, but I want to hand pick which ones I fancy, you're gonna mm. basically if you put that code into your basket GN two eight two seven, and you select three, it'll ch it'll save give you a saving and it's gonna charge you eighteen pounds ninety two. Now, if at any point you think, right, I can't remember which one's which, if you just message in by going to the homepage, which is hobbymaker.co.uk, and you click on Watch Live, there's a send message. Thank you, Dan. There's a send message option there, look. And all you do is write in there and just say which one you want to see, and we'll show them again. All right, so if you want to do that, then message in if there's any query at all. I mean, it does tell you the names of them, but if you think, oh, no, I'd like to see them again, we'll do that for you. Okay, my lovelies? Who's that? Oh, there you go. Hi, Zena and Jane. Have a fun time. Oh. That's from our gallery. Oh, that's nice. That's, yes. that's yeah, nice. Isn't that yeah. lovely? Do you want to leave those there with me so oh, that if I need yes, to show any, of Jane? Of course you can. Think? I'll go, I'll put these on my demo desk. Yeah. And do you want to see, hang on to these? Just in case I, I might need to, need show to them. steal a couple. You can show them when, I, oh, when I'm doing the demo. Thank you. Never mind. Thank you. 
Do you want me to borrow your necklace? No, no. Okay. <laughs> I'll go and... Uh, she knows I'm after that necklace. Then. Yes, please. Yes, please. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, so if there's any queries, all you need to do, if you just, if you want to choose your three, you've got some time. You can have a nice little, nice little peruse and have a little look. It might be that you want the borders. It might be that you want all those lovely bogs or you want each one of the sentiments. So just let me know if you need to see them again. Happy, because we did go through them, didn't we? There's 12 to choose from. And just think about the, the message you know, it might be the take care of yourself. It might be the never, never, ever give up. It might be the, you know, uh, be happy. It might be whichever one it is. The, the names are in the title, but if you do want to see them again, then let me know and I'll do that. So pop it in your basket, choose the three you fancy and it'll reduce because that should be £21.75. £21.75 and it'll take you down to £18.92. Amanda's done it already. So well done, Amanda. Brilliant. I might be wrong, but I think Amanda's gone for Happy Soul, Pretty Place. Uh, you make the world a prettier place, which we both loved, and the Happy Thoughts. So congratulations, Amanda. Well done. She was straight in. So we have a little demo, Jane. Yeah, let's do that. Lovely. Yes, okay. please. So the first one I'm going to use, most of mine are done on watercolour card. When I'm using the uh, Cosmic Shimmer Intense Pigment Stains, they come in a little bottle. Yep. And they are... They're very strong. They're, as, it, as it says on the packet, they're really intense. Yeah. So they're very, very strong in colour. I think I've got a little colour chart up there for you. You have, somewhere. absolutely, yeah. Yeah. It's a pigment stain, um, but it, a little goes a long, long way. And how I use them is I put them... Let me show you my palette. I've got them in my palette here. And I uh, put, some, put some water in them already. I use a little little pipette thing. Do you want to um, just pop that under there and then that can... Oh, yeah, that's a good idea. That lovely colour patch yeah. swatch for us. So I had a bit of water to them. This, this you can see, is more or less 100%. So you've got the wow. citrus lime, you've got bluebell, tangerine dream, the sunshine yellow, rose pink and teal ocean. And they all work together or you can just use two or three. Doesn't matter which one you choose, they'll all go together. And the colour clouds kind of match as well. Absolutely. And we do them in sets of three. So we'll, we'll pop those on. We just pop set A on for you. So uh, yeah. set A, by the way, is the citrus lime, the tangerine dream and the sunflower yellow. So if I just quickly show you those again, my lovely. So it's that one there, which is your sunshine yellow in set A, which we've just put on the screen for £8.75. It's the citrus lime above. And it's the Tangerine Dream, which is there. So it's those two and that one. And then the set B is the other three. And each set is £8.75. So they're less than, what, what's that, £2.95 a, a tub or something? So, yeah. yeah oh, sorry, right. Jane. That's OK. So my little bottle has a little teeny weeny um, nozzle. So you just squeeze the droplets out of there. And I've already put them in my palette. I'm using, what's the six colours here, ready to go. And I've got a nice big pot of water. My water gets quite mucky as I'm painting. Mm. So I need to change it now and again. So it's a good idea to keep your brush nice and clean. I've pre-stamped the image and I'm using the um, It's a Gift. So I'm using the one with the little frog on it because yeah. you like it. <laughs> yes. So I've pre-stamped three of the flowers onto the watercolour card. Oh, we've and got that in the show as well, haven't we? We have, yes. Brilliant. Yeah. It's a lovely, lovely way to watercolour card. It's smooth enough to take a nice a detailed stamp, oh. nice colour, nice weight, perfect for this. Can I just ask, what ink have you used to stamp it, Jane? I've used a versifying black ink, which is my choice. Right. Okay. And it wants it's and if you heat set it when you stamp it, it won't run at all. Okay. So it's a good idea you can heat it, heat set it, but you can also emboss it as well with clear powder if you wanted to. Fabulous. Okay. So I've stamped the centre from the stamp set and I've left, I've left that one blank so I can put my greeting in it when I've done the colouring in. So the first thing I need to do is spritz my card and I like to spritz it just a little bit just to get it damp so I can get my ink flowing. And I spritz both sides. That stops it from curling. You don't need mm. a huge amount of water on it. Good tip that to get the paper to relax, yeah. isn't it? So then it's now it's, it's pretty flat so it's not going to warp and all the colour going to run too much off the edge and I like to use a really big brush for this a really big brush because I'm going to slop it all over the place 
So I'll get lots of water on my brush. And don't forget, I've already put water in my colour. And I'm going to take my lightest colour first, which is the yellow, the sunshine yellow. And I'm going to just dab it here and there. If you think it's too strong, then add a bit more water with your brush, or you could dab it with a bit of kitchen towel. Rinse that. And then I'm going to put a little bit of the green. I love this green. It's such Gorgeous, a lovely limey green. Then put that on as well. Don't worry if you go over the edges of the flower. Not to panic about that. Okay. Is it just cold water in the jar, Jane? Yep, just yep. tap water. Yep. yep. Got a nice big jam jar of it. I put some of that on. Then I might add a tiny little bit of orange. Why not? A tangerine one. Yeah. Yeah. And why not? There. Because you can, Jane. Yep. Yeah. It just looks great. Mm. These improve, I think, when it dries as well. I think it looks really, really fantastic when it's dry. Just dab it a little bit around here and there. And that's basically how you can create your background. Really, really simple. take a few seconds, does it? Really simple. You can heat set that. Mm -hmm. You can add another colour if you wanted to. It's really completely up to you. But I think those three colours are nice because I want my flowers to really jump out of the background. Yeah, it's nice and zesty, isn't it? So I have got something a little bit drier to work with. So I'm just going to wipe that glass, just to some of the ink away. Thank you. And I have got one that I have started and it's dried. And every time I do it, it's different. So that's pretty similar to what I did before. So that is dry. So now I can actually put my colours on my flowers. But I'm still going to use my big brush. I'm not going to change into a little, little brush. And I'm going to start with some pink. And I'm going to add some pink to this one. I don't mind if it, def if, you, if you are using it when the background is still damp, it doesn't really matter if it bleeds into the background at all. In fact, I quite encourage that. So we're going to add lots of pink to this flower. Okay. If any pink comes out of the background, mm -hmm. you can just blend it into the background, into the yellow and the orange and the green that you've got, and it'll just completely disappear. Um, what is the next colour? Yes, I'd put that, some of that lovely turquoise. Mmm. Is that, that teal ocean, is it, Is this Jane? the teal ocean? Sometimes yeah. I can't tell the difference between the teal ocean and the blue. Well, I'll tell you what, let me hang those over. Which one do you think it is, Jane? It's this it, one. It's the teal yeah, ocean, it's, lovely it's girl. In, it's, one, it's one sits in the, my little, little um, palette. There we go. That's the, I think I've used the blue, but it doesn't really matter. So you can put the blue on. I'm doing this quite quickly. I'm going over the edges, but as you can see, you can blend it into the background. And I have got one I have finished painting because I want to try and get as many demos in this, oh, yes, please. At this hour as I possibly can. So I've done them in stages. So there's my middle flower. And then you can paint that one, perhaps maybe an or the orange, mm -hmm. keep the color coordination going. So we've got that one done. Fabulous. And I have got one already painted that's dry. So here we go. There we are. Gorgeous. And I'm going to now stamp the greeting in the middle of this flower. This is the greeting from the set saying, each day is a gift. So you can either put it straight or you can put it at a jaunty angle. I think I might have it straight today. There we go. Oh, they're and, going perfect, don't and they? And as you can see, I've also stamped the little stems. So I've got the little wiggly stem on, on my block. And I use, still use blocks. I don't always use a stamp um, platform. Mm. So you can stamp your little stems like that. Lovely. You can, if you wanted to, take a pen and colour in um, the little blobs if you wanted to. Is that a technical term, Jane? Yeah. You can put anything in here. You can put a little bit of glitter in here. You, you can, can do little gemstones, in, gemstones there, in here. Gemstones in here. I've given you lots and lots of opportunities to put something in, into oh, what here. What a lovely idea. So you can do that. So you can colour all of those in. Um, and on the stamp set, you also get a leaf and some little dots. Mm -hmm. And what I've done is I've stamped the leaves and I've coloured them with a bit of the green and the tangerine dream. Mm. And you can cut them out. Oh, lovely. Okay. I've also stamped the little frog. 
and you can cut him out. He <laughs> seems to have escaped my bag, the one Has I cut he? out, which is a shame. Um, but do I you do. Want to cut him out quickly or not really? Oh no, because no. I've, got, I've got him stuck down somewhere. Okay. Else. Has he leaped off somewhere? <laughs> He's not in the bag. <laughs> and on the stamp set, we've got a little set of dots and they look really nice stamped across the top of your card in a matching colour, oh, just to give it a little doing. border. Oh, that's gorgeous. But keep moving the stamp around or the card around so it's always in a different position. Makes it more random, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's brilliant. And it can go across the bottom as well. So that, that's something you can do to add um, a little border top and bottom if you wanted to. Um, but what's lovely about these is they're all interchangeable, aren't they? Yeah, well, you can use them all together. That's some what I mean, some yeah. cards I've done where I've got all all three flowers flowers on there. Yeah. And let me show you the finished card so that you can see what it is you're going to create. Here we go. So that's my finished card. But what I have done, I didn't show you, is I like to edge all my cards with Color Cloud. This is another fantastic Cosmic Shimmer product. It's ink in a jar with a, so um, a sponge soaked with ink with a cloth top. It's quite hard. Mm. And you're going to use your smoothie. You push down the sponge and it transfers the ink onto your smoothie. And then you can go around the edges of your card just to finish off that give it a nice border mm. and I've used the I've used the lime burst goes again all the colors I've chosen yeah. all go together and coordinate together and I also like to edge the leaves as well so it covers the co the core of the card that when oh, you cut a it nice out touch. that's a lovely yeah, touch. it just finishes it off so you don't see a white core mm. and they're really easy inks to use they're great, aren't as well they? yeah yeah. Do you store yours upside down? Or what, the, the, the cloud inks? No, no, I'd store them like you that. Do, you keep them like I, that, do you? store them like that. But if, yeah. I, if I have an excess of ink, for instance, here, I've got a lot of ink on there, I leave it in the lid, tap oh. it off in the lid, and then I can use that to paint with as well oh, later, so good. it's quite a versatile ink. Great tip. Brilliant. Yep. We've had a message come in from, is it our Sandra? Uh, okay, Sandra's just said, oh, is it, hang on a second, is it, it's all right, my lovely, it's okay. Uh, hi, Zena, Jane, and all the crew. Thank you for being inclusive. So good to see Jane working her magic on Hobby Maker. I am always inspired and tempted to add to my stash. Well, tempted. I've got to be honest, Sandra. We don't want you to be tempted. No. We want you to take the plunge. If you don't mind, Sandra. They're so lovely. If you can't go to the whole lot, get the pick and mix, Sandra. Yeah? Uh, June's just messaged in. Hi, Jane. It's lovely to see you again. And of course, your fabulous stamps. That says that's from June. Oh, you got a lovely uh, following. Oh, June. Oh, yes, I know June. Hello, June. <laughs> Who's June? Oh, we oh, want to know more uh, about June. Uh, yeah. She's a very good friend of mine. Oh, is she? Uh, I've moved house since I, I um, was friendly with June. We're far apart now. She's up in West Sussex. I'm in Dorset. Oh, so my stepdad lives in Dorset. Oh, in yeah, I know, I know he does. Yeah, where are yeah. you? Well, I shouldn't say. I'm in, I'm near Paul. Oh, Paul's lovely. Yeah. Yes. By the sea. Oh, fair journey, isn't it? Yeah. What, it's about three so I've, I've asked you to bring a caravan down. Have you? I have. Yeah, come down June. Yeah. Bring your house on wheels. It'll be all right, lovely. That is beautiful. Anyway, I've just mounted onto a piece of contrasting card and, and, there, and you've got all the cards, so you've got the, I, another finished one, which is similar. And there's my little frog in situ. He's so fabulous, yeah. that little frog. He's gorgeous. So I'll tell you what we'll do. While Jane gets ready for another demo, if we bring on those intense pigment stains and we bring on the all-important water, water card, because you've got to have the right card for the right... Yes, you have. Things. Otherwise, it's... Yes. Right. So what we'll do is we'll do the set A, which is your... Do, 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 do. Hang on a moment, so I can see. I think it's these over here. Yes, so it's your, it's here, which is your sunflower yellow, which is this one here. 
It's your tangerine dream, which is this one here, and then your citrus lime. So if I just pop those there again, that's this one, this one, this one, and this one are in this set here. Now, they're usually a little bit more expensive than that. There's a little cheeky deal on today where they're £8.75. So if you've been thinking about it or you need to top up, I'd grab those today. It's a good price, isn't it? It's a great price. Deal is SK2824 for your set A. If you'd like set B, which is these ones over here, which is this colour here. Okay, so you've got your bluebell. You've got your rose pink and that teal ocean, which is the lovely turquoise colour that Jane has just used. Uh, Janet was straight in on them. They're lovely, aren't they, Janet? Really lovely. QJ2875. Let me move that over. So that's that one, that one, and that one. Okay. Now, obviously, to be able to create that incredible image and that imagery that uh, and use these stamps effectively and all those beautiful, intense pigment stains, you're going to need your water card. Now, you said this is a really nice quality water card to work on, Jane. It is. It's a nice colour. It's not. It's not brilliant white. It's not too creamy. It's got the right weight. I cannot remember the, the weight of it. Does it have it on the packaging? I can't remember the I don't think it. I have I don't. I don't think people are too worried about that. But if I say that it's nice, I mean, I've been using it for Ooh, years. 290, 290 GSM, so that is a good yeah, quality, good, isn't it? It's a very good quality. Yeah, nice weighty card as well. Yeah. And for 10 sheets, they're 45p each for that kind of quality of watercolour card. 10 sheets of A4 uh, in your foundations watercolour card. And again, 200 and 90 years and you can actually when I pick that up you can actually hear how thick that is aren't you it's beautiful beautiful so that is your watercolor card code TE2852 so if you need some watercolor card um, and if you've not tried any watercolor card and you've got some sort of watercolor mar uh, markers as well that's a nice little taster pack at £4.50 isn't it yes and if you cut it into four they'll all fit really well onto an A6 card exactly then you've got You've got 40 then, haven't you? Yeah. And it, it's good enough that if you do make a mistake on the back, sometimes I stamp it, hasn't probably come out very well. I turn it over and stamp on the back, it doesn't come through because on the you're other gonna side. you're going to cover it when you put it down anyway. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. But some people worry it might show through, but it doesn't. Great. She's got all the tips, this one, hasn't she? So there you go. That's your lovely watercolour card as well. Um, so should we do the cloud inks as well? Get those on and then we can do the stencils and the demo. Yeah, I've got a stencil ready. Brilliant. So, do you want to do the stencils first, Alex? You do. He said, yes, he does, he says. He said, yes, I do. So if I just pop those back on there, my lovelies, and then you, because the thing is, you only pay your posting package in once, don't you? Now, this deal, oh, my goodness me, that Jane's bought us. It's fabulous. You're going to get four stencils. They're mini stencils. They're going to be so perfect for this collection of Jane's that's brand new, uh, it's a brand new launch, these gorgeous um, petal doodles from Jane. So you've got your lovely set of hearts. You've got this, now I... It's a mesh. It's a mesh, isn't it? It's clever, isn't it? Yeah. See, I thought I it was a little bit one. snake I skinny love, as well. I, I like that. that one. And then you've got... You've got your little polka dots. And then your diamonds. I think I did some of the colour cloud samples for you on some little bits of card to your left. Oh, let me show be, you. Oh, you are useful. good. You are good, Jane. So let's do that in the order I think I just had them. That was last. That was there. I think we were doing it. I love that. What a mesh. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. There's your hearts. There's your lovely hearts. You had me. What was it? You have my... Oh, you have my heart. You have my heart. So there you go, that's you have my heart. It's nice. Oh, and then you've got what a mesh. What a mesh. <laughs> Somebody's having a great time here, aren't they? Then you've got your polka dots. That's a bit pale. Yeah, but we can still see. Can you see. see it? Yeah. And then we've got the diamond trellis. Now, uh, I think you're going to use this one in the next demo, yeah, aren't I am. you? I like that. That's another one of my favourite ones as well. Yeah, it is yeah. lovely. Now, what do you think for all of those? Price wise? Um, how do you fancy all ten, all four of them under ten quid? Uh huh. Yeah. A measly, if you don't mind me saying, six ninety nine. What's that? One pound seventy five each. It's something like one pound seventy five each. 
There you go, £1.75 each. Well, I worked that out because I did six divided by two is three, pound fifty, and then divided that by four, and then I got to pound seventy-five. Very naughty there. So anyway, if you've already got the, uh, your basket and you've already checked out things today and you want to just add those cheeky stencils into your basket, post and packaging, don't change. Oh, no, no, no. I love the name Mildred. We just have a lady called Mildred coming from Gloucestershire. Isn't that oh, a great name? I like Gloucestershire. Yeah. It's beautiful, isn't it, Gloucestershire? It is, yes. We've got some lovely places in the UK. We have, yeah. Yeah, I mean, Dorset's gorgeous. Uh, so £6.99 for all four of your stencils. We'll uh, quickly do the um, cloudings. I'm going to be super quick because we want to go back to a demo, if you don't mind. This is A, and again, I think the lovely Joni, because she's so organised, has bought us some lovely colours. I just, oh, hang on a second. Where did I put, there they are. So, if you look here, you have got line burst. Can't see, I need you to come closer. There you go. Coming out the old person out in the studio. Thank you, T. It's very kind. There's your tangy tangerine. Your tangy tangerine. And then you're far over here, your bright sunshine is set A. And that's £18.99. So £6.33 a pop for your, cloud, uh, your colour cloud blending inks. And then your other set, which is this set here, I put that one there because we want to get to more demos, don't we, Jane? We do. We do indeed, yes. So in this set, thank you, Michael, you've got your fresh grass, your lush pink, and electric blue. Wow, that's so good. So that is £18.99 again. So regardless of which set you go for, it's £6.33 a pot, and they're really long-lasting, those uh, Colour Cloud blending inks, and your code is ZX2852. Right then, Jane, can we have a... Oh, just one last thing. Sorry, because I don't want to interrupt, Jane. You've got to have your smoothies. You're using yes. your cloud inks, haven't yes. you? Yes, yes. Your colour clouds. So we'll pop the smoothies on, because we don't always have them, but we've got them today. The lovely Jane has brought them in for you. Two latex smoothies for the perfect ink blending every single time. Pack of two for a measly £4.99. And again, your code is AZ2851. Just pop it in your basket and get those latex smoothies home for yourself to use that perfect blending. Okay, Jane, can we come back right. to you, lovely yes. lady? Yes, I'm going to use the um, sunflower... Um, stamp set the um, li live life I think it's called yes and it's I'm using also doodle stitches will come up I think you've got my finished sample there oh which you might want to run let, let me come over Jane have a little rummage I'll have a rummage you. for you it's up there I think that could be it we've got it there that's is a that similar it? one there you yep, go there you a go similar one. thank you yes so you can see that I'm going to try and create that, but I'm going to do it in a slightly different colour. But I'm going to show you how to do the stem and the leaves and a few other bits and pieces. Mm -hmm. So I've got the curly stem already in situ on my block, and I'm going to stamp it into the flower, right down the middle, and then join it up with another one. I think I might do it, yeah, keep it the same direction, Jane. Match it up there. And then I've got the leaves. Stamp your leaves wherever you like. There's two leaves, so they match either left and right. So you can see you can change it completely yeah. by doing that. They're very happy flowers, Jane. They are. They are. They're lovely. And I'm going to just put a little bit of colour onto the background again, like I did before. So a little bit of spritzing. Mm -hmm. I've already got one done. But I want to show you just a little bit more of um, the colouring because it's really important to try and keep that colour very, very pale. Mm -hmm. So we'll just use that, a little bit of that tangerine on here. And I'm going to use a bit more of the blue this time just to show you what that looks like. I've got a finished card in here, but I'm going to add some, some, something else to take some of the colour away in certain areas. Okay. So I'll add a tiny little bit of that green because I think it just looks really good with the, with the background mm. colour. I try to use the lighter colours in the background, so the darker colours I save for the flowers. Oh, right, okay. Because then it just, they just pop out of the background a little bit better. A little bit of yellow, perhaps. You don't have to colour the whole of the card. You can just do sections of it and leave a little bit of a white border, tatty border like I've got on my sample here. So I haven't coloured all the way around. 
completely up to you how you want to do it. Give that a brush and then just dab that colour around. Can't believe how quickly that fills the, the, the background. Yep. It's brilliant. It's such a good idea. I'm just going to switch to a slightly smaller brush to put the blue in on the flower. And again, this is quite a really quite a strong blue. So you want to just... Is that your tea lotion again, Jane? This is the... Um, Bluebell? Bluebell. Bluebell. I actually have one. It's very difficult and I'm doing painting on on um, Hobby Maker because you feel as if you've got to be really quick because anybody can colour in and it looks a little bit... Oh, yeah. It takes a long time, mm. doesn't it? So I've actually done one already, but I'm going to add some bits and pieces to it. So colour your flower in, colour your centre in orange. Ooh. Right up to the blue. I just I'm, love how quick you can make them. Well, I'm using a really big brush because I don't mm. mind it if it goes over the edges and yeah. blends with the other colours. Mm. I don't mind that. Oh, can I ask a question? I'm so sorry, I've just had a little thought. What's your angel policy with your designs? Oh, then people can make cards and sell them quite happily. Yes. They just can't repeat, they can't copy the stamp. In, no, of in course any not. Way, Gotta make something with the stamp. Absolutely, yeah, yes. Wonderful. Encourage, so, I encourage thank you, that. Jane. Let's get rid of Very that. Very kind, place. isn't it? I've got to go on. I'll be honest, I don't know about you. If, how do you feel? If you'd created something on this and drawn everything by hand, would you <laughs> give it away like that? I'd, I've got to be honest, but like, no. <laughs> It's mine. Yeah, of course. <laughs> but, I mean, a lot of people make cards for charity and sell them, don't it's, they? Yeah, so happy but it's with lovely that. of you. Just quickly, we've had a message in apparently from Beverly. Beverly from Cardiff said, I've only just been able to tune in, to, in and I've missed a lot. Can you use the pigment stains for stamping? Uh, no, because it's a liquid. Right. It's really for painting in, for creating backgrounds and colouring in. So don't take this the wrong way, Beverly, but no. <laughs> <laughs> in a word. No. <laughs> so now I'm going to add a little secret ingredient. I've got a little teeny weeny pot of household bleach here. Oh, I've used well, it. This is a first. Thing. Have you not seen me do this? No. I use it all the time. Oh, okay. It's my best friend. Oh. It's just cheap thin bleach, and I put it in a little jar, and I've got an is acrylic brush. Is it just neat? Brush. Is it, Jane? But no. Just neat. It's the very thin bleach, the cheap stuff. Oh, it costs okay. about ninety-nine pence for a great big oh, okay. pot. Oh, okay. The really, really cheap, not the thick stuff. Okay. So I've got an acrylic brush. Don't use a good sable brush because that will just dissolve okay. eventually. So I'm going to put a little bit of bleach on my leaf just so that you can see what's going to happen. I'm coming over for a nose. Oh, look at that. And Ooh. if you've made a mistake anywhere or you want to add some other dimension using a little bit of bleach to get rid of any bits of colour. That's brilliant. What a tidy up the centre. So that's, and it just slowly develops and turns it white. Wow. But it doesn't, it is amazing, it amazes to me. It doesn't make the black bleach. It's no. just the intense pigment stain. How did you come up with that? Oh, it's been around for years. What a great idea. And I'm going to put a little teeny weeny blob in each of these little circles on the centre and they will eventually turn white as well. Not always pure white, it depends what colour it's on. There's a little bit of blue there, so I'll bleach that out so it makes it look tidy. And, but reds tend to, blues and reds tend to um, have a hue when they're bleached. I don't know why it goes sort of slightly different. Mm. And the other thing I like to do is add a few little dots with my brush just random, holding the brush up so I get a little blob of bleach here and there. And that bleach is out the background. You've got to have fun with this. It doesn't yeah. cost anything, but I, I just, I, it's, it's my, what would you say, it's my signature, oh, right, okay. signature thing that I like to do. Oh, how lovely. But always wash your brush out when you're finished. And a good idea to pop the lid on just in case you, you spill it. You're not going to get it anywhere anyway. And let it let it dry, or just blob away those bits of bleach. And I'm blobbing them away because I want to do a little bit of stenciling on here. Yeah. So you can see I've got a nice little That's speckled beautiful. background. Hmm. I've also stamped the um, little ladybird, and I've coloured him in that the um, the pink 
the rose the pink. The rose pink, yeah, and set B. Such a pretty colour. Yeah. Um, so we're going to do some stenciling on the background. Okay. Now, because this is a dry piece, it's probably best to let, let a background dry. This is the Tangerine Dream. Again, the ink is in, in a sponge. You get your applicator, your smoothie, press down to get the colour onto your smoothie. If you've got too much on there, take it off on the lid so you're not wasting it onto some card or something. But I, Because I'm stenciling, I want to make sure I haven't got too much on there because I've pressed it down a lot. Sometimes you might have enough on here to keep you going f to make several cards, so really? always test it first. Okay. Because I've pressed it down and loaded my smoothie it's a bit damp mm. so we're going to take my stencil I don't you don't have to have it straight you can have just do a corner in little okay. sections super simple super quick just in the background here and there wherever you like a little bit more up there perhaps a bit more down here and there's my background that's great they are so handy, those stencils. But you don't need a great big stencil. And then I oh. just I just wipe it clean with a cloth, both sides, mm -hmm. and it's good to go. Easy peasy. Brilliant. That and card looks super. Then, you, then like, like my sample card here that I've done, I've done the, the border from the border set of stamps. I've actually put the greeting on a circle here, but you can stamp that down there. Mm -hmm. um, done a bit more bleaching here. Um, yeah. Love that because you've made the one sunflower really put really stand out with that beautiful bluebell uh, blue, mm. but then on the right you've made it really yeah. sort of blend quite, in and quite pale. So yeah, you can see that the blue works really well. It's a lovely shade of blue. I have to say, I think your leaves are the, my favourite leaves I've ever seen on a stamp. They're so cute. <laughs> I still keep seeing those wedges of lime. I don't know whether it's my oh. tonic that's calling. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm <laughs> that's having one at like. the time. <laughs> yeah. They look absolutely fabulous. They really do. Beautiful. So I'll tell you what, do you want us to go through all the stamps again? So you can, especially for your pick and mix op, pick, get me the teeth in, pick and mix option. Because I think there's quite a few of you asking for the names, aren't there? Yeah. So should we do that again? Do you want me to do that, Jane, or do you want to do that? Oh, well, I mean, you're happy to do that. And I'll, if you I've can, got, I'm just thinking if you've got time for a... I've got a quick demo with the colour cloud to do. Brilliant. Brilliant. Okay, my lovely. So if we go through, because if you, you two choices, you can either buy the show with the, the code on the screen, uh, code DS2864, which takes it down to £5.83 a stamp. All brand new, uh, only launched this week with the lovely Jane, all designed by Jane, all drawn by hand, and they're jam-packed each set of stamps. It isn't one set, one stamp for £5.83, it's the whole lot. So, um, on now, have you got the names on the back, my lovely girl? As I, uh, yes. oh yes, I've got yes. it. I've got it. I've got it. I've found it. So this one is your, ha oh, excuse me, happy thoughts. That went down the wrong <laughs> way. <coughs> there you go. Oh dear. Uh, so that is your happy thoughts. That one there, with that beautiful big foot. But look how much you're getting on each one of those stamps. It's a lot there, including that big, big um, example. Uh, then you've got the all bunched up because there is so many on there and that is that gorgeous design that we saw earlier, that one there. And then we've got the, this one here is your happy soul. Do what makes, do, do more of what makes your soul happy here, here. Absolutely. Are you juggling it? Sack the juggler, Jane. No, I've dropped my ink pad. <laughs> Do you want me to get it or are you okay? Nope. Got it. You manage. Okay, yep. she can manage. She's all good. Uh, and then you've got create a life you love with that huge flower there. There's your beautiful leaves. There's your ladybird. So that's the design that Jane's just done a demonstration with. Okay, and then you've got uh, with love, which says do all things with love which is that one here, which is, again, your sentiment right there, which is beautiful. And then we've got never, never, ever give up. We've got to send this one to Rick Astley, <laughs> don't we? <laughs> never going to give you up. Oh. He's gone really fabulous in his older life, hasn't he? Anyway, I'm sure he wants to hear that. Each day is a gift. So there you go. And again, you've got that beautiful board. And if you want the cutest frog ever, this is the one that you want. You want the one that says, it's a gift. 
Now, if you want all the bugs, the bug doodles, that's this one. All the bug doodles on there. You're getting three, four, five, six, seven on there. And that stamp equates to £5.83. This one's going to be really useful. This is your doodle stitches. Uh, and you've got all those different stitches that we showed you earlier on on the card. Um, and then we've got You Make the World a Prettier Place, which is, I think, the one that Amanda came straight in for, which is that one there. And, yeah, we're talking about the santangling in here, haven't we? Uh, and then we've got Be Happy, which is the B with the B and the happy, which is just gorgeous. And then the beautiful Take Care of Yourself Tulip uh, design there as well, which is gorgeous, isn't it? Really, really lovely. So that is all the names. Now, the two ways that you can buy are nice and simple. The code on the screen on the left-hand side of your graphics there, which is uh, 69.99, makes them £5.83 each. Or if you want to pick and mix any one of the 12, all you do is put that code in your basket. Can you read that out for me, um, Alex Loves? Because I, sorry, GN2827. Thank you, Flower. Thank you, Flower. <laughs> uh, anyway, and you pop that code in your basket. It will drop, as you add it to basket, it drops down with a menu of all 12. Pick which three you fancy, or six, or basically denominations of three. And instead of it being, oh, how did it add up to each? Are they £7.50 each? I think something like that. But if you put three in your basket, it'll reduce it down to £18.92. So that's what it'll... Yeah, it'll add up to £18.92. So it takes it down to, what, £6.30 each, which is still brilliant, absolutely brilliant. So those are your options. Don't forget as well your four stencils, your mini stencils, that were only £6.99. They're on the web. So if you go back to hobbymaker.co.uk, we're going to pop them on the screen. That is all four stencils for 6 99 Code BS2865. Okay, my lovelies. All your, in, your pigment intense... Uh, in, in, I've got my word. Calm, my words have gone. Intense pigment stains in your sets A and B are there. Your blending clouds are there as well. And your smoothies. So everything is there that you need. I'll tell you what, I think we should finish the hour with. Another fabulous demo from Jane. Got a nice quick one with a colour cloud here. How to colour in the background and the flowers really, really quickly with a colour cloud, just using your smoothies. We've got about three or four minutes. Are you oh, comfortable? Yeah. Wonderful. Go for it. Go bright for it, sunshine. Lovely. We all like a bit of bright sunshine. Let's put that on the background. So I'm going right over the flower because I don't really mind. Oh, is that you really using quick. the smoothies there I'm as well? I'm using the smoothies yeah. to colour everything in. Look how quick that is with the smoothies. Yeah. Oof, you're like lightning, Jane. I have got one partially done, so if we run out of time, I can quickly show you a little bit of the blue, not too much, because, well, my, my blue is new, so it's very, very wet. So I tend to squidge the smoothie up so that I can paint inside the flowers. So I can do a very, very quick card. Let's turn that round. Mm -hmm. Speed crafting at its very best, yeah. Jane. <laughs> doing great lovely oh that's, see that's too much I should have taken more off never mind I'll add a bit more to the other one colours are fabulous it's a great blue this one I'll add a little bit more blue then with this one so they match up okay and then you can bleach out a little bit of it as well. I know I've got one finished and I think it's on display somewhere. So that if you've got it too much, you can actually start bleaching out some of these little shapes around the flower head. So if I just put, quickly put some on there, you can see that transforms the image completely. Is it there? I think it's just on grabbing the it for you. It's this one here. Is it the bottom lady. one? Yeah, I'll pop it there for there you. There we go. There we go. So that you can bleach around the edges, bleach out anything you want. You can also get yourself a splatter brush. It's a fan brush. Add some water and splatter the background all over it. That gives a lovely effect, doesn't it? Probably should use clean water, but there we go. Get yourself some kitchen towel. Blot it, 
this is a really speed speed crafting here so that you get a texture coming through some little blobs and things like that you can do your stenciling on the background with a little bit of the blue let's make sure I haven't got too much on there this time so I'm using the little teeny weeny dots in between the flowers You can stamp the greeting inside the middle. What else can I say? So I've got the greeting, well, I've got the center here. You can stamp the center. You can stamp the little bees across the top. Carry on doing that. And eventually you'll Ooh, end up look with a card that. like that. So I've bleached out the wings of the bee. Uh -huh. I've um, bleached out the leaves. But I've also added lots of other things. I've added doodles on there mm. with a black pen. And that diamond stencil. And yeah, I've got the diamond. That's a slightly different stencil, but it works even e equally as well with the one yeah. that you've got here. The that little looks one. fabulous. So that you can, have, you can create all sorts of different looks to it. But that's colouring with the colour cloud. Brilliant. You did that with time to spare, comfortably, Have Jane. I? <laughs> you did, absolutely. Um, now, we've had a message come in. Who is the message from? Jenny. Are you asking about the tulip and the take care of yourself? It's called Take Care, lovely. It's this one. There you go. So it's, that's it, lovely. Take care of yourself. And you're looking in the drop-down drop down menu for Take Care. All right, my lovely. So that is in your pick and mix. Have Here's you got one. Here's another one I've got here, but they've stamped it onto Ooh. pattern paper. Oh, that's a lovely, oh, that's a lovely idea yeah. as well, isn't it? Oh, yeah. So, yeah, if you add in take care and a couple more for your fancy, then that's all yours. Now, Jane, we're back at seven. In the meantime, do not go anywhere. You need to be here the other side of the break. If you've recently missed your favourite show on Hobbymaker, it's really easy to catch up on our website. Simply visit hobbymaker.co.uk and click TV Guide. Here you'll be able to choose any show broadcast in the last seven days, which you can watch, pause and rewind at your convenience. And to make shopping even easier, any items featured in the show will appear underneath. With Hobbymaker's Catch Up, there's never a reason to miss out, no matter what time of day. Did you know that digital downloads are now available on the Hobbymaker website? Just pop over to hobbymaker.co.uk, go to downloadable content, choose the collection you would like to buy and click purchase. This will be an instant payment and once purchased you will receive an email. Click on the link and it will take you here. Click download and once downloaded the file will appear in your downloads folder. Right click on the folder and click on extract all. Once extracted, open the folder, click auto run and you're ready to craft. For more information, help and support, go to the further details section of the purchase page. Digital crafting with Hobbymaker.
Well, this is a treat. <laughs> Hi, Rudy. Hello, how are you? All right, thanks, how are you? Oh, 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 oh. The two kisses. <laughs> oh, oh, it's me, John, bye. <laughs> Hello. Oh, that's enough, right? Oh, oh, you make me go red. <laughs> Not many people make me go red, I'll tell you. <laughs> anyway, um, so also, when I sat next to this lovely man in the pre-production meeting, he said, you know, that was the first time I've ever been on telly. Because I, I watched you at one o'clock. You would ne if you watched Rudy earlier, you would never have known he's never been on live telly before, would you? You're you were kind. You're too kind. Oh, such a natural. Too kind. Thank you so much. Such a natural. It actually means a lot. Thank you so much. Honestly, right? really good. <laughs> Brilliant. You, you notice how many times I've rewatched the episodes and the YouTube videos. Just oh, really? To get, just to get prepared. <laughs> no, well, you honestly, absolute natural. Thank you so much. Um, so earlier on, yourself and the lovely Dave. Yes. Launched on Hobby Maker. Quite frankly, the widest mouth. We're not talking about me or Dave <laughs> or anybody. The widest mouthed machine that we've ever seen. Yes. 24 inches of gorgeousness. Gorgeous, I like that. It is. That was the best intro I've heard in the year that it's been of existence of the Romeo. Mm. That is the best intro it's received. We need a Romeo. You're our very own <laughs> Romeo. You bought us oh, the stop. Romeo. Um, <laughs> You're making me blush. <laughs> and the thing is, Caesar has been, historically wise, it's been in the business for 45 years was my understanding. 45 years of history of this incredible brand. Mm -hmm. And it's Italian, it's Italian brand, it's Italian manufactured, and you, you keep it in Italy to make sure that the quality control is absolutely, absolutely. spot on, don't Absolutely, you? because we, we uh, control from the actual prototype, the, the, the idea prototype, to the actual production, mass production as well. So everything is done in Italy. Fabulous. Mm -hmm. Fabulous. Uh, do you speak Italian as well? I'm still learning. Spanish, oh. yes. Oh, there you go. But it's not no? Oh, there you <laughs> go. I can say ciao. Ciao. Pasta, um, <laughs> vino. Oh, oh, I can do vino. Prosecco. Oh, prosecco. <laughs> uh, brilliant. Um, so this, um, now this machine, as well, I understand, comes with a two-year warranty and guarantee, and it also comes with the full support of Caesar as well, doesn't it? Absolutely, yes. So you have the two-year warranty, that's parts, pieces, we also have replacement parts after the fact, once the, yes, once the warranty okay. is done. And then we also do the full support from the Caesar side, whether you are located in the UK or in okay. America, South America, um, Australia or Asia, we have it all covered with the different teams all globally. And the website's brilliant. Can I just say, I went on to Caesar <laughs> earlier and it was of course it lands and you're all Italian and you think, oh, I can, I can read that it's accept. Clicked accept, everything turned into English. I was like, this is really intuitive. <laughs> it was brilliant. I was like, oh, fantastic. Um, so if I'm at home watching now, I know earlier on we had a limited availability and over half the availability has checked out. Okay, I will tell you that, you, that we are absolutely 50 pounds um, more affordable than anywhere else. We've done our homework, okay? And we are giving you the absolute ultimate five-way split pay, 0% interest on that product code. So if you want to get hold of it, this is without question the best place to buy it. And I mean that with all sincerity. Now, if I'm at home watching, mm -hmm. bear in mind, all the availability is actually currently in baskets. And remember, it isn't yours till you check out. Okay. So we get the wide mouth. So yes. signage, you know, all that kind of thing. But yep. what is going to make me buy this one? What's going to make me buy Caesar? So as we already saw in the previous segments, we covered a little bit about, um, or quite a lot in detail, the speed, velocity, precision of cutting. Now, this has all been done with, are cuttable materials. Okay. I think what really puts the machine over the top and, and in this segment as far as affordable machines at 24 inches is the print and then cut solution. Right, mm -hmm. okay. So we have gone when we developed the, well, excuse me, now I'm speaking like you earlier. Mm. <laughs> all <right>. It's all right. <laughs> Catching. <laughs> that is very catchy. <laughs> I adapt well. <laughs> so the machine was, was thought out with already the intention and the experience of um, the manufacturing of the vinyl. One thing that we always saw in the different types of machines is typically you have a optical eye, which is how it actually reads the registrations for right. the print and then cut solution. Okay. Now that can at times be a bit iffy. It can actually cut, miss, do a lot of miscuts at times. So what we wanted to implement into this new machine was a camera. Oh, I heard you talking about this yeah, with Dave earlier. Exactly. Right, the famous okay. camera, the famous uh -huh. camera. And what the camera is going to do is going to ensure 
a much more precise cut every single time. So you'll notice once we actually go into the demo, you'll see here in the display screen, you'll see where the camera will actually go and recognize the exact corner of each registration. Uh -huh. exactly. so you're not gonna get any wastage. There's no and hit and miss, it's absolute. No wasted, and of course, today we're presenting a product that's very, very unique, but it's a product that actually comes with a white background. So the idea is to eliminate any chance of having any of the white background showing once you Brilliant. complete the print and then Brilliant. cut. Brilliant. Brilliant. So it's yes. going to look really professional. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Just to have a sample here that we've done real life. I mean, this is actually a real picture. Of this. a real dog. <laughs> See, <No>. Lacey. <laughs> She's now famous. <laughs> so you can see here, this again is the product I'll that we're talking that about. Oh, you want you. me to hold it up? I'll hold that for you. Yeah. you the quality. It's incredible. And like you say, there's no, there's no sort of white image around exactly. the border or anything. Which is hugely important, especially when you're working on dark fabrics or darker backgrounds. So you avoid any chance. It, so it doesn't look tacky. You want something no. that looks professional. Even if you're doing it as a hobby, you want this to stand out and look good. So this is the thing. So inside this machine, because you get free software with this, which is you got, get the what, free software. Three thousand designs. Roughly around three thousand. Yes, free software. But you can do designs. your own photographs. You can do your own photographs because you have the capability of importing whether it's a PNG file or a JPEG file. So just an image. You can take a picture. I mean, you can even take a picture on your phone, right? Well, this is with the product. That's a different topic. We'll get to that when we get to the product. But no, I yes, you, so. if, yeah, no, I get excited. <laughs> <laughs> but so you should. It's an amazing machine. It is, especially this product. I love showing this product because it's, it's really easy to show because it really kind of speaks for itself. But it's, until you see it live, you don't really justify it. And what, was, uh, what I noticed as well, it's really smooth, yep. really smooth. And I'm Touch. just going to shout across. How many times can you wash it, Sue? 50. Up to 50 times mm. washable. Yeah. Brilliant. So for makeup bags, tote bags, bags for life, T-shirts, that kind of thing, you've got real washability as well. It's brilliant. Washability, yes. Brilliant. And the reason it's, it's a true vinyl. In the past, there are products that were made for inkjet printers, but they typically are paper-based, okay. where you get cracking, it doesn't last as long, where this is a true vinyl. This is manufactured in Italy in the, in the Caesar headquarters. Wow. So it comes with the same guarantee as all of our different products like the Easy Weed that we saw earlier today with the longevity and the guarantee of washability. I say, Macy, mommy loves you. <laughs> there you go. Beautiful. She's over there. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, back to the original question though. Yes, you can import the PNG file and the machine and actually the software will be able to do all the process of getting it prepped to actually send to your printer and then to cut it with the, ro uh, the Romeo. Oh. oh, is that how we say it? Romeo. Sounds nice like that, doesn't it? <laughs> Romeo doesn't sound as nice, does it? Romeo. Can we call it that from now on? Thank you. Um, so it's incredible. So now, you, now you must call me Rodolfo. Oh, oh sorry. This is my, it's actually my name. How do you say it again? Rodolfo. Rodolfo. Yes. Rodolfo. I can do that. Rodolfo. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. Um, am I right in thinking as well, this doesn't necessarily have to go from the cable. It can do Wi-Fi? Yes. So one of the other things that we want to implement is kind of go away from the Bluetooth because Bluetooth can be a bit... It's, it can lose connectivity very, yeah, very yeah. rapidly and yeah. quickly yeah. and at random times. So you don't, you don't want, want to show you up, do you? No, no. absolutely not. Okay. And especially in a, an event like this, you don't mm. want this thing to <laughs> no. go bad and start cutting, right? So yeah. the ability to use the Wi-Fi, not only are we able to have better connect, uh, connection to from the printer or the cutter to the laptop, but also let's say I'm in this room and the, maybe the, the cutter's in the other room, you can cut no problem cool. because Brilliant. it's all connected through Wi-Fi. Brilliant. Yep. Fantastic. And I mean, the kind of size uh, signage mm -hmm. that you're going to be able to design and cut with this, yep. it's just going to be incredible, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, because also you can cut not only 24 inches wide, but you can also cut five yards plus in length. Wow. So whether you're doing wall signage or you're doing stencils that are larger than the typical size that you would, you can do it all. Wow. So home decor stencils home and all that exactly, kind of thing. Exactly, exactly. And wow. you can do it all without the need of a mat, which is also very incredible. Now, this does come with a 12 by 12 inch mat, but it's got it does. internal adjustable pinch rollers, has it? Exactly. So not internal. They're, they're pretty exposed. Oh, okay. But <laughs> there oh, you there see. they are. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. So we have a lever back here that we can actually, once you lift, then you can move the pinch roller. Excuse me. Uh, yes. Once you lift it, you can move the, the pinch rollers left and right. Oh, wow. And you don't actually have to use all four. But you oh, okay. can. They're there for more security if you okay. want to cut something bigger and longer. Okay. Wow. Mm -hmm. So it, so this could be personal use, 
business use, small yep. business use, anything like that, can't it? Yeah, in theory, I mean, the, the, the idea of the Caesar brand has always been grow with us. So the fact is that you can start even as a hobbyist uh, doing this and on, you know, your, your afternoons yep. into a small business, which then can grow into a larger business. Because we, it does come with a guaranteed quality, it means that you can really kind of grow with the materials <laughs> and now you can actually grow with the equipment as well. Wow. And that's the thing. And I think if you are one of those people that is thinking about getting a digital cutter and you're thinking, mm -hmm. I don't know which brand to go for, which one, that's the thing. And it's trying to work out which one you're going to spend your money on. Yep. And I will say, we this one has nearly gone today. <laughs> that, so people are, and, and, and with 45 years of history as well, Caesar absolutely know absolutely what they're doing, don't they? Yeah, I mean, for, for a while, we were just manufacturing the heat presses and yes. the vinyl. So yep. obviously with, the the situation in the past years we had some time yeah. to kind of find the next step in the in the direction of caesar okay. and it was just a no-brainer at that point it was just finishing the recipe which was yeah. the manufacturing of the heat transfer vinyl the heat presses to actually guarantee the application and of course now with the third piece which is the cutter to be able to bring it all together so it's just the full solution yep so yes. right we've gone on to that do we want to do a demo or do we want to get on to the um the heat transfer vinyl. Do you want to the do a demo? Color. Let's do that. Because Should I think, we do that? Yeah, let's do that. What do you think? Because we can go back and recap this. Yep. Or what you can do as well is if you go back to the one o'clock hour, mm -hmm. uh, did you do it? You did one and two straight back was, to back, didn't you? It was you? two direct hours. Yeah, Dave, yeah. Dave really killed it. I mean, oh, absolutely. Brilliant. So if you want to go <laughs> back, and if you're, but just be careful though, because all I would say is you are uh, in the danger zone. If you, you, I know there's a few people with it in there in their <laughs> baskets. You are in that danger zone if you don't secure it before they all sell out. We're gonna keep it on the five-way split pay, which means you can get it sent home to you today. It's on a five-way interest-free split pay. So you can get it, what, do, what does the figure come up to? There we go, 159 pounds and 80 pence, and you can have this sent out. And the thing is, when you see the 24 inch wide mouth here, this machine, still we don't charge you any additional post and packaging. That's what makes, I'm gonna wish Shirley, you've just this second come into the mix, Go back and have a look at the one and two o'clock if you want to, but you don't want to go anywhere at the moment because we're about to go into the easy color yes. heat transfer vinyl. Yes. Mm. This, uh, I've been with Caesar, I've been working with Caesar products for over 10 years and been officially with Caesar for seven plus years now. Okay. Yep, both in America, South America, now in Italy. But this has been one of the products that has absolutely, for me, changed the game. Really? Yes, yes, okay. no brainer, no brainer. This is the opportunity that everybody has always, the type of product that everybody has asked for and wished for. And mm -hmm. um, it took many, many years of uh, research and development to come yeah. and, and create something that was truly game changing. That's Not just a like. product that we could just throw in the market and say, okay, it does this, this, and this. We wanted to do something that was truly um, a game changer, innovation but also with that quality behind yeah. it as well. Because yeah. it's not just to make a product, you also have to make something that's going to last. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Right then, can you talk us through it? Because it's this here, yes, isn't it? Yes, it is, it is. So this product that we're talking about is called Easy Color, direct to vinyl, okay? Why? Because it is a vinyl that can actually be printed on with just your regular home printer, okay? Your regular inkjet printer that you can go to the store and buy for 80, 100 pounds. Wow, so we don't need a digital, and obviously no. we want you to get a digital cutting machine, yes. but if you do not have one, you can use this from your inkjet printer yep. and actually cut it out with your scissors. If Practically, you want to. Yep. yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if not me, because I can't cut with, I'm left handed. <laughs> God did not give me the gifts <laughs> to cut straight oh, don't worry, lines. We do, we or do left handed lines. scissors here, you'll be fine. Yeah, it doesn't we, help. We, <laughs> 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 you got to change the, the brain. <laughs> <laughs> but um, no, so the product is really unique. Yes, you can cut it with scissors. Um, the design will be shown today is a bit more intricate, so you can see how that also is um, done with the vinyl cutter. Uh, but again, the huge advantage of it is it's a true vinyl, it's stretchable, can be printed just with your desktop printer, the same printer that you're printing your invoices on, that same printer. Just onto so copy of paper. Nothing even. changes. There's no need to understand wow. a new software, no color management uh, programs that you need. It is as basic as it gets. Brilliant but you'll see that the colors and what you can achieve with it is truly unbelievable. Okay. And if you keep seeing the DTV, that's direct to vinyl. Yes. That's what that means, mm -hmm. okay? And you was, something that amazed me, and you were saying earlier as well, normally when you have uh, a vinyl like this, you'd normally have to buy one for a black material, one for a colored, one for yes. a white. This will do all of them. All of it? them, and you'd never have to change the settings. So settings will always remain, no matter if you're printing 
on the vinyl to apply on white or dark garments. Brilliant. Mm -hmm. So that's a game changer. As it's well, a game changer. It? It's a game changer. Yeah. And typically, when you're looking at the other products that are in the market that are more paper based, typically you do have to increase or reduce the temperature. Yeah. Um, which means that sometimes you won't be able to actually use a home iron. With this part product, you can also work with the home iron. Brilliant. So we'll be working with our mini P press here, a craft mm -hmm. P press. I saw that earlier. That was brilliant. I, I, when I, you know, when we're gonna do something, we're gonna do it right. Okay. So again, it's the full solution with the cutter, the materials, and the heat press. So we okay. want to make sure that we're bringing the right recipe Brilliant. to the audience. Just understand that you can also use an iron. Fabulous. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think we need to see this in action, don't we? Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm excited. And just a couple of samples here. You can see oh, how yes, beautiful please. this is. We have the bib here. Nice little pretty Shit. design. Now this design is actually one of the designs inside of the software, I believe. I could be wrong on that one. But this is the thing as well. I think this is what's key is what, because firstly, when mm -hmm. you, uh, honestly, when you, I wish you could, I wish you'd got stroke vision at home. Because, <laughs> uh, honestly, uh, because that is so soft and silky. But then again, like you say, the fact that it's got stretchability as it's well, stretchability. that's what makes it so clever. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's brilliant. It's brilliant. Now, you do get five A4 sheets, okay? Five A4 sheets of the easy color. Um, the DTV, so again, direct to vinyl. Yes. Um, we're going to give you a very, very uh, special introductory price, which we popped on the screen there for you. Eight. Oh, has Sandy just come in and changed the price tag? $16.99. Well, that's a bonus, isn't it? Because I couldn't read the first number, so they had to adapt it. Yeah, oh, we'll blame now. Uh, Rodolfo. <laughs> no, stop. We'll blame. We'll blame. <laughs> We're not complaining, are we, when no, the price no, goes no. down? No. Because that's a lovely thing. Everybody pays the final low price. Nobody pays any more than anybody else. So it's fantastic. So I think the second you see this in action, and the fact that we can do it from our own computer onto an inkjet. So for those of us that don't have the big digital cutting machines yet, this is a little introduction to, yep. isn't it? And this is great. I mean, you can do so many things. Just a quick, we do a lot of trade shows over the year. And one thing that we did this past year, which was really, really cool, was just from our own phone. We have the app for the, for the, for the oh, printer. Oh, so you can do it from your phone as well? Absolutely. <gasps> not the machine, not the machine. The, the, obviously, the material. Yeah. The TV, yes. So as long as the printer has an option for, the, for an application, you can just take a selfie, for example, print it directly to the printer. You can do with scissors and apply it. No problem. Right. I so a lot of different you could options. Just do yourself a few, a few of you for us. <laughs> for us to, we'll just auction them off if you'd like a nice, uh, nice print of Rodolfo no, stop. before he goes home. <laughs> Should have never done that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So Obviously, and then. professionalism, <laughs> right? Well, after you, my love. All right. So let's go ahead and go to the. I'm yes. going to show you in the software. Basically, I want to bring an image in that we're going to be working with and how to prepare it for the print, and then we'll go into the cutting action. All right. So, I have, I'm here working in Leonardo Design Studio, which is the software that comes with the machine. Okay. So, it is a free software, and in the near future, you will also have the option to do the, tri or the, the pro version, mm -hmm. which will give you a lot more tools to do designs and things like that. Brilliant. Okay? And that's something we can talk about at a, at a future Fabulous. training. Oh, because <laughs> you're here to stay, aren't you? I guess so. We'll see. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> All right. So, let's go ahead, and I'm going to go to File, Import. And I want to bring in an image. So this is the, I have this image here of the kitty. Oh, it's beautiful. I love it? this because obviously it's a cat and I love animals, but also because it really showcases a lot oh, of colors. different colors. Mm. Exactly. And this mm -hmm. is what we want to show here. The first thing we'll notice is that the image has a background color. So you have yeah. a brown color back there. I don't want that. I only want to print the cat. How do you take that out? Um, we'll see oh, now oh, in a second. Okay. So I will hit next. Uh -huh. Here we have select color range. If I left click on that and mm -hmm. check that box, I have this little uh, tool here that says remove. I'll go oh. right over and hover over the background that uh -huh. I want to remove. Left click on my mouse and boom, that's it. Is that, is that it. simple? It's that simple. So now we've created or we've pre prepped the design for um, creating my cut lines. Right, okay. okay. So next, we'll hit next. Here, you'll notice now the, the software is, is reading across the, the image, and you can see it's very detailed. The corners are very detailed. I now, you, put the cut lines you see that? In. The blue cut lines. Wow. So, this is what we'll be cutting. Now, I don't want the inside to cut as well because the vinyl is already white, so I don't need to cut those sections out. I will remove include holes, and that's it. Very simple. Click next. 
and then hit finished, and that's it. So I'm gonna hit page mark, so I'm working on an A4 printer. So okay. this is the max size that I'll be able to use, but uh -huh. it, you can also do A3. You can do A3. You can do much bigger, wow. absolutely, because wow. we're obviously working with the Romeo. Okay. So as long as you have a printer that's adaptable to the bigger size, yeah, yeah. yes, absolutely, you can use so it. So you're limited by your printer size. Exactly. We're always limited. Not with, not with, not with the, the cutter. Romeo, or you're no. not. <laughs> All right, so let's make the design a bit bigger. Perfect. Oh, you can do that. Oh, of course you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no problem at all. So you see my image here? Uh-huh. I will go send design. And that's it, so easy. So now you have two windows here. You have print artwork. Mm -hmm. So this is what we'll send, and we can send it directly from the Leonardo Design Studio to my printer, which I have right here on the side. Uh, you'll see you have the HP, which works great for this product. And then once that's done, we'll do the cutting contours, which is what's going to cut around my image. Can I do, you mentioned the name there, Leonardo. Leonardo, so, yes. Leonardo. Yeah. <laughs> um, what does that mean? Because anybody that didn't watch the one o'clock, yes. what does that mean? So Leonardo is, um, Leonardo da Vinci, is, <laughs> is the, where the actual name and the, 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 the idea comes from for the mm -hmm. software. Oh, that's uh, the software. That is the right. software. So Leonardo Design Studio is the free software that comes with the machine. So this okay. comes with all the machines. Even if you just want to test the software, you can go to the caesar.com website and test it. There's a link there for you to download Brilliant. it. So it's Fabulous. free. You just won't be able to go past the point of um, to send the design over to cut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But even without the machine, if you just want to test the program and see if it fits your needs, you can do Brilliant. so right up for free. Fantastic. Great. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and. It's um, isn't it? <laughs> so I'll do send to printer. Now the beautiful thing about the product is I don't actually have to have any knowledge of um, any type of color uh, programming. Okay. So just using the standard settings, I do apologize, this is in Italian, so just we'll let you believe on. me. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's just the standard setting, it's just standard paper setting. Okay. I will hit OK, mm -hmm. and now we're going to go ahead and print. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this on screen, but it's printing. Okay. Now, the, the material does have a white side and kind of a yellowish background, backside. You always want to print on the white side. On the white. On the white side. Okay. Okay. And what I want you to see here is really the colors. I mean, how incredible, the, for a printer that is very economical, how impressive the colors will be. There we go. Oh my, see, I'm so sorry, you <laughs> can't see this yet, no, can you? you? <laughs> oh okay. my, look at that. Oh, and the thing is, if you're sitting there now, because as soon as I saw Macy, the dog earlier, and found out that it was your, your Sue's lovely dog, I was like, oh my goodness me, and the second you know, you can print your own pets. Yep. Oh Check my. that out. Look at those hold colors. Hold that to yeah. that camera there. Mm -hmm. Rude. Look at those colors. And again, this is just a standard printer. Look at those colors. Wow. How cute that's is that cat, right? Magnificent. And that's on vi that's on the vinyl. That's on the vinyl. So that's just, see, vinyl. So the white the white side yep. through we want to print on. Exactly. You see the back. I don't know yep. if you can tell on camera, but it is more of a kind of a cream color. Yeah. No, and it's more it's, white on the yeah, You'll see when you get front. home. Yep. Studio yep. lights are always a bit of a nemesis. <laughs> always challenging, right? Wow. Okay. So I think it hopefully it cuts well, but the problem I'm seeing here is that it, the printer may be a little bit lopsided, but that's okay. So now I am going to use the mat. So I have the, okay. the 12 by 12 mat here. And that does come with the Caesar. It comes with it, exactly. And this is a high tack, so it has a nice tacky yeah, feeling I to it. Yeah, I kept getting stuck to it. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry for that. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and move my computer to this side. Could I just mention something, Rudy? Yeah, go for it. Go for it. I am it. allowed to just because of how many of you are thinking about it, and I appreciate it's a think pro it's a think process. Mm -hmm. We have one. Oh. We may not have one left. It may have just exited the building. We haven't even finished the demo yet. I know. This is incredible. <laughs> we'll let you know. We think at the moment the Romeo okay. <laughs> may have gone. Do, if do you, you got it? Whoever, whomever got it. Huge congratulations. Yeah, I am congratulations. Envious. And thank you for the support. Absolutely. Um, do you mind if I just kind of come to the front real quick here? I'm sure nobody's going to complain okay. if Rudy comes a bit closer, are they? I should have I wore jeans and pants, right? <laughs> I hope you, well, pants mean something <laughs> different to us, Rudy, so be careful. That's true. <laughs> I've learned a long time ago that I need to, um, I need to watch my, my <sighs> American humor stop. sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the reason I'm going to the, I want to go to the front, I want to make sure when I place the mat inside of the machine that it's perfectly aligned. So I don't want it to be sideways or crooked, um, so it reads it perfectly. Yep. 
Now, I don't want the pin, you notice I'm not even using the other two pinch rollers here. These are kind of off to the uh -huh. side. But I want to make sure that the pinch rollers are not touching the material either. Can you manage or can I? No, no, no. it's okay. okay. Yep. So I'll move my blade over. Mm -hmm. Now, now I can come back. These can be back around. Yeah, I can come back around. Pants and all. No problem. <laughs> so here we have different settings that we can use. I'm, the material is very similar to the Easy Weed, so I'm just using the same settings as Easy Weed, which is a force of five, so very low force, and that's because the material is very, very thin. Okay. All right. Then we'll now select here the cutting contours, and you can see right there all my cut lines. And again, I wanted to go with something a bit more intricate, mm -hmm. so not just a regular circle, square. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. you can see you want the, sort of the, f the hair lines almost. Exactly, yeah. and also so you can see the velocity of the cutting. Yeah. Okay, so that's another very key element of it is how quickly it will recognize the registration marks and actually cut the design. Wow. Okay, so okay. here is where you'll be able to see the camera reading and recognizing those, those ah, cut lines. Ah, this is the camera that you were talking about Exactly, right, so okay. let's go ahead and send to cutter. Mm -hmm. And if it's all well, let's see here. So you see here, it's recognizing those corners perfectly. Oh, it's making oh. it look good. Oh. No, 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 it's okay. That's it. And look how quickly it starts cutting. And it's very, very Gosh, quiet. It's quiet. Very isn't quiet. It? Yes. Look how quick, quick it's going. It's <laughs> like it's on fast forward. Wow. It is. And, and this is not even the top speed. I have it at, I think, 10. You can go even a little bit higher, but it's a bit more intricate, and I want the material to cut correctly. Oh, this is phenomenal. <laughs> no, it's really quiet. It's right. The gallery is saying, can you even hear it out there? Because they can't hear it in the gallery. It's absolutely <laughs> so quiet and so fast. Sorry, Rudy. No, no, it's okay. Way, lovely. I'm, just, I'm so fascinated I'm, by this. I'm, I'm, you here. Here, I'm in the zone now. I'm in the zone. Don't mind me. That okay, is, beautiful. and the detail it's cutting around there is absolutely phenomenal. Gosh, so if you turn this into your own business, you're going to be going pretty quick, aren't you? You can, absolutely. Wow. And you can do what I'm doing here. So I'm setting up the garment now. Is that done? Is that it's done? done? That's done. Absolutely. Nope. And this is really where you get to show, you get to really see and, and appreciate the machine. Okay, so now let's show the cutting. Let's hopefully it cut well. I think it did. Okay, now with this material, typically I would weed the outside and the excess material. When you say weed, for anybody yes. that's not too sure, can you just explain? Because exactly. Because it sounds a bit odd. Because you might be thinking, why is he gardening? Mm. <laughs> We're doing something else. <laughs> 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 so weeding is what we um, refer to removing of the excess material. Yeah. Okay. So if I have this as a cut material, I cut it and then I remove the excess and then what's left over is why I actually transfer onto the fabric. Okay. okay. In this case, we have to remove the excess, yep. if this is a typical print product, mm -hmm. then use a transfer sheet, which is called yep. TTD Easy, yep. and transfer the design over. Yep. But in this particular case, I'm not going to do that. Have to do that. I'm not going to do that. So what I'll do... So you're mo removing a step. I'm removing a step, you? making it easier. Am I and obviously, your way? Just no, no, no. To, honestly, just kick me out of the way. No, no, I'm just, when I get in the zone, I just start moving, so oh, okay. I do apologize. Okay. No, 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 <laughs> I can't not stand at all. Still. No, I'm just excited to see it happen. <laughs> okay, so now let's go ahead and take a look at the cutting. Let's see how well this design cut. And again, I'm just going to go ahead and just weed the inside. So I'm not removing the excess, I'm only moving the actual. And you're just doing that with your hands. Yep, you see that? Do you get weeding tools with the machine anyway, with the Romeo? Uh, I believe so, yes. yes. I, think, I believe you guys yes, have you a do. pack with it, yes. Okay. Um, just can I mention, while uh, Rudy's getting that out of there, um, we've just been told that we are being allowed to have a couple more machines tomorrow. So if you are that person, we've had a couple of people there saying, oh my goodness me, it's gone, and I was just hovering, I was just, you know, but uh, you did miss out, they did sell out, but we've been told we can have two more machines yeah? Okay, so, ro thank you. Thank you. Just thank you. Thank you, <laughs> lovely lady. Uh, so, if you would like to get hold... I can't believe this. Look, that's just detail? with his hand. That was with yeah, his that was my hand. hands. Yep. And notice it's, it's right now... Hold it up. Can I touch it? Yeah, can yeah. I? And you can see the corners are very, very... I mean, the detail, the precision is absolutely incredible. Look at that. The only white parts you see is because the material, the, the actual design. And you can see oh. in the corners there I mean, how well that is done. And notice now it's folding, right? This is yep. very important. Yep, the sides are trying yep. to curl in, aren't yep. they? They're going to start to curl. That's okay. But look how real it looks. I mean, this is incredible. <gasps> I just want to do it with my dog. <laughs> okay. Yes. Come on then. Next. Okay. Yes, please. We're going to go over here to the heat press. And as usual, with any type of vinyl, 
and type of cotton, the first thing we want to do is do a quick pre-press. Now, I don't know if you're going to be able to tell on this one here. So I'll do five seconds, just enough to heat up the T-shirt, and then I'll place it. But we could do this with an iron, couldn't we? With an we? iron, We yep. haven't got this big, jazzy machine. Exactly. And watch this. Look at this. You see how all the points now are curling back down? Yeah. And that's just done with the heat. So it's almost magical the way it comes it back down. It just settles straight down. It settles it? down. Yeah. And this is why you don't actually need the actual transfer tape. Wow. So if you have letters, things like that, yes, you, you will have to transfer it because it's not just one solid piece. Okay. But in this particular case, that's it. That's it. I need to make sure it's centered because otherwise it's going to bother pardon me. Okay. Now I have here parchment paper, which is what I will use to cover the, the It's design. like baking paper. It's like baking paper. Oh, okay. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Most of us have got that, haven't we? Yep. I think I have baking paper. Are you, are you all right? Yeah. I've got some at home. It's okay. That's not really going to help you, is it? No. Okay, well, I have this one here, which is a bit different. No problem. If not, you can also use this part here. Watch. Make it easier on myself. Okay. She's yelling at me like, I it's, it's there. supposed to be there. It's okay. Even even <laughs> using the back. No is that the, the, the back of the... The um, backing of the, the, the product. The easy yep. color. Yep. Yep. Again, things that go during your live, things yeah. can go wrong. You adapt. Of course you do. Okay. Make sure that that... Okay. Mm -hmm. So now this can be applied at 150 degrees mm -hmm. for 15 seconds. So very quick. Okay. So with an... Ah, with an iron, do you, yes. do, you do it without the steam? Absolutely. You never yeah, want to do it with steam. steam. No, no. That will completely okay. deteriorate the material. Okay. <laughs> right. Yes. So don't use your steam on your iron. So depending on how you're covering it, in this particular case, we're covering it. Look at the colors. That pop. is not done. It is done. That's it. Oh, my. Look at those colors, how beautiful can they I look. Can I hold that up? Yep. Can I hold that up? Oh, it's done. <laughs> yeah. Look at, and those, look at all those little. Look at the outside <laughs> lines and the color and the. Oh, Rudy. That's incredible, right? <laughs> my mind's just gone. <laughs> <laughs> I've just realized my dog is now going to be on every item of clothing <laughs> I own, every tote bag, you know, every actually, makeup bag. Actually, that industry is huge. Isn't it? Oh, absolutely. Personalization for animals. Christmas gifts and oh. things. And you know what I mean? <laughs> I can print your pet. It's, it's, oh, it's incredible. It's incredible. You could, I'm being funny, you could get the cost of that machine back pretty damn quickly. Couldn't you? If you were selling these kind of yeah. items personalized. No, absolutely. <gasps> absolutely. Oh. That's the thing. I mean, you can do, let's say you have some type of like a gift shop, for example. This can be images of, of families coming in, yeah. um, anniversaries. I mean, yeah. so many things. Oh, so, so many, many events, events, so many, so many occasions. Yep. You know, it's your 18th, it's your 50th, it's your 40th, yep. all those big events and weddings and oh my goodness me. Tell the detail. I mean, this is actually it's really, really good on the, on the, on the video And there. it was 15 seconds and it was on. Yep. And, and is that washable? Was about... A washable? Absolutely. Absolutely. Obviously, we always recommend waiting 24 hours prior to washing. Yeah. But once that, because you need the, the, the glue or the adhesive on the back to really crystallize and, and blend with the fabrics. But after that, you can wash as you wish. And so, would we go like 30 degrees? Up to 40 degrees. Up to yeah, 40? 40 degrees. Oh, even better. Sorry, isn't that awful? I went straight to say, is it 40 soon? Rudy's like, I can wash as well, thank you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Don't ask me. I wash everything together. <laughs> uh, well, that's why I didn't ask you, but I didn't like to be sexist. <laughs> that's why I went straight to the lady over there. <laughs> Because you're just I, I like do, my dad. I Whites do. and black, straight in one. But I do wash my clothes. It's just I'm I don't do it. I don't do it. It smells the... very nice, people. Listen, I will I, just say. I will, I will say one thing. I, I, I'm Cuban, so us Cubans, as we're being raised, our mothers do everything for us. We're very do spoiled. They? We're very spoiled. I love you, Mom. Take it on, Mommy. <laughs> but we are very spoiled in that sense. <laughs> yeah, but that's nice. That's lovely. She's yes. bought, she, well, she's raised you very lovely. You're a very Thank nice Thank you so much. I appreciate man. it. Thank you so but much. But that is how quick that is. So, mm -hmm. um, right then, can we just go back as yes. well? Oh, because we want to do the markers. Yeah, I think we, we have some time to do the markers, something yeah. quick. Yeah. Are you a good drawer? No. I Me mean, neither. <laughs> but I have, a, I have a trick for that. <laughs> good. I have a trick for I'm that. I'm not very good at drawing. <laughs> Me Sorry, Rudy. I can't help you there at all. <laughs> Um, so, um, what I would suggest that you do is, um, we have been allocated. Have we got them now? Are we okay to... It's tomorrow, so we can get them from tomorrow. But you can, can, can we buy them today, though? Are you going to do them tomorrow? Oh, right. Pay attention. We're going to give you the chance to buy them tomorrow. We can't get them in the show today. Okay. I'm on the show tomorrow, so I'll sort that out. Are you speaking to me? or? No, I'm talking to them. Ah, okay. 
I'm still getting used to this TV right. thing, right? I, mean, right? I don't have the earphones. Yeah, no, right. no, I'm, 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 no. All right, no, all right. Sorry. Yeah, no, it's not. But we can do it tomorrow. Okay, okay? And I'm on air tomorrow, so I will be able to sort that out for okay. you. So um, those of you that are desperate, clean, and have now seen that, seen it cut, seen that happen, <laughs> Uh, you can get five sheets of the A4 and we've reduced the price to $16.99. And they're flying out the door, understandably. So No, the product is incredible. It it's, really is true. That's just blown and you my can, mind. And, it, and it works with any cutter, digital cutter that you have that actually has the ability to read those registrations. So any other type of machine out there, if you still have, if you have a digital cutter that has the ability to do the print and then cut, you can still use the product. So if you've got, oh, okay. Yep. I like this one now. No. I like how wide it is. We're versatile. We don't want to exclude our customers. Okay, but if you've got like a care. Cricut or a Brother Scan and Cut, is or that a Silhouette the... Cameo. Silhouette. Yeah. Oh, so any of the. Oh. Yeah, because they all, they, have, they all have that function. So. Okay. That's why my director's getting very excited in my ear because he know. has a Cricut. I'm not supposed to say these things, but in reality, I mean. But they're... we've got to look after everybody, haven't we? We've got Absolutely. to be all encompassing. At the end of the day, we are a heat transfer manufacturer. Yeah. Right? So for me, it's very important to to have good products in the market. Fabulous, so, yeah, brilliant. Yeah. Okay, so the sublimation market yes. as well. Yes, so one thing I'll, let me go ahead and, I'm just gonna go ahead and increase the temperature here because we'll need some more temperature. Oh, okay. So sublimation is a very unique process. Uh -huh. um, are you familiar with sublimation? The only time I've ever seen sublimation was the sublimation mugs when we sold a cricket mug okay. press before. So I, I think we'd all appreciate a bit more education if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, so, well, I think we can start by just kind of forgetting everything. What do you mean you have an update for me? Oh, it's, it's oh, that. That's I thought it was my computer. We've got okay. an update there okay. again, Becky. Lovely. Okay, I thought it was screen. my computer. Yeah, no, that's So fine, sublimation yeah. is a very unique process. Actually, it's a very beautiful process. Oh, yeah. Um, and the reason is because it is it's one of the few ways to really get some really, really dark and vibrant colors. So it's a really beautiful form of art. And it's been used for many, 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 many decades, the sublimation. Um, in this particular case, we're using markers, but yep. typical tr sublimation is a printer that uh -huh. has special inks, sublimation yep. inks. You print on a special type of paper, and then you transfer it onto a polyester fabric. Okay. Okay, so the polyester is very, very important because it needs to, it's, it's an ink that is going to convert into a gas and then transfer onto the substrate. It does. It does. Wow. Sublimation, exactly. Um, so what the sublimation markers are is a introduction to sublimation without the actual need of the printer. Cool. So if you are looking into getting into sublimation with creating your art, this is a really nice and unique way to do that. It's a step stone to all exactly. the other things as exactly. well. Exactly. A little it? bit more economical than yeah. buying a printer oh, right off the bat. Great idea. Okay. Pretty cool. It's pretty uh -huh. cool. You want to see how it works? Yes, please. Now we've got a yes. pack of, you can buy a pack of primaries. You get six or you can have the set of six of the black uh, and they come with, do both sets come with the three different um, tips? No, just the just black. Just the black. Just the black, okay. yes. Because typically the black is going to be for doing outlines and things like that. Okay. And then the primary is going to be for the filling in. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this one comes with the three different tips and yep. that, uh, uh, nibs, tips, whatever you call them. Yep, nibs, and you, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes, nibs. <laughs> Tips, you. nibs, I mean, I think it's all. Same thing. Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, so uh, we're going to see them in, right, well, okay. Yep. So one of the nice accessories that actually comes with the, the, uh, the Romeo. Romeo is the adapter for the sublimation markers. Oh, and that comes with it? It does. It does. Okay. For people like us that don't know how to draw well. Okay. Or not, not don't know how to draw because I, I can draw just not well. Exactly. <laughs> so let's yet. rephrase it a little bit. Yet. <laughs> so what we can do is actually, we'll grab our black yeah. marker. Okay. Oh, can I open this? Or? Yeah. Do you, to, do you want me to do it for Yeah, you? please. Well, I say, I say I'll do it for you. I'm not going <laughs> to... Okay. Well, I can manage that, can't I, for him? So we'll remove the blade. Okay. So do you want to show the different tips here while I get the, the machine Yeah, I'll do up? that for you, my lovely. Perfect. Thank there you, you so much. And then right. we'll do... Okay. Okay. So if I show you... Hang on. Oh, well, they are different, aren't they? Oh. There you go. Is yeah. that okay? Yeah, yeah. I was going to just grab this one if you don't. That one? Yeah. He's nicked me nib. I did. <laughs> I did. I did. Oh, it's so <laughs> Hang on. I will have another one I can show you. Just a minute. Bear with me. <laughs> All right. So I can... There we go. So I want to show you the three different nibs, my lovelies. So there you go. Do you get two of each then, Rudy? Because it says you six. You do. Yeah. Yes. Two of each of the nibs. Okay, so those are in the pack of the uh, six of the black. 
any sublimation. We've got those on screen at the moment. So your code is UV9G26 for the sublimation markers in the assorted nibs uh, in the pack of six. Okay. And you're about to see them in action as well. Yes. Do you mind if um, the, um, the mat? This? Yep. So I'm actually print, I'm actually drawing on regular paper. So this is regular computer paper. Okay, just copy a paper. Yep, just regular okay. paper. So again, you're saving some money on that. Oh, this is a bit sticky, so hopefully it doesn't stick too much. Now this one, we never, we didn't do any test cuts we or anything, so nope. hopefully it all goes smooth. You just put the pen in the Exactly. Layer. So I'm just adapting it there, making sure it's good. Okay. Bear with me. We're just gonna do a quick. Okay, not bad. So even then, I'm doing a test cut just to make sure it's there's not too much pressure. Uh huh. It looks good. And I will go to now my designs. Okay. What I'll do is actually I'll just pick a, any random design. And this is design. one of the sort of 3,000 designs that's in the software. It is, it is. But all I want to do is just find a design, and this is not something I was, I didn't know if we were going to do the, the sublimation Sorry. markers or not. Did, am so, I asking no, for things no, we weren't no. due to do, really? No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. I like, uh, I like the improvising. So let's say we have something fun like this right here, like we have uh -huh. a butterfly. Yep. Let's see how this is going to look. Uh-huh. Hopefully it goes as I expect it to go. Uh-huh. Okay, so now I will send the butterfly design. Again, just a, one of our basic images that we have on there. Yeah. And then we're going to go ahead and send this over. So the idea is that we're going to draw the outline, and then with the primary markers, we can actually draw inside. Is it doing it good or no? Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was listening to you. I'm watching it at the same time. Yep. So all we're doing is basically like you're sending a cut job in this case, we're just sending it with the marker inside, which is going to draw the design out for me. And look how quiet and quick it is. Exactly. You see? Now, here's a question. Yes. Um, how would I know which nib to go for? Well, I went with the fine tip because I wanted just a nice outline. Okay. So it just depends on the, drawing. on the drawing. Okay. Yep, exactly. Okay. Because it comes out really nice. Doesn't it? <laughs> I can't believe how quick and how quiet it is. It is quiet. It's extremely oh. quiet, really. Because you, you, you read the sort of, you go onto the, on the, onto the, onto the website you and go. you start reading about it and you hear it says fast and, <laughs> exactly. fast and quiet and you think, mm, yeah. No way. And then you, hit, you see that and you're like, oh my God, it's like, boom, 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 and it, can't I hear it? It's brilliant. Okay. So now you can, maybe can help me out a little bit here. So you know, you see here, even though it looks black or excuse me, it looks a little bit gray, that's okay. This is the part of sublimation. You won't get okay. to see those real colors until you actually go ahead and print it. Okay. Or apply it, I should say. Uh-huh. So, so you this has gone straight onto the easy color again. Yeah, but let's draw a little bit inside so they can see the colors. What do you think? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. So we'll grab some of the primary colors. I jump to it that Yes, again. please. <laughs> and then in the meantime, I'll grab something here that we can um, apply it to. These are the colors that you get in the, oops, a daisy, in the primaries. Mm -hmm. So you can see them. There you go. That's your six primary colors. Orange, pink, green, blue, yellow, and red. And again, we're going to 1999 for the sublimation markers in the primary. Okay. Okay, so there you go. Do you want to draw a little bit of drawing just so we can see the colors? It looks like the mat was a bit too sticky, but that's okay, no problem. Okay. Do you want to draw something on it? Yeah, there? can I have a go as well? Yeah, <laughs> go for it, go for it. You go for it and then, <laughs> it's a little bit messy up here right now, it's but okay. that's okay. So yeah, fine. just color in so we can see some colors so they can see what it's gonna look like once we actually apply it. Okay. So basically with the black, we were able to draw the outline. Now it's become kind of like a coloring book. Yep. So this is great for, Ooh. you know, if you're doing kids' parties, if yeah. you're just doing, you know, stencil work or selling the stencils, this is also a really great idea. I love the fact you can just go straight on. Yep. Can I do one more? Yeah, and yeah then... absolutely. And then we'll see what we can do. Oops. Maybe we'll draw one of these in here. Go on, you can do one, and then we can, we can have done it together. <laughs> All right. Team effort, right? Teamwork. So you want to make sure that you are doing it I'm not a good drawer at all. And also I'm left-handed, so even worse. Okay. I'm sure we could have picked somebody else in this building that could have done a well, much better know. job. It's <laughs> it's no, I think that's that's you're all right. Yeah, yeah. You're all right. Sue's having a great time over there. <laughs> she's she's the been she's been waiting for me to do that part. <laughs> oh, it's, we were just showing you how it works. Exactly. It's a bit Let's of fun. See. 
They sure it shows the two people manage? to uh, yes. Yeah. So I'm just gonna go ahead and cover this. Are you just putting that with some Teflon? Yeah, we just ah, you knew what it was. Perfect. Yeah, we're just with some Teflon. <laughs> oh, what? That was bad. <laughs> oh no, it just kind of. It's, oh, it's you just, know what it is. I do do a bit of cooking, you know. <laughs> Bottom of the oven. I'm all right. <laughs> oh, you know what it is. Awkwardly walking out of the stage. <laughs> Okay, so now, so we're facing the paper down. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> so we are facing the paper down. Let me actually cut this little piece oh, here. The, that would, have you got some scissors? That's yeah, okay, we can just go like this. Okay. Uh, we have got a message from Susan. Susan says, OMG, kids' parties will never be the same again with those pens. Exactly. Exactly. Any party, any party doesn't, you know, yep. oh. So one thing that you'll notice is I've increased the temperature and the time okay. for the application. So now we are working at 185 degrees mm -hmm. for uh, 35 seconds. Okay. And I've put Still the paper, quick, though, it's very quick. Yeah, it's, quick. it's very quick. So let's go ahead but and- But again, um, just adjust your iron, yep. no steam and do it- Exactly, a bit longer than that with yep. the iron. Mm -hmm. Okay. Sublimation does require higher temperatures okay. for letting the, the, the sublimation or the actual process of the inks transferring over. Well, it's the gas, isn't it? It's the gas, always the gas. See, I'm listening. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm not making any more comments at this point. <laughs> <laughs> but the most important thing is that it does need to be transferred onto a polyester substrate. Po okay, so polyester. Polyester is very important. Okay. Whether it's a t-shirt, a mouse pad that we're doing it on here. Let's see how it polyester. looks. Polyester, gotta remember that when we polyester. Uh, I just need more to transfer. But you can see here it's transferred it on to the mat. Okay. Ooh, ooh, it's not nice the best ball. drawing, but Yep. <laughs> Not the so best you drawing, but you can see that. Yep. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's brilliant. For the next one, we'll pick better okay. design. But. Okay. <laughs> but that's onto a mouse mat. So, oh my goodness me, the things that you can make. We'll show, we'll show them a real sample of what yes, it please. really should look like when you're actually drawing correctly. <laughs> so, you can see there. Now, this is something we did on, a, um, on our white vinyl, right? glitter vinyl, because oh. actually, you can actually um, sublimate onto the white vinyl. So you can see that those colors really, really stand out. Goodness gracious, this is awesome. This goes on fire. Wow. <laughs> I, I'm so <laughs> smitten with this. It's absolutely <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Wow. So yeah, if you're looking, if you've seen sublimation anywhere online and you thought this could be something for you, this is a kind of good intro way. Introduction, yep. I think this is superb, yep. absolutely superb. And, and like Susan said there, this is the thing, if you start designing things like, like you were just talking there, Susan, have you got them? Have you bought them, Susan? Because these pens are an absolute game changer, <laughs> aren't they? They are, they are. I mean, they, they open up a lot, of the, a lot of doors for a lot of different creative projects. And uh, I, I, the first thing I thought when I, we started launching these pens was exactly that, parties. Yeah. Kids' parties. I mean, this is a great way to get everybody. Of course, always be careful because you do need heat. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. So be careful with that. But the kids but can draw. But they can do the designs, exactly, can't they? Exactly. You can just do the heat bit. Exactly. Oh, my goodness, exactly. man. This is and, awesome. And that way, every kid can go home with their personalized T-shirt, personalized cap, personalized mouse pad, whatever. It's well, a make and take, isn't it? Exactly. That's a exactly. great thing. Yep. You make and take party. Yep. They've got something at the end of it. I think it's absolutely genius. And again, if you're doing weddings and you're doing sort of bridesmaids and grooms and things like that, you've just got endless possibilities now haven't you absolutely unbelievable right so we've got about oh, i don't know about sorry lovely it's okay sorry oh we've got some big news apparently okay oh have we been given four more machines seriously sue oh you absolute legend behind okay. the scenes today or tomorrow not to... right now they've changed their mind right we can okay. have it today rudy so if you were in the wings trying to get hold of the Romeo. 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 He says it better, obviously. Say it no, nicely. No, Go no, on. No, no, no. Um, Romeo. Uh, if you were trying to get the Caesar <laughs> Romeo, uh, with, don't forget, you get your two-year two -year guarantee. Yes. Uh, you get the full support from Caesar as well. You've got all the assistance there that you could possibly need. There is so much. I mean, look at this. I just took this off the... Um, do, 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 do. Let one? me put that there. I mean, all the information that you could possibly need. I just took this off Caesar's website. I just went on to caesar.com today, took all the information of what the machine can do, the Leonardo software, all the information there, everything keeps going down. And then you've got all that. It just, there's so much information to hand and support just on the, um, on, on the homepage. And I love that. Create, cut, love, repeat. 
Uh, it's just awesome. So every single bit of information is there, okay? We should also mention, I don't believe I mentioned this earlier, but the Romeo actually comes with a manual, which actually seems to be very, very popular. It seems I, like we like something physical exactly. still, I think, don't we? I know we, we know about obviously downloads and all the mm -hmm. bit, but when you've got your actual instructions and your yep. guidelines and your operational handbook, yep. I think we still like the physicality of it. Which is incredible. Obviously, when we first launched it, we thought, okay, we'll do a lot of cool videos, kind of showing the process, and the last thing people watch is the videos. Mm. They will go right to the manual, yeah. they will go right to social media, yeah. or last case scenario, they go to the videos. And it's incredible. It's a really, the mindset is really interesting, yeah. but the manual seems to be a big hit. It's a big, thick manual as well, isn't well, it? Well, we have to, we, it's translated in various languages. languages. Yeah. yeah, it comes in English, Brilliant. Italian, French, German, and Spanish. Brilliant, fantastic, great. You want, sorry, Alex? For the multilinguist, that's you, isn't it? Hmm. <laughs> be surprised, I have colleagues that speak five languages. It's <laughs> It's impressive, wow. yes. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. That's a lovely manual nice, as well. Right? Fabulous, yeah. lovely. Now, we've got about five minutes left, so what do you want to round up? Do you want to, do you want to go back to the Romeo? Because, sure. And Rick, because we didn't even... Well, yeah, should we finish on that? Sure, sure, sure. Would you like to... Okay. There you go, yes. sir. Yes, so some of the... Outside of what we just saw, which was the print and cut, the adaptable pen... Um, there you go, my lovely. Uh, sharp, or Sharpie. <laughs> sublimation marker. Mm -hmm. We also have the tools inside of the actual Romeo that will allow you to make the process of starting out with the machine very simple, uh -huh. especially with the different products. Yep. So I, one thing that I find to be really, really, really interesting and really, un and really unique is the cut settings here. So if I click on cut settings, let's click here on EasyWeed, you have all the different materials already preloaded with their cut settings inside of the touch screen. So what can we, what sort of materials have we Well, got? right now, this is for our heat transfer vinyl. Okay. But if you do want to... Blackboard. Yep, we have all the, also here, where you can actually place your own uh, materials as I well. I like that sparkle, twinkle. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, so these are all the different types of vinyls that we manufacture oh. as well. Um, but then you also have some open spaces here, slots, if you're doing any type of other jobs, like cardstock, or if you're doing... Um, Brilliant. I think they're even leather you can cut depending on the thickness really? of it. Right. Yes, okay, yes. brilliant. Yep, so you can either do use that settings or you can actually customize it in the software okay. as well. And again, just remember the software is inclu includes about 3,000 designs in them, but of course you can use your own as well. So again, if you want to personalize them, yep. members of your family and your photographs of your pets and whatever it might be, and occasions and milestones and whatever, you can do that as well as the 3,000 elements in there as well. And also the designs in there cannot be sold separately or individually as they come, but you can use those designs that come as with a commercial license to make the finished product and sell that finished product. I was going to ask you that, yes. brilliant. Am I right in thinking as well, you've got a pro version coming down further down We do, we do, yeah. we do. The pro version is going to come with a lot more designs op uh, design options, but also tools they're going to make the software even more powerful when it comes and to the actual designing. And you'll just pay for that as a... Exactly, payable. it'll yeah. be a payable, okay. yep. Fantastic. But it'll just be a set fee that you'll pay monthly, and then right. the rest, um, you yeah. won't ever have to pay for any type of additional but items. But that's the same with the cricket, you pay a monthly amount. It's, We're it's, used to that, It's aren't pretty we? common yeah. now. It's, yeah. it's the way to keep these types of programs to keep evolving. But this future-proofs your machine. Exactly. Because it just keeps growing with you. This is yeah. the great thing. Anyway, I'm going to zip it. <laughs> um, over to you, love. No, no, and it is true because an another really key element is that we have the designers of the software actually work for Caesar. So if there's any so changes, it's all in house. Exactly, right. it's all in house. Yeah. If you ever need anything, they know anything, the machine. They know what they're doing, and they're always watching to see what the user is looking for. So if Great. there is a particular need for, let's say, a rhinestone design, which I, or a tool to make rhinestone designs, we can also implement that. Obviously. It will take its time. Really it's, it's really innovative. It's really innovative because innovative. it's very interactive and we always are constantly speaking with the engineers to make sure that, the be, that we put the best software out on the market. Okay. I know there's a couple more of you trying to get hold of this as well. Just remember we are offering you a five maximum split pay opportunity. So nobody else does that. So we're 50 pounds cheaper than anywhere else on the planet and we are offering you five months to pay for it. So. 100, was it £159.80? Still only charge you your standard post and packaging of £3.95, which is unbelievable. Think what you're saving with that on top. And you can get it home for £159.80. It is going to be ready to ship immediately. Okay, your code NW9G80. If these demos, and don't forget as well, do you know, we offer a 30-day money-back guarantee. 
You're not going to need it, but it's your safety blanket. Anyway, sorry. I, I find the shipping absolutely incredible, actually. Amazing. That's that's our that's, unique selling point that, here, really. That, that how much would that would cost <laughs> exactly. to ship. Yep, yep. No, I mean, that for me would be just enough. <laughs> well, I sent, uh, you know, like, a, like what, well, it's called a mince pie yep. tin. Mm -hmm. Do you know what one of those is? No. No, I didn't. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Got him back now. Uh, but I sent, it's just like a muffin tin, a baking tin to make muffins. Of course and, I know what yeah. it is. Oh, right. I, I also bake. <laughs> No, I don't. <laughs> no, no, you don't. No, you totally no, no, didn't. no. <laughs> Got more attractive than even then, didn't you? Uh, but I sent one of those to New Zealand. Cost me twenty-four pounds just really? to send a little, little tray. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Yep. Uh, right then, how many machines can we just double? Have we still got one or two of the extra machines left? We have got a couple left. <sighs> I panic then. We do have a couple left of the. Ad can I just say, Sue? Thank you so much for adding those in. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, we've got 90 seconds left. Okay. If you, you had to say to that person there thinking, do I, don't I, what would be your advice to buy? My advice to, I, I would always say, always do your research. Make sure it's something that you actually need and desire for, because I think that's very important. I, I like to be truthful. I don't want to yeah, sell no, stuff. No, that's exactly that's, what we want. They're never going to use. Yep. If this is something that you see as a value to you as a hobbyist or as a professional business owner, then I would say go for it because this is going to change your life completely. But wow. always, always do your research. I don't want to offer you or sell you something that you will never use. Make sure this is something that's actually something that's going to help you and benefit right. you and help you grow in the process. I love that because that was a really honest, and that's what I did before I came on air today. I really wanted to research this because when you're trying to decide between yeah. the digital cutting machines, I mean, obviously the 24-inch yeah. width, is the, is the big USP as yep. well, and the fastness and the quietness and the, everything else. But, you know, just knowing what it can do. And I did all my research before I came on, and it's fascinating what this machine can do. No, we're, we, globally, we are facing difficult times economically. So the best thing I can say is do your research, make a right investment. Yep. Just make sure this is the right pros, uh, yep. product for you. But again, if you've got that inkjet printer, make sure you are getting this <laughs> genius yep. Inkjet printer compatible, easy color, um, uh, five sheets that we had earlier because we took it to sixteen ninety nine as well. Rudy, you've been amazing. Thank you so much. We hope to have you back soon. Thank you so okay, much. I appreciate care. it. We'll see you after the break. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> purchase anything on Hobbymaker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee, meaning that you can shop with confidence. Happy shopping with Hobbymaker! to know what's going on in the next show then head over to our website click on the TV guide this will tell you who's presenting which guest we have joining us along with what's going on in each hour if you ever miss a show you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show you can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy catch up on hobby maker it couldn't be easier to watch Hobbymaker. You can join us on Sky, Freeview, 
on our website or on YouTube, so you can watch at home or on the go. Are you having trouble finding the perfect gift? Then why not treat them to the new gift card from Hobbymaker at hobbymaker.co.uk. Simply scroll down to the bottom where it says gift cards, click and you'll be taken to the right place. Decide between posting the card or delivery by email and then decide how much you want to add. You choose the value. So what do you get the crafter that's got everything? Why not treat yourself or them to the Hobbymaker gift card? Oh, we're all tempted now, aren't we? Um, right then, my lovelies. So we are coming back to the lovely creative expressions with our very own brilliant, well, creative expressions, brilliant designer of these awesome, a whole dozen, a whole wonderful 12 of these beautiful petal doodles, uh, the stamps that we have here. We launched them. Uh, they've only been launched this week. They are brand spanking new. Uh, and instead of £87, you can buy the entire collection. Do you want to come over, Jane? Oh, okay, okay. Do you yes. want to come over, lovely lady? Yes. Um, this is Jane. Hello. Our lovely Jane. Uh, so Jane is the designer of all these incredible designs. I didn't ask you earlier. How long does it take to, com to compile something like this? Oh, I well, quite a while. I mean, sometimes there? I can do one in a day, sometimes two or three. But these are... Uh, I really enjoyed drawing these. And I could do them anywhere in the house, just sit there with my iPad and my pen and oh, fabulous. sketch away. Can I be rude? I'm just going to check your... Oh, my, is my mic not working? It may not be on. Okay. And we want to make sure we can hear you. Just oh. bear with me, sorry. It's all right. Somebody's down here fiddling <laughs> with Jane. Sorry, Jane. Yes, I, yes somebody's... Hear me. There we go. Are we back in action, Director Dan? We're back in action, Jane. So, sorry, it can, one can take you a day... Your one can take me a day. Um, sometimes they can take me less than that. I can do mm. two or three. But because it's on my iPad, I can just draw anywhere in the house. So oh, if I'm sitting brilliant. on the sofa, uh, I can just take my pen and just sketch. When was the first time you designed a stamp that became an actual stamp? When was that? Oh, it must be, crikey, it must be about 15 years ago. Was it? And it was my bubble range of stamps. I don't know if any of the viewers are familiar with those. They've just got lots of circles on them. Oh, really? And, and now I've designed a die and I've taken them a step further. But oh, the first wow. one I did was a little Christmas tree. What's it, it had a sort of a curvy shape to it. Yeah. And it had lots of little teeny weeny circles. But I've progressed since then and added more and more to it, flowers and, and wow. I've been put a die to do, do the circles and things. Brilliant. It's just great. Honestly, I'm, I'm always in awe. I mean, Rudy just asked me if I could draw and I just said that to say no. <laughs> You've got no <laughs> chance. Um, but you are absolutely incredible. Now, there is the By the Show, which is all 12 uh, stamps. You're going to see, we're going to show you each one, or there is also a pick and mix option. So if you buy the show, each one of these brand new, hand-drawn by Jane, incredible, beautiful petal doodle stamps, uh, they're available, in, if you break that down, the whole set, each set of those stamps is at a mere £5.83. Or if you want to uh, have the other code that we pop in, it's a pick and mix. You can add, all you do is you put the code into your basket, which is about to come onto your screens. It will bring you a drop-down me uh, menu. It's GN... Uh, 2827 and if you put three in it'll automatically reduce the price a very special buy price today to £18.92 okay all you need to do is, do not, uh, is numbers of three so if you want three great if you want six great do it in threes and you'll get the saving okay would you like to see them so that you know which one is which yeah, shall I do? Should we do it like we did last time? Yeah, we time? did. I have a feeling they may be in a bit of a jumble and I've pinched one out. Well, of it, I'll go we, and, I'll well go I'm going to have again. a go to manage. Oh, all right, I'll go and get that card back. Oh, OK. Again, because there's one missing. Oh, we box. took one out, didn't we, Jane? Well, yeah, I've got, go. oh, I'm all ready. I think that's the second. OK, well, I'm ready with that one, look. All right, we're all in a, we're all different. Are in we in a year. kerfuffle? Yeah, I did, I've done mine in a code order, but I can find, I can rummage through these bits of paper. Or shall I just use the stamps? Yeah, should we do that on that? We'll do it, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's just do the stamps. We're good. So here we've got um, Take Care. So you've got a really big tulip-style um, flower so that you can stamp the greeting in the middle. 
you can doodle in the middle or you can just leave it plain as it is. Beautiful. Take care of yourself. Yeah. And I'm just going to reach behind me because there's a okay. card. Up okay, there you grab that lovely lady. That is made with a petal on that set of stamps. Ooh. Now, look at that. Oh, this oh, is no. when you were talking about um, the fact that it, that petal being used yeah, to make so an entire it's flower. That, it's the petal that's on, where is there. it? There it is. There. On there. Yep. But she has stamped all the way round and um, created a bigger, much bigger flower. Brilliant. Than what I've designed. And Clever. I just thought that was genius. And she's used the centre. I think that's a centre from another, another set. So yeah. that they work together. Brilliant. And this is the thing, this is what we talked about earlier though, mix and match. You haven't got to yep. keep one set of stamps on one card. Mix and match the whole collection, I've you know. So, that. yeah, and I think that's from the... I have to say, our design team have just been brilliant. Haven't they? Clearly love yes. them, haven't yes, they? Yes, they have. That little image that you saw there was from the do... Uh, what's it called? The Happy Soul one. Yeah. So, the next one, right, lovely. the next one, I've got the Be Happy. Are they right. not in order? Oh. No, but you know what? There he is. There he is. We got there. We there got he there. is. It's got quite a big flower, so the B is obviously a separate stamp. So he. So that's can be the B happy. Out. So the middle of the flower is, is hollow, which makes it nice and easy to ink. And you can put your sentiment will fit yeah. in the flower, won't exactly. it? Exactly. So I've yeah. given you the option to have the sentiment or the centre of the flower in there, Brilliant. and the little B as it put it in the background mm. somewhere. I'll just cut him out. Mm. Yeah. Cut Brian out. <laughs> Okay, that's that one. Let's that, put that okay. one there. Let's put them we? in order, shall we, okay. this time? Okay. But they so were in order the first got, time, weren't they? Um, I'll find you. We have we got... That's yeah, that, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, it. That would be okay. There you go. Uh, is that the right one? Is that right? Yes, it is. It yes, is, it yes. is. So this is a good example because I've got the flower and I have carried on the stem to make it longer using a fine black pen that matches the width of the outline of the stamp. So it changes it completely. Yeah. And I've re-stamped the leaves and I've cut them out and stuck them down to, to give another look. And again, you've got the sentiment and the centre that can be mixed and matched. Gorgeous. Doing it a different way. No, honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm absolutely bowled over with these. I think they're fabulous. Oh, we got those now. Well, the stitches, we've got various well, we've got, stitches yeah, so throughout, we've got, throughout the, well, we'll the samples. I think they're at the bottom. I think it's these it's ones. It's these here. and that one there. Yeah. The zigzaggy yeah. and that one and I'll that hold one. That one up. So and that the one. Zigzag, um, zigzag set. This is the um, doodle stitches. So we've got uh, six different um, designs that you can use for borders. And oh, uh, yes. Yeah, so just, just looking at these borders. It. Sorry, they're on the card. See yes. the borders look. There you go. So then I've got another one here where we've got um, the little zigzag bit there at the top there. Where is Perfect. It? There, it, there it is, that one there. Is that one as, is that, that's one as well, isn't it? Yeah, that's got on oh, the you've outline. you've got two you've got there, the dotted, look. The dotted line. Yeah. Yeah, you've got two on that one. Is yes, that squiggly one as well? Uh, no, that's not. Oh, no, I think I've hand-drawn that. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that's how good you are. <laughs> <laughs> so that's your borders. Okay. That's the border one. Yeah. Oh, so no, we had, had the bug, didn't we? We got the bugs. then. So here's the bugs. You've got this is seven on there. very much the favourite of a lot of people, There's I think. Seven on there. I'm surprised it actually because I thought, shall I do these or not? I love oh, drawing they're bugs. Lovely. But they look good. I've done the they coloured those in with alcohol markers because you have to be a bit more precise. Yeah. So it's a different look. Yeah. But they look fantastic. They do. And they, all the colours match the, the inks that we've got in the show. So you've got lime greens, oranges, pinks. Mm. And Brilliant. They, they probably look like that in the world. They wild. do. They're fabulous. Here we got Mr. Little Frog. So he's do, 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 on a long do, do, card. Do, this one. Do, 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 do. <laughs> this was It's a Gift. Again, Life you've got is a gift. another greeting. And uh, you've got the little frog on there. You've got separate leaf. You've we'll got show you the frog. Dots. Look yeah. at him here. He's so cute. Look at his eyes. I've cut him out. And so I've stamped him onto some watercolour card and cut him out. And he's sort of slightly on the top of the Great. the background. <laughs> He's got a nice expression. <laughs> Fabulous. <laughs> right, so that is your... What's that one called again, sorry? That one's called It's, it's a, a Gift. Life is a Gift, absolutely. This is a good one. This is um, Never Give Up. So you've got two centres. That one. We have got two <laughs> centres on here. There we go. <clears throat> two ideas. So I've done what I've done. I've made a card that shows you how the, you can use the um, greeting 
or the centre and I've used a bit of bleach to bleach out the centre so if you're wondering how I got that lovely clean white middle that's what I've done I can show you how to do that Brilliant. shortly. Beautiful okay lovely and now we have the sunflower. Oh, I'm with Here you. We are. So this, this one's, one's called uh, with, love. with Love. So you've got a lovely big sentiment there. Obviously it doesn't fit in the middle but there you go it's you've already got the centre on that one so it's quite a different card. Again, you can carry on the stem to make it longer like the other one that we showed you. That's a nice one. It's, it's always beautiful. a bright and cheerful. You've got some beautiful. flowers to stamp in the background mm, as gorgeous. well. Gorgeous. This is the sunflower, Love Life. And we have, let me just remind myself on here. Oh, yeah, we've got separate leaves here with a curly stem, which you can extend. You've got little ladybird. And again, you've got the choice of the, the um, sentiment in the middle or the centre of the flower in there. You demoed with that one earlier, didn't you? I did, and yeah. that's got a sample of one of the borders on there. Yeah. So I've just done it one down one side. So yep. if you want to go back and watch that demonstration, that was at three o'clock. Five o'clock. Five o'clock. I meant five o'clock. I was just testing yeah, you, Jane. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't on air at three o'clock. <laughs> this one is this one. This here. one. This is Happy Soul. And we've, it's a long card, so you've got three smaller um, flowers. Again, they'll just, they would mix easily with the bigger ones as well. Um, cut them out. They're easy to cut out because I like doing a bit of fussy cutting. Do you? They're really good to cut out. So if you don't like big, big flowers, this is the one for you. And they all look nice together. Even if you repeat them, mm. do the same one, you can make them look slightly different by adding um, the greeting which you've got on there. It's do you there. tend to fussy cut with scissors or crop knife? Uh, scissors. Scissors. Yeah. yeah. Brilliant. Okay, next one. Oh, this I know this is, one. This, this is this a really one. nice one. This is all bunched up. So it's some, all the flowers that I've done in the release, or some of them anyway, made slightly smaller and put all together. Gorgeous. So a nice little group. Mm, beautiful. So okay. remember, you can buy the whole show with that code on the screen, DS2864, at 69.99 instead of £87. Or you can do a pick and mix on the code that we had earlier. Is um, that this, is, this one is this one? I've done it slightly different. I've used one of um, Jamie Rogers' uh, canvas dies to stamp. Oh, on. that's so it's, where I know so it's it's di got dimensional. Brilliant. Uh, that was a really nice idea. And the little um, dragonfly in the middle, he's separate, obviously. And uh, I've, I, you can do whatever you like in the middle with that one. I've done lots of doodling. Is that the right one? Cut. Happy thoughts. Like, yeah, it is the right. Yeah, one. yeah, yeah. Happy thoughts. It just looks so different when you. Doesn't say it, it just? Yeah. And there's there's another one. So it's got um, the centre in. It's a slightly great. different one. Yeah, beautiful. So just a couple more samples as well. We've got another example there of the uh, the bugs. Okay, you've got the be happy with the B one there as well. Just, I just don't want anybody to miss out from the design team on these lovely designs. And you've got that one as well with three different uh, flowers. And then that one again, I'll pop that there. So we've just popped the I Want It All bundle back on the, on the screen. That should be £69.99 instead of £87. Or again, if you put that other code in, you can just, it goes down uh, into a drop-down basket and it'll reduce your buy price to just £18.92. So do you think we should do a demo, Jane? I think we should do I a demo. I think we should, lovely. Okay, I'm going to nip over here. Okay, my lovely girl. Okay. They lovely. Aren't they lovely? And uh, we've had so many lovely messages in about you, Jane. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. They all say you th they think you should give me your necklace. <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> <laughs> she knows me too yeah. well already. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> okay, well, I'm going to use the... Um, oh, here we go. That's the stamp set. This is the Happy Soul. So you've got the three fl little flowers on there. You've got the little greeting... Um, set and you've got some little hearts some other little swirls and things like that um, yeah I, a lot of the text on these stamps by the way is all hand drawn it's not See. a typeface so I've, I've done it myself so it's really original so for here I have pre-stamped uh, the flowers I've used I've used all three of them. I've repeated, repeated one, and I've done it on the watercolour card that we've got in the show as well. Yes, we do. Really good. What was it? 280 grams, something like that. 290. 290, 290 so GSM, it's yeah. A nice, mm. a nice strength to it. It's got yeah, a nice yeah. colour to it. Smooth enough to take some detail. Uh, fabulous. Right, so I'm going to use the Intense Pigment Inks, and 
It's a contradictory of terms. It's a pigment ink, but yeah. it's actually an intense dye-based pigment ink. So pigment is mixed with water. Dye, is, to me, is more permanent, but they are permanent. So it is Very a mixture clever, of they? pigment yeah. and dye. Mm. Um, they are... Uh, intense which means they're very concentrated and so you only need a little bit and just to show you I've put all the colors in my palette so I'm going to bring it over here so that the camera can see so I've got all the colors in here and I've added some extra water mm -hmm. so they're nice and watered down I've got a nice big jar of water and I'm going to put a background on there and show you how quickly and easily you can create a background okay before I do that I'm going to spritz the back just slightly with a bit of water in my spritzer bottle and a bit on the front as well. And that will stop the card from curling up and mm -hmm. warping as you're painting. I like to use a really big brush and I'm going to create a nice background of perhaps just a bit of yellow and a little bit of the green. So I'm going to put this on, trying to go round the, round the flower, but I'm not too worried about going over the edges because this is really, really quite pale. I like to stick to the paler colours. If you want to put some blue on the background, then water it down an awful lot, otherwise your flowers probably won't show mm. if you put too much ink on it. Let's go back to the green, which is one of my favourite colours, and we'll just mix that in with the yellow as well. Lots and lots of water. Don't be afraid to use lots of water. It's watercolour card, so it's designed to take the colour like this. Yes. And carry that on around there. Add a little bit more water, mm. a little bit more yellow perhaps down here. See how it blends so easily. Mm. Mm -hmm. And even with the big brush, because it's really quite light as well, it doesn't matter so much if it's going to go into the image. Yeah. I love the way you do that. So I'm doing it from a distance. I'm, I'm sort of looking at mm. it sort of further away so my head's not in the, yeah, no, it's in the overhead camera. Um, that's okay. And then we're going to colour the flowers in. Okay. And I'm only going to do one or two, so I'm not going to colour the whole lot because I've actually done one, so I'll show you what I'm going to do next. So this mm -hmm. is the, what do you call this? This is the um, teal ocean. Yes. Lovely shade of teal. So I, I haven't dried the background. I'm putting this directly onto a damp piece of card. You can dry it if you want to, if you want to be a bit more precise. Mm -hmm. But I wanted to show you that if the, if the teal goes into the background, don't panic about it. Give your brush a wipe, a wash, give it a little wipe on some kitchen towel and just blend any of that colour into the background. Brilliant. So it really doesn't matter. And we'll put a little bit of the orange... On to another one. All these colours work so well together. Mm. Look how bright that orange is. Fabulous. And don't forget, I'm actually putting the basis of the of the design on. I'm putting the basis of the colour on. And um, it's what you do on top of it that is also really important. Uh, I've left space on these images so that you can doodle and do different things. Mm. So you carry on colouring all these in. Let's put a little bit of green on the, on the leaf so you can see what I, how to do that as well. So put a bit of green on the leaf, a bit of green on the stem, and carry on colouring them all in. Mm -hmm. And I'll just wipe my table because it's jolly wet. Give that a wipe, a wipe. And I've got one here I've already done. And I've also um, splattered it a little bit with some of the watered down ink. And you do that quite easily with a fan brush with a very, very watery bit of ink, lots of water and very little ink. And just tap that all over the background until you get some nice fine splatters. Yeah. So that's another idea of how you can create a nice background. So we've done that. I'm just going to blot what I did so it's not too um, wet for me to do my next stage. Okay. I'll just blot that there. So the next thing we're going to do is perhaps stamp some of the images that are on the set. Mm -hmm. So I've got some coloured ink pads that match the inks that I'm doing, so nice and colour coordinated. I've got turquoise and an orange, and we've got some the heart on the set 
we've got some hearts we do and some little squirrely bits here got some hearts going up in the stencils as well haven't uh, we? exactly so mm -hmm. that's why i've chosen the stencil mm -hmm. so we can stamp some of the little hearts around the background wherever you like do whatever you want to oh then they we'll look lovely add some of the little swirly bits with a little bit of orange mm -hmm. This orange is quite a subtle orange, so it's not too strong. Just dab those around anywhere. You've also got a greeting, which you can add to the, to the stamp too. Mm. Stamp that in the background. And then we've got another little star shape. We'll pop that Aww. on as well. I find stamping really relaxing. Do you? Do. Yeah. And if you've got these little blocks, which I have quite often on, on some of my shows that are... You do, those little acrylic blocks. They're, they're very handy, they're really, aren't they? They're really handy. Mm. So let's get those out of the way. And then to just transform it yet again, mm. it's getting that bleach out. So this is Jane was saying this earlier, it's a really, really thin, cheap it's a really bleach, thin, isn't it? Cheap. Yeah. You don't need to have use the really thick stuff. It's a cheap, um, thin bleach. And I just put it into a little bit of jar. I use an acrylic brush. Don't use a um, sable brush because that will dissolve in, yeah. in the bleach eventually. It will yeah. just disappear completely. Uh, so then you can pick elements out of your stamp to bleach out. So I'm going to bleach out the center of this one. This, some, this painting I did is dry. So I did it a little bit earlier. So it's completely dry. So it's best to do the bleaching when it is dry. You can either leave, leave it to dry naturally or use a heat tool. So I just take out little areas that I want. So can you see how it's turning completely I love white? that. I think it's such a good idea. So because I, I paint on, probably some people think I'm not being very careful. Mm. If you get your bleach and do this, it changes and it looks yeah. like you've been very precise. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Such a clever tip. I've got only a small amount on my brush, but I can't really see where I've been until it started to bleach. Look at that. What a difference that makes. And then we'll do the same thing with this one as well. Look at that. But it doesn't always go completely white. You've got sometimes a little bit of colour behind. It depends how much bleach you put on there. I've probably got quite a lot on my brush. Um, you can even put a little bleach on some of the inside, some of the leaves, if you wanted to. It can go anywhere. Mm. And I like to put a few little blobs on the background so it will turn. The background will have little white dots on it here and there. You said that's your signature, didn't it you? It is. Yeah. I do, I do like circles. Mm. So there's a lot of circles in my stuff. But that's why I think quite a few people have said what I said earlier on as well at the, in the five o'clock hour where people are thinking about sun tangling with your stamps because yes, we've just yeah. had somebody message in again because I, I suggested that as well. So who was that messaged in? Susan from Merseyside has just said um sun tangling them yes. springs to mind there's a sample yeah. on the shelf behind you there's a great big one here let me just where is it lovely me, it's on the top shelf the black and white one. Oh, this one here yeah and look oh. at this one look at that one. Oh well well susan and i think the name of whoever did diane that should be on, Dyke, diane on. williams diane, diane. Fantastic. hello she must have spent hours doing that hasn't she just isn't that amazing? And she's used so many of the stamps on there, hasn't she? I think that's a lovely idea. That is, Diane, thank you so much. That is beautiful. And I'll just show this one here as well, from the, from the uh, Be Happy one here. It's quite a different style, but still very, very attractive. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you could have a field day, couldn't you, with sun tangling with these? Now, that is the price that the I Want It All bundle should be, but it does go down to $69.99. So it will go down to $69.99. So, sorry, my lovely. It's okay. So I've, I've just blotted the bleach so it's not so wet because I want to do a little bit of doodling and I've got a fine tip black pen here. And this is something you can do at home if you've got a fine tip black pen. So you're just changing the look of the stamp by adding extra detail. 
and you don't have to be really good at drawing or anything. You just follow the outline of the flowers and adding anything you like. Oh, lovely. So I'm just putting some loops around the petals and some little swiggly lines in the middle of the petals. You just do whatever takes your fancy. Yeah. You can put a little black spot in the middle of that one. So carry on doing that. Some little little lines in this bit here. I think Santanglers are going to have an absolute field day with your So stamps. I'll show you that card again that's completely finished. So there we go. So it's a bit different from this one. But yeah. again, I've done exactly the same on there. Mm. So that's the finished card. And um, that's brilliant. Yep, put, I've added brilliant, the Jane. to it as well. Fabulous. So I'll tell you what, shall we, while Jane gets ready for the next demo, shall we go through the, um, the, the pigments for you, my lovely? So they come in a set A and a set B. So set A is, yes, so that is, if I show you this side here, it's going to be your sunflower yellow here and your citrus lime. So that's these two. And with the tangerine, isn't it? Yeah, the tangerine dream. So it's these two here. Your uh, sunflower yellow, your citrus lime, and your tangerine dream. That's these ones here. Now, we've given you a very special price today. They are reduced to just £8.75 to get the tangerine, the sunflower, and the citrus lime. And then if you want set B over here, which is these ones here, you're going to get the lovely rose pink, your beautiful bluebell, and your teal ocean. So it's basically those three there. That is the one that's on the screen at the moment. £8.75 for either set. And the code for those lovely brights is QJ2875. Okay, so that's for you to get your intense pigment stains. Okay, we also have... Oh, do, 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 do. Hang on, just wondering, what are you using in your next demo, lovely Jane? I'm going to use um, three flowers yep. from three different sets. Okay. Um, That's okay, but are you using the clouding? I'm going to blitz? go to the colour cloud. So shall I pop those on? Oh, and that's then a I good don't idea. Have to interrupt then you can you. tell, then you can show the colours as well. Fabulous. Fabulous. So, we, uh, Jane's about to use these. Okay. Yes, so we have got here... Do, 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 these. So, just make sure I've got the right ones. Do, 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 do. Yes, so we've got the Lime Burst. So this is, if I'll show you here, look, this is your Lime Burst. Give me the colours again, um, Alex, please. So the Tangy Tangerine, which is that one. And then that one there, the Bright Sunshine. So that's those three. And they're £6.33 a jar. So yeah, very, very, very blendable, the Colour Cloud blending inks. Okay, so that one, that one, and over Lime Burst. You all right there, Becky Love? You all right, Flower? Yes? Okay, live on television, darling. Sorry. It's all right. It's all right. Then we've got the Electric Blue, the Lush Pink, and the Fresh They do have to try and be ever so quiet when they're recessing the studio. I don't know how they do. It's very difficult, joking aside. But you've got the uh, fresh, fresh grass, you've got the light pink, and you've got that electric blue in this set here. Okay, so again, £18.99 for your beautiful uh, colour cloud blending inks. While I'm just going to pop on the screen as well, with my lovely, if my lovely producer does not mind me doing it, so that I don't have to interrupt our lovely Jane for the moment, is to make those even more blendable, use your latex smoothies. Okay? Pack of two, code AZ2851. They're only 4 99 and they are superb. You'll see them in action with Jane, and you certainly did in the 5 o'clock hour as well. So those are your brilliant latex smoothies, pack of two, on the screen, 4 99 Right, Jane, are right. we ready, my lovely lady? Yeah, I decided to use all, but... Uh, oh, no, I've used all colours on this card of the Colour Cloud, which is brilliant. And I've used three different stamp sets, mm -hmm. and I've... I've stamped the flowers onto a smooth card and I've cut them out. So I've used um, Pretty Place, I've used Be Happy 
and never give up. So I've used those flowers. Brilliant. And I've done the centres and some of the, so they look completely different. So this one, for instance, is here, but it looks completely different there because I've stamped the centre in it. Okay. And is it the is it the Versafine that you're using? To um, stamp yeah, it? I tend to use a, ver you do. a Versafine yeah. um, most of the time for for stamping the images in okay. black. Yes. Uh, first of all, I'm going to just do a quick background. So I'm going to use the gorgeous fresh grass. Oh, lovely. Have I got the right colour? Let me just see. Yes, I have. Got my smoothies here. Mm -hmm. So you've got the colour cloud blending ink in a sponge that's saturated with the ink. And you've got a hard um, fabric cover, mm -hmm. which you're going to press down with the smoothie to pick up the colour on there to apply it to your card. Okay. So we'll press that down. And it depends, I mean, you get them new, they're really, really juicy. So just be careful, you haven't got too much on your smoothie. So you can take a little bit off on the, on the lid. Mm -hmm. And we're going to just blend that colour all over my background. And this is onto the watercolour card that we've got no, on the this show? No, is, this is just a smooth, oh, a just smooth a uh, Creative Expressions card that oh, we've okay. got on the show. But it's, we've used it lots of times before. Okay. It's, um, it's a coconut white card. I like to put my hand on a bit of paper. Well, I've got a bit of a, oh no, that's no good because it's damp. Let me just grab one of these, that'll do. I don't like to put my hand on the wet ink because it'll show the fingerprints through. But it goes on completely smooth, it dries completely flat and you don't get any um, smoothie marks at all. Mm. Although you can see them there, it's, com it's fantastic. Yeah. And then we're going to splatter that because that's what I like to do. Mm -hmm to give the background a little bit more interest. So this is just water on a fan brush. Or you could flick it with your fingers, put some water on the background. I bet you're good at putting the water on the naans when you need to grill them, aren't you? Onto what? On the naan breads when you have to sprinkle water. I bet you're a dab hand Oh, you could do it. Yeah, I'm pretty good at that. <laughs> I don't have naan bread very much, very often though. <laughs> oh, I've just transferred some color on there from my, I'm running out of clean kitchen towel. Do you want us to get you some blue roll, lovely? I've got a little bit here, but that's, sure? that's all okay. I'm going to do now. So I've, 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 I can cover that with one of the flowers. So it's got a splattered um, tech, um, effect on there. So I'll leave that to one side to dry. So I've stamped all my flowers out and I've cut them out just away from the outline. Mm -hmm. And I'm now I'm going to colour them in. Lovely. So we'll use the tangy tangerine to do this mm -hmm. one. Again, push it down to get the colour on the applicator. And I'm just going to colour in the outer petal, holding the middle down. Mm -hmm. I've got different sizes of smoothies here. Um, we, the Creative Expressions bring them on um, Hobby Maker quite often. And I have one for every colour. Do you? And right, I keep okay. them in egg, egg cups, egg um, containers. You? Yes, whether oh, it be cardboard or ones that you get in the fridge because if you didn't keep your eggs in the fridge. Oh, brilliant, great idea. Then I'll go with a little bit of yellow in the center. Color that in, up to the orange. Mm -hmm. Like so. And we'll have a little bit of the pink. I haven't used the pink yet. So it'll be nice to see what that looks like. Let's get rid of that. This is the gorgeous lush pink. Way. and we'll just colour that in around the edges see how quickly you could colour in and as it dries mm. it goes a little bit paler yeah and completely flat in the in <coughs> colouring completely uh, a little bit of yellow in the centre it's just the speed of how quickly these yeah cloud inks yep. just colour in it's it's incredible I'll just blend a little bit of that yellow I wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't seen it do you know what I mean <laughs> it's so quick and then the other one a little bit of the blue yeah again this is this is a new one of mine so you need to have a very small amount and I've probably got enough yeah because you, you went a bit darker yeah, than you wanted did. earlier didn't you I did so that's a little bit better so for each each one different kind of smoothie I mean you could have a blue smoothie for all the different shades of blue there we go and we'll put a little bit of let's go a little bit of orange in the center of that one 
and it helped just blend that orange into the blue. Tiny little bit more blue in there. I'm happy with that. So that's Beautiful. my blue. So that's all those done. And then you can start faffing about with them with the bleach if you wanted to. Again, we'll get the bleach out. I'll just show you quickly on one of them because I've got one already made. You can bleach out the centre. You can bleach out all the little shapes around the edge of the centre. It's my favourite thing you've taught us to do with the bleach. I think it's so oh, it's, clever. It's fascinating. Look at it. I mean, it, it works so well with the Doesn't colour cloud it? as well. This goes really, really um, white. Yeah. It bleaches out colour cloud beautifully. Let's do a few of those, perhaps. Just don't have too much on your brush. You could put the bleach in a water brush into the reservoir and into the, the um, little, you know, the handle of the water brush. Mm. But just make sure you um, you mark on there that it's, that it is bleach and not water. So carry on doing things like that. And the other thing I wanted to show you, which I've already started doing one, this one, I've actually decided to put some little dots in it just to change it and give it another look. So by dipping your brush into the bleach and just doing the odd dot, you get that lovely effect. Yeah. Little spotty, spotty flower. <laughs> Love it. Little spotty flower. Yep. Um, always make sure you put the leaf, the lid back on there. Mm -hmm. I have stamped the leaves from one of the, one of the sets and I've bleached out the middle. I've done Lovely. a selection of different leaves as well. So I've got all my, all my flowers done. I've got my background done. Mm -hmm. And so what I'm going to do now is actually put it together. So I've got my layers done. There's, there's the background, which I did earlier. Beautiful. And I've stamped um, a little cross stitch all the way around the edge. In fact, it should be. That's from one of your little border stamps, it isn't it? It is that way. Yeah, the little border set of stamps, which is... Is that the doodle different. stitches, isn't it? It is doodle stitches. The doodle stitches, stitches yes. Yes. Just a check. So um, I've got a little bit extra of bleaching in the middle and here. I had time to sort of think about what I was going to do. And I've done the main flower with... Um, I did that one without anything in the middle. And I've okay. stamped the greeting on there. So I've finished the bleaching and I've actually stamped leaves and put stuck them on there. So I've got foam pads on there. So it goes goes yeah. in on one on one piece brilliant well while you peel those off didn't we have a message come in that i didn't get a chance to read i do apologize do apologize oh, is it susan uh susan says these stamps are perfect for any newbies to stamp and color because they're so large that's a really good point yeah. actually susan that, that is a good point i mean i've done all these with the ink tense pen um, inks and i've done them with the color cloud but they eat blend equally well with mm. the um, watercolour crayons, Absolutely. Um, alcohol markers, yeah. anything you fancy. Anything you fancy. So we're going to put Susan. him just over here, I think. Stick him there. And there's another card created. Completely different look. Same stamps, but just using the heads. Absolutely. Nice simple. But they look so fabulous and they feel so much and there's so much yeah. fun and there's so much you can do with them. Yes, yeah. But you see how they how it has changed in colour. They've gone completely mm. smooth. I mean, the pink, this is the pink I did earlier, but it does fade slightly. So it's a little bit paler. I'll tell you what we'll do for you as well. We will get the watercolour card on and we want to, we've had a lot of people asking about the stencils again. And then we will recap all the options of the stamps for you, whether you want to go the I Want It All on the 69.99, where they're only £5.83 each, or we'll, we'll put the, the graphic on, which gives you the uh, pick and mix. Okay, buy three for £18.92. Now, this is a great, as uh, Jane was saying, really good quality watercolour card. It's 200, listen to this, a 90 GSM. It's card. I mean, it's neat. It's 10 shy, point, point 0.1 shy of 300. It's 290 GSM watercolour card, phenomenal quality. You're getting a pack of 10 for £4.50. Jane's raved about it. It's really good quality, didn't I've, you, lovely? I've used that for years. Yes. It's just perfect. It's your go-to. It is my go-to. Yeah. Did you have? Did you mention the, what you did the background on earlier? Was the coconut white card? Well, yeah. Right, we've the just found some of that for oh. you. Okay, so if we just pop that on the screen for you, you, 
Are you already done it? Was it a pack of 10 or 20? Did I see 5.99? So, God blimey. A pack of 20 sheets of the coconut white for £5.99. It takes a colour cloud really well. Great. Well, we saw that, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. So we'll just pop that on the screen. It's, um, uh, yeah, I mean, it's coconut white card. Uh, it's 230 GSM. Uh, I think we, well, thank you for the image, but I'm hoping we know what it, like, what it looks like. But it's, uh, it's coconut white, it's A4 and it's 230 GSM, pack of 20. Um, I'm just going to show you these lovely stencils as well because you're getting four mini stencils that Jane bought us in because they go so brilliant with, brilliantly with her petal doodles. Uh, you're getting the lovely little heart that she demoed with earlier, which is uh, You Have My Heart. If I pop that down and then that down, you've got, oh, what a mesh. Oh, what a mesh. It's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, it's a sunshine girl. What a mesh. And then if I just pop that one down, you've got the lovely diamonds. Oh, hang on a minute. Polka dots there. It's trying to throw me. Let's get that right. There you go. Polka dots. Yeah, we do like polka dots, don't we? And then the lovely diamonds, which is what Jane demoed with earlier. So I'll tell you what we'll do. Shall we recap the stamps for you one more time? Just to make sure you know the names. And then we've got, we've got another demo, haven't we? I've got another demo ready. Fabulous. Yep. Fabulous. So, I'm going to show you one more time, just because we've got people saying which one's which. Okay. This is your take care. So, take care of yourself is this beautiful one here with your lovely... Um, I know the butterfly's gorgeous, isn't it? There you go. There you go. Okay, so there you go. Then we've got the one with the lovely bee. We've got the bee happy. Okay. I've got a couple of samples of, of this one. So you've got that beautiful bee happy. You've got all those. Oops. Oh, come here, you little naughty bee. And then you've got that one as well, just to give you another example of how beautiful it looks. So that's your bee happy. Then we've got this one here, which is your... Oh, no, this is the one that says, you make the world a prettier place. I think that's oh, one of my favourites. I just love that sentiment. I really do. I think that sentiment's absolutely beautiful. Okay. Then we've got, you know, those lovely um, stitches we were talking about. And you can see this in all the borders, look. So there's all different borders. That just gives you an example of that lovely little dash line there. Yeah, and if I just show you, if I grab the one down, you see the little zigzag there, look. Got the little zigzag in the border as well. And you've got that sort of sort of dot dash line on the outside as well. Is that another one lovely? No, it's just the one I took pinch from the paper. Oh, bless you. It's all right. Oh, if you're, showing, you. the, if you're showing the stamps again, I'll thank you, add that to it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Then we got one of our favourites, the lovely buggy buggies. The buggy buggies. This is your bug doodles. This is one of Jane's favourites, isn't it, Jane? Yes. And look how fabulous. Just going to give you another example. Look how gorgeous they look. There you go. Then the next one is It's a Gift. Okay, so It's a Gift. So you can see. And that's the one that's got the little froggy on it. <laughs> got that girl. I would make sure you grib it quick. <laughs> Sorry, Jane. Sorry, Jane. That was bad. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> this one, never, never, ever give up. It's a really lovely sentiment, that. Never, never, ever give up. We've got to make sure we never give up, do we? So there you okay. go. That's that one. Then we've got do all, the thi do all things with love here, here. So there you go. Do all things with love. Oh, sorry. Just trying to get in there. There you go. Okay, then we've got uh, love life. So this is create a life you uh, love. Very important, isn't it? Yes. So there you go. That's the, and again, if you missed out on this earlier, the lovely Jane did a fabulous demo on this one in the five o'clock hour. So if you go back to hobbymaker.co.uk, click on uh, TV guide right next to the search engine, click on today, click on five o'clock, you can watch it back. Okay, so we're on a uh, happy soul. This is do more of what makes your soul happy, which I have got here. Thank you, Jane. You are just in time. There you go. 
Absolutely gorgeous. And then we've got this one, which is fabulous. This is the all bunched up, which is this one here. All bunched up. And then the final one here, which is your happy thoughts, uh, which I've got here. Look, your lovely happy thoughts. And then a couple more samples just to finish off, just to make sure that I've got these designs here for you. There you go, look. Really, really lovely. So DS2864 on those. Now, just remember, you can buy the whole show, which is here at 69.99, taking every one of those brand new stamps of Jane's, all hand-drawn, down to £5.83 a stamp at 69.99. Or, if you think, I oh, fancy two or three of those, grab yourselves three, pop that code in your basket, okay? And that will give, you can pick any three that you fancy, uh, and then it'll reduce the price down automatically to £18.92. Now, just before we hand back to Jane for another awesome demo of her very own designs, I'm just going to hand over to the beautiful Emily, who's going to tell you what she's got coming up after us at 8pm on Gem Collector. Thank you very much. I'm so excited about the show tonight at Gem Collector. It's coming up in 12 minutes from now on this very channel. And tonight is a massive special. I've got two hours of gemstones from across the Himalayas, including some of the finest pieces of Museum Petrochi Kunzite. I've actually brought one of them here into the studio for you to see, just as a little bit of a glimpse wow. of what is coming up. Isn't this absolutely exquisite? Ooh. We are talking about some of the finest gemstones ever brought out of our planet Earth, and they are all coming up for auction on Gem Collector here tonight. So we've got the first hour, eight o'clock, which is where you'll find these Museum Petrochi Kunzites, uh, alongside some phenomenal pieces of Afghanite as well, which are colour-changing gemstones. Uh, then in the nine o'clock hour, we have more Himalayan material, which is the Nilamanis and the Peridots. And then at 10 o'clock, we have some exclusive diamonds, pearls, and the deal of the day. So it's a very special three hours coming up on Gem Collector. Thank you. Thank you, Emily. So that happens straight after our channel. You don't need to channel hop. You just hang fire and the beautiful Emily will be there. Right then, my lovelies, I think we've managed to bring you everything. So... Are we okay to do another I lovely have, demo? Yeah, another demo coming Thank up. Thank you, Jane. Um, I'm going to just do a little recap with the with the um, intense pigment stains. Okay. And do a bit of things in there. Lovely. Um, so I'm going to again spritz the back and spritz the front so that it's nice and damp, ready to take the the inks, which I have watered down before I actually use them on the card. Mm -hmm. It's really important to do that. So I've got them in my palette, so I'm adding a little bit of colour on the background. And I try to keep my background nice and pale so that the flowers, when I colour them in, really pop out of the background. I'll add a little bit of green. And I'm quite happy using a great big brush, keeping it nice and pale. Just dot the colours in different areas and then you can blend them together. Let's add a little bit of orange as well. Nice and relaxing thing to do. Mm. Watercolour makes this very, very simple to do. So always, I'm always washing my brush, just taking off the excess water. Go back, blend it, blend it over. And don't worry if you've gone on the inside because you're going to colour those in with another colour on top, which is probably going to be a little bit stronger than what you've actually put on the background. And then we're going to colour the flowers in, and I think I'll go with a little bit of the blue. I love that blue. It's very, very strong blue, oh. so make sure you get lots of water with it. Mm -hmm. And we'll do the petals. You can use a smaller brush if you want to. I'm quite happy that it bleeds into the background but it should be quite nice and quick to do. You'll know which brush you're, brush you're sort of comfortable with, won't yeah. you? Yes. Mm. I have got a smaller brush here, um, but I just wanted to show you that it doesn't matter if it goes around the, out the side of the edges because I'm working with the background is quite wet, mm. so it doesn't really matter, so I can blend that into the background if I need to. Mm -hmm. So we'll just give my brush a rinse, just take off the excess water, and that little bit of colour that's come through just blend Take that off, into yeah. the background and it Brilliant. just just spreads itself around and um, adds to the interest of the of the um, finished sample. So let's put a little bit of blue in the centre of that one. 
So this is going to stick to mainly sort of blues and oranges. They look really nice together. Mm. Put a bit of blue in there and then we'll pick up our orange. Oh, I really like this tangerine. So I'm keeping it a little bit stronger than I did on the background so that, just, as I said, it pops out and is more noticeable. So get that down there. Still stands out so brightly against the background, doesn't it? Yeah. So yeah, keep your really backgrounds are nice and pale. Yep. Oh my goodness. Wow. I could watch you all day, Jane. It's lovely. Like you say, it's really relaxing, isn't it? It is relaxing. Yeah. So basically that's what I've done. And of course you can put the green on the leaves. I'll just put a little bit of green on there. And I'll show you the, the dry one I've actually done. Oh yeah. So there's my leaves there. Give it a chance to dry, then you can add all sorts of other things to it. Let's just wipe that ink away. Here's a question I was just thinking, you know, because you're doing it brilliantly, but when you first design your stamp, do you have the, do you, are you, do you know that you're going to have to go on telly and demonstrate them? No. No. <laughs> Just watching you then thinking. Well, as a card maker, I know what I want on, on a card and how right. on what I'm going to do. And I look to see what um, products Creative Expressions mm. have. And I mm. say, well, OK, I can use that ink to do this or I can use whatever, mm. that texture paste to do this. Mm. But at what so, point did they say, you're going to have to go on telly and do it? Oh, I, I've done television quite a yeah. bit have over you? the years. Yeah. Yes. But you like it? I, yeah, I love Hobby Maker. Do you? Yeah, I do. It's my oh, favourite. Oh, that's lovely that's to hear. Oh, favorite. bless you. Oh, thank you, Jane. Right, this is already dry, and you can see that a lot of the colour has bled into the background. I'm happy with that. Mm. I mean, when I did, when I went to art college, I was taught to, to draw precise flowers oh, in wait, detail, right. realistic. Mm. So this is actually a breath of fresh air oh, for absolutely. me to do it like this. So I'm going to stamp the centre and I can colour that in or do what I like with it. Yep. Let's stamp the greeting as well. Yeah, let's do that. And that can be at a jaunty angle so you can see that it fits in really nicely. Perfect. And I've got one of the um, border stamps here. I've got the cross stitch. I think they're going to be so handy, those stitch doodles. And that's doodles. going to just go, not going to go right across. I'm going to just do bits of it, just a bit there. Yep. And I'm going to little do a little bit down here, because I can, <laughs> and a little bit down there. Oh, and what we'll do, we'll have a little bit here as well. Why not? Absolutely. And when you take these stamps off the um, packet, mm. it's a good idea to put them down on a non-tacky surface, like a piece of paper. Right. Get it straight, because they're very long and flexible, mm. and then put your block on top of it to oh, pick it up so it's face down on your piece of paper because mm. if you try and stick it down um, by hand mm. it will it won't well, necessarily be straight. dead straight Brilliant. so on top of that you can do your doodling um, you can put stuff on the background but I've also stamped a couple of the bugs too um, these are from the bug set Brilliant. and I did two different colors depend on what color I was going to paint my card in I've got a little orange one here uh, he's coloured in with the inks and I've bleached out areas I didn't want. So he's going to stick onto my flower like so. Thank you, Jane. Uh, thank you. Hasn't she been amazing? Absolutely lovely. So don't forget to check those baskets out because, again, it doesn't come to you unless you uh, physically do. Katie's just messaged in and said, we love Hobby Maker too. Oh, that's really kind, Katie. Thank that's you. Nice. That's really lovely. Yes. Uh, right, now, just uh, can I tell you what we've got coming up on tomorrow's show here on Hobby Maker? If you have a little look, we're carrying on with the 15th birthday. The lovely Anne-Marie is back from Honky Dory and it's all about Christmas craft card. Oh, that sounds interesting. Uh, you can shape up your card making with the Gemini Shape Shaker card stamps and dies with Corinne uh, and Crafter's Companion at two o'clock. At three o'clock, we're going to continue with the birthday celebrations to celebrate 15 years of Hunky Dory with some amazing Miri deals. Uh, Crafters Companion about with Corin with a Gemini fold back shape gatefold dies at four. More of the 15th birthday and those much loved little books at five. Uh, it's sparkle pens from Crafters at six and Hunky Dory's 15th birthday at seven. For myself and Jane and the team, take care. Bye bye. <laughs>